goddamn stuff. Like I said, how for can we find? Well, <laughs> well in, that, in that case, I that now, now oh, I am live. Oh, oh, yeah. <laughs> After, uh, holy crap, Stone. My little setup here, so I can watch everybody. I'm very careful with my pronunciation. Jesus. Jesus. I, I think the main thing I'm gonna look for tonight's magnesium, so I can make a crap ton of ammo. I've got everything else I need. Magnesium? Except... I figured you need a lot of other stuff. Oh no, I. Everything else I've basically got. I figured, figured you needed your head exam too. Oh, uh, only on the weekends. <laughs> Although I I have been playing around with my uh, my fighter, and oh, I. Have? I do want to take that out at some point. Hmm. Well. Oh, wait, I found a deconstructor filing. I don't know what to think of it. And how are you guys doing? I'm your host, Kai. And also, if Ruggles is live, that is Ruggles. I, too, I am. You know, I, 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 I am. I to introduce myself, but, you know, we were kind of derailed by stone. Cause... Stone is good at delay, derailing everything. That's why we like him. Some days, right? Or is it most days? I don't remember. I've been derailed for 49 years. What are you expecting? <laughs> yeah. Well. Let's see. I don't know what to expect. That's why we got some to outer space. Got it. <laughs> that door wouldn't let me out. He's fighting uh, the door boss now. What is it with stone and doors and me and elevators? I, I think you two have some serious soul searching to do uh, with your elevator and door. Well, I just Probably. Started, I started the rolling thing again while I was trying to go through the door. They see me rolling, they hating. Something like, like that. <laughs> Always. Should I be locking the doors when you roll by? Maybe. Alright, now I can watch the Ruggle struggle live. There we go. Is, is, oh. it, is it a good struggle, though? I don't know yet. Mm. I got the Ruggle struggle. And the Kai Kick. The Kai Kick? Yeah. I ain't no Kai Kick. You're the Brad Kick. Okay. Where the hell is I gonna go? Um, oh, it's this way. Hmm. Okay. That's a I went to warp somewhere the other day, and I was next to Liberty, and I hit it, and my and I hit warp, and it just warped through Liberty. Uh, you know, well. Well, that's not the first time Liberty's been around a warp. That's for sure. We're out of Kai every day. Yeah, <laughs> it becomes a habit. There's nothing really you can do about it. Once, once you, uh, oh, once you do that, here. you're kind of stuck oh, with just it. Orbital production, okay. Yeah, why don't you go geek? <laughs> Use a freak. Hey, 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 who are you calling Freak? Oh, you know. Right, really? you're... Nothing in this asteroid field? Are you gonna get your Freak on tonight, huh? Gonna try. I, I don't oh, know how much luck we're gonna have. You. What? Huh. What do you mean, huh? That looks like another asteroid field way over there. That's interesting. What is? All right. The miner that I'm working on mm -hmm. isn't even on my list now. Why'd you break it? No, for my uh, it was in my factory, but now it's not even on my list. All right. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. See what happens when I turn, turn your shields on and the lights. When the lights go down low. 
What kind of plasma cell does this thing take? At one time. All the time. Oh, type A. Easy peasy. It's lemon lemon squeezy. Lemon squeezy. Is it though? Squeeze the lemon. Squeezing the ooze. Oh god. Get out of here, Polly. <laughs> Put the lime in the coconut and drink it all up. How about not? Yep. Oh, 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 yeah. There we go. There we go. We got that stuff. That's almost as out of line as fruity with beer. Well, a lot of things that are. Oh out my of god! Just what? That's fucking cool. And Ruggles is already struggling again already today. Didn't take very long. Yeah, if I'm going to be drinking, don't fruit the beer. <laughs> Wait, you, you heard of this song? You have heard of the song? Mm -hmm. They've only had that, they had that on like the what was it, the 90s commercial with that guy that was doing, uh, like a clone of himself and he was doing, like, Dawn dishwashing soap or something? And they had that song? Mm hmm. Surely some of you guys actually remember that. Dawn dish soap? Yeah, the commercials we... they used to do. Oh, I was about to say, we all know about Dawn dish soap. Yeah, there's a lot of old commercials for it. Made me not want to cut in front of my mama. <laughs> yep. Orbital production. I wonder how hard that is to take out. Yeah, eh, easy. Go for it. Yeah. Not really. <laughs> I said it's so easy. He's like, I don't trust him. That's probably a good idea. Okay, you let's jump over him? this. You're smarter than you look. <laughs> hey, I mean, I mean, I was just trying to encourage him to do battle. You were caught, you got I was doing battle out. earlier. Yeah, I'm just encouraging him to do more battles. Nice. Uh, turrets off, thrusters I mean, off, shields battle, off, but, power you know. off. If that isn't gonna be a battle. A resupply station. Yeah, it'll be oh, a God, slaughter. Which ship is this in here? Go find a Torvera and go play with it. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I found something, I just don't know what it is or where it's at. Oh, well, I bet it's not a Torbera. Or if it is, he's in a lot of trouble. He just doesn't know it yet. Yeah. He's about to feel a ruggle struggle moment. It's alright, Bradley. Uh, I'll come to, I'll come to your rescue. Won't live long enough. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> He'll feel a partial struggle. If it's a Torvera, he won't live long enough to feel the run. I don't even struggle. know what it is. But... Oh, speaking of which, did we check the Pentaxid stuff today? No. No. Okay. That's probably good to go to today. Well, I suppose I can help you with that real quick. Yeah, I've just been station, starting a little bit on station. the old Prime today. I suppose you can do something useful today. Ooh, Ooh, I'm the one that's been going around collecting all this shit. Yeah, well, I've been rebuilding this shit. What shit. <laughs> well, I feel, I, I feel I, like there's going to be just, a lot of turmoil here. Also. I I built the Spartan, so. Well, I'm working on Liberty. And I've been making ammo for the got, Spirit I, of Fire. Yeah. You know, I got to bring Liberty soon. Yeah. Technically, Jay Wendell built the Spartan. All right. <laughs> yeah, I technically uh, I I built this one by my bare hands. <laughs> bare hands. And and you know what? I'll say, I appreciate creative mode way better. I mean, I'm doing this on stream for those to see how in depth the ship building is. But holy crap! Bare hands? How can you turn your own hands? As my other hands were busy, so I had to get Grizzly Adams to help. Um, you have teleporters at all the other Pentaxid ones, don't you? Yeah. Okay. Is there a way to come back? Yeah. So teleport to my ship or so teleport somewhere else. As long as it's got guaranteed power. 
<laughs> well, just take your little fuel with you, just in case. I have fuel. <laughs> well, and there shouldn't be. I put solar power on it, so. Although, although she yeah, has solar on it. Yeah, but depends on the dark yeah. side of the moon or not. Yeah, I put solar on all that shit. So you're good. Supply station. They don't even stay 24 hours on the dark side of the moon. No. Who the hell is it? And I put a lot of capacitors in there, so we wouldn't worry about run out of fuel. Man. Oh, man, I don't know which direction it is. I don't oh, know. Man. Who am I? Pentaxid Farm 2 is a triangle. Um, Pentaxid Farm 1 is right outside the base and then south. And so then there's one at like, each one of those? Yeah, there's a whole slew of them. Technically, basically, with the amount of taxes you get, you'd probably get about 20,000 before it's refined. Jeez. Jesus. Yeah. We uh, should not be worried about Pentaxid for a while anytime soon. We would be worried about it if we had We need to put some more miners down. Though. We need some on magnesium. Yeah, I pulled the ones I had on magnesium, but I'm surprised you're low on magnesium. I've been mining the hell out of that. Uh, I haven't been using the resources in the Liberty. Oh, well, if you're still in Haven. Yeah, I am. Check uh, Rodimus, see how many stacks of magnesium I still have in the harvester or in the raw. If I have more than, like, three stacks, take a stack. Okay. I've been using the motorcycle here. I didn't see a ship. Uh, one of them does have a white dart. I don't remember where it's at, though, now. Because we've used it and moved it around. Well, yeah. It's not too hidden if I can find it, buddy. Oh, he threw down on you. Dang on pirates think they're hidden. He's, oh. talking about, he's talking about pirates. Oh, okay. I was like, like damn. He threw down at you. I was like, "Whoa!" <laughs> I no, I only hide wieners on rebel ship. That's it. <laughs> wow. Well, we all know Brad can't drive. Can't fly for shit either. That's Whoa. true. If you're into if you're into hiding wieners, I think Target's got something for that. <laughs> oh God! Too early. I just go. Too early. Too early. <laughs> We are the highlight of your week. Uh, I, I don't know about that anymore. You got, you got, you have to admit it. I'm scared. I need an adult. <laughs> do you need a safe space? I do. I'm afraid. <laughs> What's your safe word? Uh, help. <laughs> <laughs> his his safe word's pentaxid. <laughs> Say for his own mother of God. Elf. <laughs> what have I done? Yeah. Please forgive me for these atrocities. Yes. The mother of God. Uh, Heaven stakes. <laughs> so I so I gave my wife my credit card and I says, Well, you know, when you get done running your stuff today, you know, if you want, you can pick up some food, right? So she comes home and she's like, uh, she gave me this big old thing, uh, honey barbecue wings. I'm like, oh, fuck yeah. She's like, well, I, I got to make everybody happy today, right? Just buy everybody some lunch uh, with, with your card. I'm like, yeah, with my money. <laughs> <laughs> she's like, yep, yep. 
And then my, my middle child was like, I want some. I'm like, you got McDonald's. You chose your food. Yeah, <laughs> you have chose poorly. You've chosen poorly. I want like McDonald's. Yeah. Okay. Well, you got McDonald's. I'm going to Applebee's. But, but McDonald's sucks. I, you know, I don't... How did that anybody. translate to Chinese, too? <laughs> my my oldest had the phone okay. and, and he was like mom got Chinese food and I'm like are you sure and uh, he says yeah yeah and he's got her on, on speakerphone and she's like I didn't get Chinese food I got Applebee's oh and I looked at my son and I says yeah Chinese food and Applebee's are two totally different foods yeah those are substantial that's food is edible. Applebee's isn't. Yeah. <laughs> well, it just depends. The old Applebee's, their steaks were not bad. Yep, the new Applebee's is not edible. Yeah, the new Applebee's isn't as good food. Well, I will say I think ever since COVID hit, a lot of these restaurants have really skimped on their food. Applebee's has been pre-made for 10 years. Uh, I don't know. I went to Outback the other night, and it was really good. Outback, though, I think they have to have somewhat fresh food. Yeah. Well, yeah, steak. Applebee's has got pre-packaged everything. Yeah, because you're dealing with mostly steaks at Outback. Yeah. Kind of like Longhorn is now, like, the number one dominant steakhouse you see for a franchise. Even though I don't really care much for Longhorn. I went there one time years ago, and it was like a $60 bill for two, and I'm like... Like, holy shit. Hey, it's... You know what my, you know what my favorite is? What's that? Roadhouse. 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 Logan's... Or not <laughs> Logan's but it's like the Roadhouse. Family Guy episode. Roadhouse. Mm -hmm. Right up, right out, people. Roadhouse. <laughs> Roadhouse. Uh, buddy of mine at my old job, we used to... Uh, we had his joke, so anytime stupid shit was going on and we wanted to uh, punch somebody we would just yell over we'd just say over the radio roadhouse <laughs> and everyone was looking at us like what like they don't obviously get the reference Rip his throat out. it's like a family guy you know roadhouse and then the actual movie roadhouse and they may be like, you know like, where Patrick oh. Swayze worked at the double douche yeah, and beat the shit out of, you know, those guys. And then ripped the heart out of that one dude. Throat. Was it throat? I thought it was yeah. heart. Okay. No, that's Indiana Jones and the Temple of Doom. Yeah, well. <laughs> but they are kind of alike. I get I get where you're going. There I am. I'm not getting that last one. What drone base? I don't know. what is that Pentaxa 2 or? Yeah, it is. Oh. There's I've already got like 8,000 from the two. Well, you should get more. I'm going to teleport back to the, uh, I'm going to teleport to the Radimus for the moment. See what you got for magnesium. Magnesium. I need to make more rockets and explosives. Ruggles is singing tonight. This is going to turn hey. into some stupid-ass musical idea. <laughs> hey, tomorrow, I'm taking the, uh, I'm, I'm taking the spirit of fire out. So I, oh. I, I got to make sure the ammunition is. Oh, so what you're saying is. is we're going to need, we're going to need about 10 million fuel so he can get to the jump. Yeah, and then he's going to run out of the fuel somewhere and be like, oh my God, I'm in trouble. I don't have enough fuel. And then I'm going to be rolling laughing. Oh no, I got I got fuel covered. That I, I was able to do that the last two streams. Hmm. For oh, now. Mr. Hammond getting to have a gas. Yeah. Oh, you can sell those insulation boosters. Yeah, I know. I had a shit ton of those. I just I sold a bunch. And thank you for the likes. Gentlemen. Okay. Obviously, somebody has been here. Somebody Somebody's once been told here. me. And it feels like somebody's been here today. 
The Rados didn't have any power. I had to turn it on. Oh no! Must have ran out of fuel. No, the power the off. power was off. That's weird. What's even weirder is when I logged off last night. I turned the power off on the. Uh, actually, no, I I had the power of the Osiris on, and then it was off when I logged in. I don't understand what's going on with some of that. It's weird. And then I was working on uh, the ship, mm -hmm. and I had the shields off, and then all of a sudden I couldn't do anything because the shields were on. I'm like, what the fuck? You gotta watch it. The X button turns your shields on. I off, didn't so. press the X button. It just fucking happened. Alaris, how you doing? Alaris says, I hit the like button so I could see Stone take the entire Mata on by himself with nothing but a sniper rifle wall in space. There you go, Stone. Make it happen. Make it happen. Stone can moonwalk. And hope, hope your uh, Friday is going well, Alaris. Very slowly getting the ship modified. Just taking longer than I thought. But I do know once this ship's done, it's gonna be absurd, so. It's gonna be fantastic. I wonder what would happen if you flew into one of these giant gas planets. Uh, find out. Get back to us on it. Uh, why don't <laughs> so you let me make a little dart real quick? F, F around oh, oh. and find out. <laughs> you never oh, know. I oh, might see. See, <laughs> see, he's like, oh, I'm gonna make another ship. He's not gonna be ballsy to take his ship. I like, may be crazy, but I ain't stupid. <laughs> I ain't stupid. I ain't stupid. I ain't taking no crap from you. What is that? That's alright, I'm going to the Osiris right now. I took one stack of 8,000 from the Liberty and one stack of 8,000 from the Rodimus. How much is left? Oh, you have like three stacks in the Rodimus and three stacks in the Liberty. Okay. Of eight, uh, the, out of the three stacks in the Rodimus, one of them isn't a full stack, but the, one, the three in the Liberty are full stacks. Okay. And oh no. Oh what? no 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 no! Oh no 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 no! I know what that is, Alaris. Oh no! So, Alaris said, "I mean, I got some good laughs. Had a friend come back to FF14 to refresh his house and play, and he oh, walked shit. into something that? very unpleasant in his house, and I already have a feeling what that is." That's why I went, oh, no, 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 no. It's a oh, Polaris shit. Archon Sunseeker. Um, so there is a legacy in uh, some role-playing games, unfortunately, where people get a little uh, frisky. Yeah. So, yeah, there's that. So... I'm gonna have to reduce the ship size down more. The thrusters are just. Uh, yeah. What a controversy. Yeah. Yeah, man. I would not be happy if I was somebody and that was going on in my house. I had been gone so long. They must have been doing some freaky stuff in that house. Mm. <laughs> yeah. I'll have to, one of these days I'll have to tell you the, about legacies of MMOs. 
and some of the weird stuff you do stumble on in those games. Oh, I'm sure there's a lot of weird shit. Yeah. And, and that's probably just the understatement. Oh, it, that's, that's like... That's the understatement of understatements. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, there's no, uh, there's no way around that. Oh my god. Okay. It was nine people? <laughs> I hope he brought a lot of Lysol. Holy wow. shit. Yeah. <laughs> Good lord. Uh, poor guy. I don't remember what I need this for, but I'm gonna get it. That's rough. Yeah, you will, Brad, when you're not expecting it. <laughs> Post says I'd want to demolish after that. Yeah, except it's too hard to find housing in FF14, so. Yeah. Flamethrower. Flamethrower, yeah. <laughs> oh, something. Burn the house down. Okay. Burning down the house. That's exactly what I was suddenly thinking. I'm like. Look at all these systems we've been to. Holy shit. Check this one out. Because we're all trying to beat each other to certain stuff. <laughs> we are? I I'm didn't just kidding. I didn't realize we were racing. I didn't realize that either. I didn't get that memo. Ruggles, did you get that memo? I did not. Huh. Is that why you put the wrong cover on your GPS reports? <laughs> I think that's why he did. It's possible. Bradley's up to no good. Not me. Not you. I'm just mining my. I'm minding my own business. Oh, <laughs> He's yeah. mining his own business. Yeah. I came out. I got to look, and I just. I put another laser miner on here, and I got to look, and we hadn't even where that UACH thing is. We've not even explored around there. Yeah. I'm Actually, we did. Right we did explore there once or twice. I'm finding Either. stuff that nobody's found. Surprisingly. Or, or you weren't there when it was discovered, possibly. Well, once you discover it, it's usually here. I don't know. Well, and there is, after a while, they do regen it. They weren't fully destroyed, so. Right. It's a possibility. Yeah, I, I know it's going to happen. If you have a public house in Final Fantasy XIV, yes, you're going to stumble on that stuff, no matter how hard you try to avoid it. it just... Our peers suck. Hey, I did. I actually enjoyed roleplay a long time, but I did, like, Dungeon Dragon style roleplay adventures and shit yeah. where you fight stuff, and I you had fun doing it. You weren't committing acts of soft core porn. Bingo. In a video game. <laughs> yeah. Like. Yeah. Lucinda the Troll? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I... I've experienced some of that random encounter stuff in my years. So, when I was young... Years! Yeah, I... When we started having the internet, I did actually roleplay a lot online back when I was younger. Um, I started with AOL and Prodigy. So oh, I was no. like, I was like 12, I think, at the time. And I always liked doing DM type stuff, and it, which for those that are curious, it's dungeon mastering. You're doing, you're basically telling a story. Yeah. Essentially trying to, the best way to describe it is you're creating your own adventure with bad guys and all that stuff. Yeah. But there are those. There are those that, that wish to destroy you. There are those that take it in a That's whole a life here. new Begin out there. level. It's a whole new world. I don't think it's a whole new world, Ruggles. 
think According to <laughs> Disney, it is. Well, that's because, uh... That's because they're wanting to do a new Bambi. <laughs> I, I like the Rocks version of Bambi better. From Saturday Night Live. Well, I was just thinking if, if we want to do, uh... Bambi, they could just play Deer Hunter Simulator. Yeah, Mr. Echo. It's not me echoing. I know. Drone Dismantler? Wow, these drones are really popping off. Yeah, Mr. Echo. -er. <laughs> well, I can tell you where the Echo's coming from. Yeah, stone. <laughs> Everybody knows it's stone. Yeah, hey, 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 we're feeling stone. <laughs> uh, is that all graphite down there? Oh, Maybe. that ship is moving. Is that his, it's a Xerax, I believe. A fax machine, huh? It's a fa yeah, Z that'd be Xerox. Yeah, that's but, but yes. Machine. Wow, it's not even being detected. Let me set a jump point, just in case. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, we'll do this Run, asteroid field. Girl we are. Na, 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 na. Oh, na, na, na. cool, it's the same direction oh, as this hey, fucking hey, thing. Hey, hey. Hey, hey. Hey, hey. <laughs> oh, it's an Al Sunet class thing. Corvette. Run into something that took out his shields in like two seconds earlier. Yeah. yeah, that was part of the drones. That might have been a progenitor thing. Yeah, that's what I think. It was definitely not Xerax, and it and it wasn't. Uh, no, even Xerax doesn't have weapons that cool. No, it, no. it definitely wasn't Xerax. That's why. Unless it's, unless it's a Tevera, they don't have weapons that cool. That's why I'm not fucking with that dismantler until I'm done with what I'm doing in this system. Because it was going to dismantle you. Yeah, something was getting dismantled. More than likely Ruggles. Oh, almost certainly Ruggles with what he's flying. Oh, well, he yeah. called in help. I got him, I got him. If you're, not in the, if you're not in the spirit of fire and back up, you don't want to tangle with certain ships in this game. No. <laughs> yeah. I mean, you can solo them in it, with the right builds, but... Uh... Yeah, but you need to. There's some of them that hit hard enough. You need to swap out even with big shields. Yeah. Like those dismantlers. <laughs> Couple of rounds of fire, even the biggest. There has to be a, some kind of station there. So what we're trying to do on my side is we're trying to loosen the weight. Liberty. We're still going to keep the carrier at the top. We're still going to secure everything. We use the lowest weighted wall here, which is called carbon composite, which means, yeah, it can get destroyed very easy, but this is going to be wrapped around multiple layers of wall that can handle a blast. And this is more like the heart of the ship, so if they get this far, you're already screwed no matter what. Yeah. There is no coming back from that one. No, I would put steel or something on the inside of the flight bay. Just yeah, but you are buy time to get the ships out of there. Damn. Oh, there it's all combat steel inside there. Oh. It's all combat steel and Xeno steel. So okay. it, yeah, that that's all sealed up. As I said, that extra layer of steel on that, you know, on the inside of it. Yeah. Get yeah, extra, little extra we're, time to get the ships out. Yeah, we're talking. This is deep internal. This ain't. Uh, this ain't yeah. the hangar side. This is like yeah. stuff that I know that there's no way in hell it's gonna reach because there's too much to take out to even oh, get to that point. I'm just making a recommend recommendation for the flight bay. Yeah, flight bay is gonna stay fine. It's you've, still... seen, you've seen what those what those uh, crude missiles can do. Yes. <laughs> yeah. yeah. That goes through the flight bay. That goes through your bay with just one with just one or two layers of wall. 
And some shit's gonna be destroyed in the Yeah, and that's why and that's why we're doing what we're doing. There's yeah. there's a lot of layers of wall back here. There's combat yeah. steel, xeno steel, and there's also gonna be some outside things to block a direct hit. Yeah. But, oh yeah, they don't play nice. Yeah, and this is just taking time because what we have here is we're at a 210 kilotons, and we're running hot on our CPU because of all the thrusters we're having to do in the RCS. I want to cut this down some so I have enough momentum on all directions and still stay strong. And of course, we got medium thrusters that need to go. Um, Advanced thrusters that need to go. Drive thrusters is the ones we're keeping. They use the most power. Get so there's, there's some What's things that? that are tweaking on I it. said, get them, Ruggles. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> if I had gas and ammo, I'd bring the, I'd bring the Hornets to play. Yeah. I don't have gas or ammo in it yet. Hey, I hear ya. Well, you saw I... what I want to do with this Horus. Yeah. <laughs> Some of my plans for this. Oh yeah. So uh, Stone, since you're getting the grand tour, um, back here, as soon as you come in the hangar, this is uh, I haven't listed it all yet, but this is the one that's going to take you all the way up and down. But right here, you just cut across. I have it labeled the medical room. It has everything in it that yeah. you need. Here, this is just ammo, an ammo section with lots of oxygen tanks back in yeah. here. And then there's three fuel storage locked in combat steel around here. Oh, I gave myself the grand tour earlier trying to find out of that. Okay, so I wasn't sure if you'd actually saw this. And then back here, I'm not done. There's more. This part probably is going to be more wrapped in a lot here, just normal steel, maybe. Yeah. It just kind of depends. I'm, like I said, I'm going to try to drop the weight down to about 150 to 125 kT if I can. Will maintain the size and power of it, which is going to be the challenge. Because out here, once I redo yeah. this part, it's going to have a lot more combat still up here. Yeah. And, and it's going to be connected to these two hangar bays that you can fly in from. But what the goal is to that is you can park two capital ships up here. Yeah. And I'm thinking of idea of out here on the sides building dragon wings kind of which means your capital ships on here will be protected by the wings of it so if a direct hit happens it's going to take out a wing and not the actual block yeah or, mine would be rather hard to park on here but that's good it's wider than it is yeah yours is yours you have to basically you'd have to come in like this wide ways and come right down here once it's done mm -hmm. to dock you're not going to be able to come this way because I think yours, by the time it's said and done, is probably as wide as Liberty. Yeah, pretty close. Yeah, I mean, it's there's just no way you can really yeah. do it otherwise. Horus is not a small girl. No, you're wide versus long, whereas this is kind of <laughs> she thick. Uh, mixed. And then up here on our second floor, I have not done anything with this room yet. I gotta redo this. I'm probably gonna do this one in carbon here, and then kind of go out that way. But on this side, I have loaded this up with as much as I can. It looks like the cap for materials is 640,000. I tried to see if there's any more, but I couldn't break it. Yeah, 800 no pays. 800 pays were done away with. Okay. God damn it! Come on, doors. Yeah. So getting that done because we're going to have storage and then out here is closer to the bridge and then on the front side you're going to have multiple layers of guns and stuff and then side guns for the barrage but this is probably as far as we're going to go with carbon plating here because that protects everything and then there'll be a third floor actually there'll probably be three or four more floors the next one up will probably which is the old area, but if we go, let's count them right here. If we go one, two, three, four, five, we'll probably.
probably start right here at five and go across this time, which is one down. The only thing we're gonna have to do, which is gonna suck, and I'm gonna wait to do that until close to the end, is underneath this block here is the core. I'm going to have to pull the core and move it down a little bit yeah. in the center here. Which is fine, but I'm waiting to do that till the very end. And then we're gonna go upward from here. So it's gonna be taller and longer with some width, but it, the width's mostly gonna be the wings that protect My it. recommendation for this, just make a little box right here above and below it of combat steel. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna, to but, I wanna, core. but I wanna bring it down one more level. So I want to try to maintain floor balance. And then I'm going to wrap the carbon substrate around carbon one carbon steel layer, just protection, and then go out with just steel or xeno steel. Because we're yeah. still, like I said, the goal is to bring this down to about 150. Maybe if I can get to 130, that's ideal. Because right now, it will not go very fast no, at all. That one over there with the thrusher, with the few thrusters we had on it, did 39. Yeah, this one, if you go up to the bridge, which we can show, uh, demonstrate that real fast. If you go up to the bridge, which all like all this said, all this will be revamped a little bit. But if we go up here, right now, the maximum speeds we got 84 going forward, but we've used probably 10 at least thrusters to even get this. If you go back, it's only yeah. two, so stopping is really hard. And then left is zero, right is five, to ascend is ten, to descend is two. So we still don't have a fair balance of thrusters. So that is the one thing that's kind of hurting. And looking at your device count here, let's go back to that. It's mostly these. RCS, we maybe it'll cut that down once we cut the weight down. And then, probably not because you got so many thrusters. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Probably not. It's going to be a balance. That's why, like I said, I want to cut the weight down to protect everything. Yeah. But, but much like much like generators, I would put them in separate parts of the ship. Yeah, they all are in separate yeah. areas, as I am not taking any chances. Back to that one point when we watched the my ship randomly blow up because the overload. Mm -hmm. That was a less valuable lesson learned to not put stack, your generators next to generators each other. and RCS and all that together. No. Yeah. You want to uh, portion all that shit out through the ship. Yep. And also the other thing is if you get shot, then at least your ship can counter by still having some mobility to get out, even with the limb. But like this here, this is all made of carbon composite just for the hangar part. This here is Xeno steel and combat steel. It's thick. If I were to crack this open, which I'll Damn show boy. you right here, yep. it's multi-layered. Oh, so it's, there's six right here just to get through that. And we're not even including the inside here, which is still lined up. So there's a lot of weight behind this ship, but it's for a reason. And I staggered the material here for hit Excuse points me. versus oh, yeah. blast. And and that's so a lot of this takes ship building without creator menu takes a lot. I will say that guys. It's not just yep plug and go it's a lot that's Which, why i've been working on this thing all day like i have yeah because you have to go get parts whereas the, the only benefit to prefabbing everything in my opinion is then you just gotta go get the materials whereas this one i'm fabbing it all up trying to figure out what works here like a lot of this stuff will go away because i gotta clear this for the rest of the hangar here but I still got more work to before I can uh, cut this part down, which will cut probably at least four or five K down, especially once I'm using carbon. On the outside here, 
it's still the same thing. There's two layers of car uh, combat still here, but the internal walls, you have a minimum, like right here. <laughs> you have four combat steels right here. So, unless they somehow know to just fire right through here, which the door itself has a lot, there's oh, no, yeah. not really a good way that this stuff's going to get penetrated. I mean... This will probably be the last area to get hit. The way it's built. Whereas, for example, Ruggles, uh, ship that he's using now, his hangers are on two sides. So, yeah, if one of those hangar doors goes out, or one of his ships goes out on the side, yeah, the ships that are in there are going to get tanked. Whereas this one's going to be able to withstand a lot more. And even on this side, this here is going to be combat steel, but you have hardened steel here, and then you have combat steel here. So you're still constantly balancing your weight and your armor, because this is meant to be essentially... Uh, did we really lose that much oxygen? Oh, boy! Let me double check. Did we... What did we puncture? Let's oh! See. I lost my miners. My miners. And Lars says, Strange New World Season 2 Episode 1 was really good. You lost your miners? <laughs> my mining lasers, yeah, they blew them off. It's alright. Oh. Oh, Damn. that would be a key party. But yeah, so this is designed to be very versatile ship. Not necessarily just a straight up war machine, but also transport and everything. And if we can get the weight down and get the thruster strength up on top of the guns, then it may be able to do a planetary land. If I feel it can I then I'll revise the thruster system later and treat it as a permanent in the air, just like the Spirit of Fire and yeah. Set, set my other two capital ships on top of it and use those to bring stuff down on the planet because I don't really I don't feel like I'll have an option on it yeah and so that's the end game I'm very proud of what this hangar's done so far and what I've got going but courtesy on uh, the research uh, on carbon steel because this has made a huge difference on the weight of something this massive. Yeah. And then a lot of this stuff is going to get phased out as I revamp everything, and it'll be separated through different corridors of the ship. Because they're yeah. all scattered all over the place right now. I have three fuel stacked here, three fuel stacked here. This is all going to be a combat steel wall right around here. And then I'll pad it with... Uh, Xeno still because they still got to bust the outer wall here, which and here there should be if I'm thinking right. Yeah, see, there's the wing right there, so it's already gonna have a hell of a time just getting through. Yeah. To hit any of this as is because it but has to take out the wing. One thing to remember: if it's not fast, do not be the first shield tank. Right. Because you're going to have to have somebody else intercept it. Once you're going to you... want to do it once the weapons are lowered and you've got a better chance of getting out. Yeah. And more than likely, the lengthwise of the ship, it'll be more designed for broadsides versus, yeah. versus frontal attacks. If I get this thing done all the way the way I want it, I will, be, I will probably be the primary shield tank. Right. Because one, most of my weapons will be forward facing. You saw that list. Yes. Whereas if and I'm two, coming in, one side's going to yeah. be given a yeah. nasty payload to it. And two, I'm going to have a hundred and fourteen k shields on this thing. Yeah. You know that's the way I'm designing it, so I and can even, shield tank and still do damage. And even here, I'm still setting this part up here because there's going to be guns all positioned along these platforms here, and then some there. So it's still going to be able to do a lot of firing right off the bat as yeah. it comes in. I'll probably but, shorten some of this up a little bit, but... 
But even so, no, I am not going to go toe to toe with a Tavera for you. No. I don't want to eat. I don't want to eat fifteen hundred missiles in thirty seconds. <laughs> I'll, leave, I'll leave that for you. Oh, fifteen hundred missiles. Jesus. That's what they can launch in thirty seconds. Jesus that's what Christ. Well, that's why we're going to have EMPs before we even do that. You wondered why the front half of Spirit of Fire was gone? <laughs> yeah, and his is uh, his is all just normal steel, too, over there. Yeah. Yeah, it, is, it literally wiped out the entire nose of his Spirit of Fire. And, if he, and if he was doing it as steel, then yeah, once his shields were gone, then he was a sitting duck. It was almost instant. Once it started hitting, it was... Oh, yeah. yeah. Well, what we'll do is once this is fully done, I'm gonna copy this, do some test yeah. run on it on uh, test, and see what weaknesses needs to be tweaked on this because there is gonna be some things that I need to do to tweak this when it's done. Always is. I, I tweak the hell out of that model if I'm my creator. Because I also want to make it look nice, and some of the weight out there. For example, and I'll and I'll show all the viewers where uh, some of the weight is also attributing to it is out here, all these extra yeah. platforms, or so every one of these little pieces of pipe is hardened steel or combat steel, depending on what I use. This is just decoration to make it look nice, like this here. I'm gonna reduce this either down to steel. Or a carbon substrate just for the decoration is here's here's why to kind of show it carbon substrate is only 180 kilograms it has 120 hit points 30 blast resistance it's not really designed to take a hit this one here weighs 2.45 tons this is a substantial bump in weight the thing with this is it has 10% blast resist and I believe it's 2,500 hit points. Steel itself is one ton, so this is probably your optimal bet, but it has the worst blast resistance of any of them. So you could even use that for the decoration or just rely on carbon substrate. Combat steel has the best, but it's 3.8 tons. That attributes to a lot of your mass that makes everything slow. It makes you a walking tank but the problem with this is you've also crippled your speed and this should only be used to protect vital parts and things like that. There is one more and I don't have a block. Jesus, this, this one is a bit different than the other ones that we faced. This one's got a lot of shit on it. And like this is going to be revamped nice. down here Fucking a bit. 13 large optometric bridges, 5 small, 40 gold. What the fuck? What? This, that's why I had such a hard time with this. This is different from all the other Corvettes that I've faced. This one had stronger shields, more rare shit inside. What was the class of it? Um, it's like the one that we captured, the Sunet, but it's an Al Sunet. Al Sunet, yeah, that's an op that's, uh, elite shit. It's a higher tier. Yeah, it's an elite. Holy shit. Like the, no wonder this one was so difficult. Yeah, you took a beating there. I, I, oh, told yeah. you if you, I told you if you see a prefix before Sunat, be careful with it. <laughs> I couldn't help myself. I wasn't uh, kidding. All right, so we drop down in here into the cargo area. I will pull one of these blocks to show you. The Xeno Steel has 3,500. This has 1,600. This is 7,500. The Xeno Steel is hands down one ton lighter than Combat Steel. It has more hit points, but its blast resist is only 10%. This is good for adding extra meat for a third block in, but I would not recommend you, or a second block in past Combat Steel, but you can't use a ship based on Xeno Steel either because it is weak to thermal and in general. So. It's still great to have as a cushion, is what, I, what I've what i learned. So, like, yeah. a lot of this stuff still has cushion. You're going to have to make sure that you kind of balance your weight a little bit. 
So that's why there's such a substantial change to this. And that's why on the ship statistics, I have 210kt, which is I think 210,000 or some shit. Because basically, with a class size 7, it's, it's big. It's a big boy. I mean, <laughs> just looking at what you have to make to if you were to build this on your own, it's already a lot of resources. And I, since we started doing this game, I've been working on this nonstop. Yeah. I mean, it's, and it's coming along nicely now, finally. I've kind of been learning how the building materials work, weight differentials, everything. And all that comes into play in this game. Yeah. Yep. There, there is, everything you see plays a role. Even the, if you start loading your ships up with a lot of weight, if you turned on the volume, that too will impact you. Uh, now, like with my uh, monolith, when I said I took all the uh, all the quantum cores and stuff out of it, if you throw all those in, it's got about 35 million on the core. The quantums, the auxiliaries. Uh-huh. I've got 10 auxiliaries, uh, 30 quantum cores, just to make it 35 million. Oh, yeah. Just, and to, that... just to handle the load. Yeah, and that all adds up very quickly. Mm-hmm. One check, make sure oxygen is still up. Okay. But, yeah, like this here, this is going to get moved to probably the second floor. This will be uh, set up for production because I'll still yeah. keep all my constructors on here. But the other thing is I'm taking the base down here. Which will go check that out. Oh, this has prison cell on here. This long yeah. runway here, mm -hmm. there, it is actually a base. And inside we do have a lot of plants and stuff like that already in here. Which we're going to real fast because I wanted to get rid of some of these hydroponic blocks that I have. Because we're going to definitely use this for our primary source of food. I'll set it up to where it has a bunch of advanced constructors and stuff because this sector is a starting zone. It won't have invasions or anything dangerous to really attack us, so this would be a good place to store all your stuff. Yeah. As you can see, we've got a massive garden going in here. But the other starting zones on the map, you could get attacked. Correct. If and they were not our starting zone. Right. We didn't start there, so more than likely... It's not safe. Well, like I said, that uh, Tovera being where it was the other day was more than enough. Was enough for more than a little cause, little concern. Yeah, because that means you can just jump right in. And if you're wondering what he's talking about, it's the ship the other night when me and Ro was like, "Hell yeah, let's get it!" And then we saw it's a dreadnought, and we're like running with the They're tail like, oh, between shit. our legs, like, whimpering, running away, like, oh my god, we're gonna die. <laughs> hey, let's get that uh, No, no, fuck that. No, <laughs> no, it's like, yeah, we're, we're, we're leaving. <laughs> we're, yeah. we're not even sticking around for this party at this point. Yeah, it went from, it went from hero to fuck this shit, I'm out. Yep. They're like, yeah, it will eat our shit for breakfast. <laughs> yeah. At least until maybe later, once we figure out a better weaponry like EMPs and stuff, and then if you can get behind it. But even then, you're dealing with a lot of missiles coming at you, for what Stone has said. Uh, at once. <laughs> yeah, it, it's and, a lot. It's, and, and that's kind of, even like Rodimus has a crap ton of missiles built onto it. That It's got a lot of heat sinking missiles on it. That's what I designed it for, plus artillery. Yeah, but, the Xerox love missiles. Oh, I love missiles too. You saw the, how I was using them to break down their bases last night with mm -hmm. all my homing missiles. Oh, yeah. I found out they didn't have shields. I didn't need to waste my plasma anymore. It was just <laughs> blast away. Yeah. So the garden is ready to pull. So that is done. And this is also the ship that they brought from last night. Stone has done a really nice job working on I mean, not the parts you see in there, guys, because it's, it's a work in process. But Bring them this part. 
yeah, this part here is what... The back end of the bridge I've got done. Yeah, he fixed the bridge. It looks really nice from out here, from when Ruggles blew it up. And he uh, restored the backside, so he did a tremendous job getting it to stitch back together to what it was. And then, for everybody's viewing pleasure, this is uh, Captain Ruggles' uh, calling card. Struggle is real. Captain Struggles. <laughs> yeah. And then this is his new toy, apparently, that he made. Which, you yeah. know, I'll, I'll be honest with you, I don't, I, I like this design of stuff, but I swear, I feel like glass is so dangerous to have. Uh, this is designed to avoid most of the enemy fire. Yeah. The Spartan was built to remove to not be there when the fire gets there. Yeah, but it's designed to fend off enemies if they're pursuing. The spirit of fire, however, <laughs> <laughs> and I don't. I Hell seriously, I seriously doubt Liberty's going to be as agile as Rodimus. There's no freaking way. Even after I get it all finalized and set up correctly, there's just, just absolutely no way. Oh, I am probably going to have the least agile ship here. Oh lord! Do you think this one, by the time I get the weight? Uh, under control and everything, you think this will be more agile than the Horus? Have you seen it roll? Uh, that's a good point. <laughs> that's a good point! <laughs> it rolls at six meters per second. It rolls like a little uh -oh, hold bitch. on, we got, we got that Tootsie roll. We got that server error. Hold on, hold on. Oh, shit. Sure. Yeah, gonna have to shut it down. I'm headed back in. No, no, I just gotta go in the mixer and find it. Yeah, I'm gonna have to shut mine down because I'm getting I've got three of me on screen. Alright, there oh, we geez. go. I fixed it. Alright, yeah, now we're now we're fixed. So basically what was going on is we we're getting the sound error. And to yeah. answer your question, Laris, there is no Helga in this game because there is no Dutch or Binks in this game. So Thank God. They don't like it. Wow. Why did I have three instances of the game open? Um, it does that. I, I don't know why, but it does that. I was on your server three times and I didn't even know it. Dang it, I could have wasted No, I have, I have four instances on it. On mine. Well, there's some. No, I was literally on screen three times. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I guess you like yourself that much? I don't know. What can I say? I'm just that special. So freaking special. So freaking special. Because he's a creep. <laughs> 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 I well, a creep. I, I, I do have to say this was worth it. He's a weirdo. <laughs> Gotta love Weezer. Yeah. Does he belong here? Yes. With all you other creeps and weirdos. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a creep. Uh, no, you're a weirdo. I might be a weirdo, but I'm not a creep. Maybe a creeper. Uh, okay. Okay there, Igor. Well, they had enough money and stuff yes. on that uh, ship to where I can buy three more um, auto miners. Okay, that's better. So, it wasn't a total waste. No, but now... I, I may have yeah. lost my three mining lasers, but I gained four of the advanced upgrade kits, so I can get three of them back and I can get the uh, advanced radar I need for the Spartan, so... Yay. Win-win. The advanced blaster charges for that, so... That's literally yeah. the only damage I took. I lost a headlight and those three mining lasers. That's it. Okay. Not too shabby, not too shabby. Those oranges there are hilarious. Oh, yeah. 
Yeah, these yeah, are Polaris. Orange. I'm not sure what it is. Probably it's down it there. Out. I'll yeah, not... and there's unknown signals too, so I'm gonna go yeah. that way later. Yeah. Do you need me to jump in there? I mean, I if you if you want to. Space adventure. So if anybody Let me wants get over to this wreck first. Me, I'm gonna right. go look for stuff short in just a few because. Liberty Prime, I'll work on it later tonight, guys. But I've been working on it most of the day, so. There's but a... yeah, I think it's shaping up really nice. Let me know in your comments or in chat if you guys are liking what, how it's developing. I think it's, I think I finally got a better idea how to do it. I would love to give it a tail and some wings and give it a dragon's face on the front with all the guns <laughs> in the center. But I don't know if I'm gonna be able to pull that off. Even though that would be pretty badass. <laughs> There's a cluster of colonist things over there. That might be something. Polaris? Like... No, colonists. here, but that means Helga can't exist. Yeah. There's, there's a cluster of colonist positions over there on the other side of Polaris. Might have a bounty spot for us. I mean, yeah. let's face it. I ain't, I ain't the prettiest thing around, but even I have standards. This yeah. is true. All right, so the advanced multi-tools I have are toast. So. All right, I'm going to check out this wreck, and then you can beam aboard, Scotty. And Bradley, uh, are you joining uh, me? Yes, I will join you. I'm just finishing up this little okay. bit of mining I'm doing here. I'm just putting that last touch on the on this nacelle here. And that uh, works. Do you need aluminum? Aluminium? That's um, always good to have. Yeah, it's going to okay. be for our automatrons. You're going to need our... Positrons, I mean, you're gonna need them okay. too. That's, There's that's... a uh, asteroid here. I'm grabbing some neodymium. I've just been out mining asteroids. I've, oh. Since I put these two mining lasers on here, I don't take long. I may have to go regulate. Because I decided to tip off their mother. <laughs> <laughs> Regulators, raw. I think too on this side here. If I decide to do more of a wing, I may shrink these down here too, just because this is extra weight to the ship, especially if I'm doing something like this where I'll have guns centered right here. So if I do a broadside, they're all going to fire at once right across here. So I still have options. I mean, it's coming along uh, nicely. Um... And then you're hanging out with Polaris. So. And then once this, uh, once Liberty's done, then my second project, like Stone has, the struggle is real, which um, I'm sure it'll have a new na uh, name. It's Legionnaire. I got this project to still work on here. I'm gonna take this thing that looks like a Cleon bird of prey, and I'm gonna revamp it, build it, and take what I have and make this a fast uh, attack ship. Shipwreck. Where I can sneak up, fire off uh, torpedoes and stuff, and get away quick. Because this is pretty much going to be designed as a hidden run capital ship when I'm done with it. Because as you can see, there's not a lot on it. One of my more awesome finds. I do say so myself. That was an awesome find to find the struggle is real. And I was just talking stone. I, I definitely have this project on the list. Ah, oh, there he is. Okay. I just I was just talking that out. Once I'm done with Liberty Prime, this is my next project. I want to revamp this Klingon bird of prey. <laughs> yeah. Seeing what's inside this crashed I ship. Fix this. And pretty much, I'm going to design this as just a hidden run ship. That's it. Is that a hangar? That's a hangar. Just one that goes in. I might even retweak it and see if I can make this into a ground attacking ship. If there is capital weapons that do uh, well against ground, nothing. I may revamp this to be a ship that attacks everything on the ground. What section? Where's my aluminium? Oh, me? Yeah. I am in... <sighs> Holy crap, you know, I'm looking at a Ramatsi. distance. 
looking at distance at uh, the Spirit of Fire and the Horus. Yeah, the Horus looks so tiny compared to both me and Ruggles' main shift. Holy it's wide. Yeah, I know it's wide. It just, from a distance, it looks yeah. so tiny. It's about as wide as Spirit of Fire. Yeah. Well, you know what they say, go big or go home, right? Okay, you in a good spot, Rick? Oh, I'm not even in the ship. I'm I'm at this wreckage here, just looting shit. Right. I need to get good, some and you damage. can't leave me floating in space when I do that. <laughs> <laughs> Again. Since yeah. I'm done with this aluminum asteroid, I'll join you, Kai. All right. And then I got to re work on this tank at some point. Yeah, Horus might not be the biggest ship in the fleet, but you can, you've already seen the ship from getting nasty. Oh, oh yeah. it'll be able I to take a hit. I do want to revamp this a little bit more to build, continue to build this as a tank. So it's not quite done, but I do believe it's going to have some serious firepower on it. I mean, it's already got Let's see. 1,700 uh, shields, which is what I'm flying with the Creel. But we want to get it up to speed, and I want to make sure it's doing the best because it's primary cannons are the artillery and it's normal tank guns but um bradley yeah. generally what you're looking for is the whether a ship is peaceful uh, or not with 80 percent of the blocks are still present yeah and over over two-thirds of the machinery warp tank are still there um yeah, there was nothing like that. That one I found earlier, it kind of yeah. looked intact on the outside, but not so much on the inside. Yeah. That's generally what I look for when it comes to, can we salvage this? And Alaris, I missed this, says there's stone, though, so Helga can't exist. No. We can't <laughs> exist in the same universe. <laughs> Even I have standards. Uh, some, but not, so you do have standards. <laughs> Uh, Shit like that is reserved for those with no standards. That's true. Standards are for the weak. No, standards are for those that don't want to get body slammed. <laughs> Pretty much. That don't want to get completely decimated. Stone will do the right thing and carry on Helga's legacy. I don't, I don't know why, but Alaris believes that you're part of Helga's legacy. Apparently. <laughs> I don't know what to say, Stone. Alaris, both pass. <laughs> Alaris, this extra pass. armor plating that I... Pass that shit. This <laughs> extra armor plating I put up front paid off. I bet. Because I, I put thin bit. armor pla plates of combat steel over combat steel, and it, yeah. I might revamp this later, too. Because I see some ideas for this ship that I might. Oh, he was trying to target my do. thrusters. <laughs> oh, that ship! He, he had no such luck. But the Cerberus? Yeah. No, no, not the Cerberus. The, uh... The sun at. Yeah, yeah, I think I'm gonna tweak this later too. I think I'm gonna. I'm just doing this. a quick repair on this before I. But. Not go right further. Now. But even this one, let's look and take a look at the statistics on this. That this one. Like had any hardened steel, but. That... No, I, th I, th I think it does have some hardened steel. 21.7 kilotons just for this ship and I'm yeah. running and I'm yeah, running thruster wise I was running. running yeah it's I'm, all steel yeah I'm running 8 advanced thruster and 4 drives so it's still and it can move fast I can move re relatively fast almost like a fighter on this thing so yeah, it's steel and carbon composite. This one? No. Oh. Oh, that yeah, ship this... that we found. I 
got a ventilator out of it, so... Now, I do have a question for you, Stone. Does it really matter placing the advanced RCS anywhere, or can you just piece them throughout your ship? You can Cause... stack them in one room if you want to. Okay, because I, when I got the Rados, they had them all stacked originally. Yeah. That's it's why I not wanted. advisable, but you can stack them all in one room. Well, the reason I mention that is because if they were to hit here anyway, they're going to hit the core right down below here. So. Yeah. Yeah. And there's a lot of stuff they have to hit to even get to it, which is why I put the wings on this thing like that. All right. Plus extra but artillery. But the less you have to say, the less you have to uh, replace them to make it move quick. Yeah. You're better off just saving the ship. Well, for the most part, I am repairing. Well, we needed too much. Yeah, your ship was beyond saving at the start there. It was no longer a CV. <laughs> it was uh it was no longer a capital vessel, it was a capital donut. <laughs> it was a it was, was a capital a, donut. There was a stone temple pilot song with your name on it. Half the man you used to be. <laughs> <laughs> now remember, it didn't catch me in the cockpit. No, but it took it everything else out. <laughs> oh. Yeah, I got my engineering, my constructors. All right. Plants. Yeah. All right. I'm going to take this off the ship. Yeah, the ship's all basic steel blocks and carbon stuff. So. What is? That ship. Oh, yeah, it is. Oh, All right, I'm, I'm putting my last... Uh... Oh, you're in there. Oh, wait. Yeah, I, I just dropped a bunch of my... Where are we going, Kai? Stuff, like, uh, uh, I'm awesome. still in Haven. Okay. I'm, I'm unloading some stuff before you're we... You're fine. Begin I'm still our... just... Okay, journey. there you go. Awesome. I'm going to move the ship. I was sorting. Uh, no, you're good. You yep, I'm just putting this last drill laser on here so I can mine again. So there I got all that shit in all the wrong places. You know how I do. I got shit in Good. all the wrong places. Wrong places. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I was thinking that when Kai was when I was watching Kai in uh, Seven Days the other day. Oh, you know, <laughs> I, I will be honest with you, Stone. I keep forgetting that they had made that auto sort thing where he just drops in there if it has one already. I was having a mint, I was having a freaking aneurysm watching that. Oh, <laughs> you're welcome. <laughs> but apparently, I may I already, I don't know what I'm going to do for day seven on that one because they may have wiped my character with their last patch. Uh, that's why I wait for the first few patches to really get into it. Well, it's kind of a pain because a lot of uh, content creators are trying to take advantage of playing it yeah. and may have just had, you know, which there was already arguments on the forums about it. Like, well, it's a, it's a beta game. What do you expect? Yeah, beta game. It's been out over 10 years. Sorry. Yeah. We oh, only want streamers with 5,000 subscribers. Well, if your marketing sucks that bad, you probably shouldn't exist. It's more like 10 years to die. <laughs> <laughs> it's still not bad. Yeah. Oh, wait. I, don't know, I, just, I just find it to be so stupid. I, I I'm, like the I'm game. I'm way associated with this YouTube thing, so don't hold them responsible for what I say. Oh, I know, but <laughs> it's the whole thing. The whole concept is stupid. The way they handle it, the way they have been handling it, you know. Now, now with the other game that you were telling me about, that's going multiplayer. Yeah. What what they the asked for is reasonable. Yeah, they basically. They they just want to make sure you're actually somebody who plays the game, takes their time, knows knows how to play it. Yeah, yeah, like if you if you've got these achievements on Steam, you know we want you to 
right. showcase that's, it. That's yeah, that, that, that's difference. cool. That that's a huge difference. Then oh, you gotta have. And they're not asking for streaming it. They're just wanting beta testers. So it's not. It's a different. It it literally is apples and oranges on that one. Yeah. I mean, they're not gonna give Greg Greg still plays a copy of it. Yeah. <laughs> well, and, and the problem with a lot of content creators, and I know this is probably gonna rub some, uh, get some people angry, and quite frankly, I don't give a shit. Some of them look at it because they just want a free damn game. I'll still buy the damn game one way or another. I just want to test it. I want to play it. I want to write a review. I want to demo it. I want to let people see what it can do. And then... be one, of, Yeah, be one of the first for a change to... Yeah. I just want to help lead the pioneer way and help influence decisions on stuff. Not, not oh my god, I got a bunch of free video games. Oh, like some yeah, others well, we know. <laughs> most of my games have been free, but they're not new. Yeah, and that's the problem with some some of the content creators. Is some of us can't afford it. <laughs> they want they want the clout, but they don't care. I mean, you can work your butt off on YouTube every day, every day, but sometimes growth is not overnight. In fact, nope. it rarely is, because it's people got to find It's never overnight. You. Unless your name is TG, it's never overnight. Yeah, and so there's still a lot. It, it's a very slow, grueling pace of discoverability. TG got in a, a gaming thing at the very beginning to do that. And it does take time. That's why it's very important... You know, everyone smashes that like button and watches the streams and supports that stuff because no it smash. gives a chance for YouTube to basically say, okay, there's a lot of people watching it. Oh, there's a lot of people that hit like. Okay, let's recommend it. And then that allows other people to discover because that's the only way you're really going to do it. it. It's really, it's a pain. And then once you're like 100, 200,000 channel and you have a thousand viewers at a time, Pretty much it's autopilot that mode. You just make sure you do yeah. the right things, you have the good shows, you do all the right programming, you uh, you just really keep busting your ass, and yeah. that sells then at that point, because now they're look YouTube is just actively recommending your channel when your game comes up. Yeah. yeah I don't know if you know who TG is. But... No, I don't. I've heard the name. Typical but... gamer? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He went, oh. he went from 1,200 to almost 300,000 in a week when you when game and the gaming thing first started on YouTube. Yeah. Well, it's like PewDiePie. He got big, right? It's a matter of timing for him, too. Yeah. They were I mean, in at the beginning. Yeah. There was nobody doing gaming content. Right. It was all starting out at a certain point where everything... I mean, that's why... Yeah guys like DSP really hurt themselves more because they were the pioneers. They were the originals. They were the ones that had it yeah. all. And some of them pissed it away. And we still can't get rid of PewDiePie. <laughs> all the good ones gone. Dead Peter, DSP, and we still can't get rid of PewDiePie. PewDiePie, I don't know if he even does anything anymore. Last I knew, he got in trouble... Last I heard, he got in trouble on Twitch because he was playing all his... He was literally just playing his content from YouTube on on their uh, platform. He wasn't doing any new shows or anything. And Oh, he was, oh, he was basically restreaming already recorded content? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> content. Well, he got in trouble that with that one game because he said a no-no word. Yeah, if you say the oh, no, we got trouble a lot for the N word. Yeah, and for the having having Jewish kids stand on the corner with the sign. Yeah, he. I don't like the stuff that he did. That, no, that was, I, I can't stand any person that would that would think that that is even remotely funny. No, no, that, that's. I don't even know how to say it other than it's disgusting behavior. It is uncivilized at best. Yeah. You just don't do that. Looks like this is the colonist 
trade fleet or mining fleet. Of course, if I did what I wanted to to him, I would be the one who's uncivilized. Yeah. I think I think people. That's that's the problem with why I think Kick's gonna run into a lot of trouble because from what I keep hearing, it is a very unsavory platform. And while I don't mind, and I'm a big supporter of free speech, in my opinion, there still is consequences for yeah, free X speech. Yeah, that's huh? I What's see you found those guys. Who, me? Ruggles. He found the TRXs. Oh. Uh, that's a gun bad. Is it what? That's a gun bad. Pirate. Oh, yeah. I'm looking for that uh, one ship, that drone. But yeah, yeah. Like I said I, I'm probably one of the biggest people that support free speech because I believe in it wholeheartedly. But there's some things that you shouldn't say. Man, why is the spirit? There are some things you me? shouldn't say in certain forums. Yeah. Yes. Lara like, says, Lara says, Kick's been banning people for all doing awful things. Well, that's good if they're doing that, because I mean, I've heard, I've heard mixed things. I mean, Twitter seems to be a very interesting times because you see all the shit that's going Mixer on. Mixer wouldn't even accept PewDiePie. They wouldn't let him stream there. Yeah. I heard oh, on Kick. That. No Mixer. No, no Mixer. When they were around, that's where I was streaming. Oh, okay. Yeah, they wouldn't even they wouldn't even accept PewDiePie. I could see that. They wouldn't let him. He set up a set up an account, tried to go live, and they blocked him. No shit. Mm -hmm. That's wild. My son used to watch him. Oh, there he that, is. Yeah, that was during that was right around the time he was saying the N word all the time. But it was a joke. I don't give a damn what you think it was. Nobody else found it that way. I know. It's a very distasteful word. He knows no. that. Yeah. He I knows don't. what it means. I don't understand. It's, it's also why I don't do Call of Duty anymore. All the lobbies are filled with that the filthy fucking language. I mean, cuss, Actually, word, cuss words are one thing. Cuss words are one thing, but derogatory yeah, remarks to whoever, yeah. anyone and everyone? Yeah, yeah, fuck that. Yeah. Oh, Lara says the guy that solicited picks on, and I'm not going to say the other word because YouTube policy and all that, but um, actually did get banned off Kick. I yeah. did see that on Twitter. They did, because what, what Kick did is they started bragging about it. That they do this better than they do Twitch does and all this and I'm like oh boy here we go mm -hmm. and Kick said nope we don't yeah it's like it's it'll be it's interesting times because I think alright stone it'll be interesting times yeah. I think let's get ready 19 kilometers in closing okay. 12 o'clock high I think, the, I think the reason hey. why I'd... Just a heads up Take your time heading to bed Because Austin can Dump my ice tea all over your side <laughs> Ouch Lovely no, no, no. I had it in the kitchen Lovely. He brings it to me Sets it on the bed then knocks it over And it fucking spilt everywhere Oof. Uh. I'm like I go get myself. I didn't ask him to bring yeah, it to no. me, Michael. He took it upon Jesus. himself. I said My kids do the same this. shit. Kids will do what they want, you know? Alright, let's see. Yeah. Kids will always do what they want. He fucking disappeared on me. Uh, what is that by the asteroid? Oh, up? Yeah. I can make oh, that oh, 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 Whatever it is, it's this way. It shows it. It just 
not picking up on my scanners anymore. But, it's clean yeah. on. It's got a stealth technology. Something. Cling on, on the starboard bow. Yeah. Starboard bow. Starboard bow. Cling up on the yeah, I can see it on the map. I can see it on the map too. Straight ahead. So I mean, we'll run into it at some point. <laughs> if you're crazy and you know it, slap your face. <laughs> hey, Stone. You yeah, remember, I can still see you slapping yourself. Stop hitting yourself. Stop hitting yourself. Stop yeah. hitting yourself. Stop hitting yourself. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, it, it's it's a weird thing. But yeah, at the same time, it's like I don't really care if this place bans somebody and they're running around bragging like that's like an achievement unlock. It's like no, it's like come on guys, you banned them cool leave it alone it doesn't make you awesome it just means that guess what you have all a lot of other places did the right thing right there you see him it's just out of reach of my gun above me above us i don't i don't fucking see him oh yep. sorry it's taking so long you're Bradley, fine i'm just you're fine this. i'm just Oh yeah, those I'm working on my ship. Ones. I'm getting things going. I need to put another constructor. That those other are one far. is just not enough anymore. Well, nope. yeah, he's open. I know I got one here in storage somewhere. I know that feeling sometimes. Yeah, Hell yeah! Hit something pretty. <laughs> yeah. He blowed up real good. He did. <laughs> All right, let's. Get in there and loot them real quick and get the hell out of here. Yeah. Oh, maybe I can grab the mining laser off of them. That'd be great. That would be great. <laughs> that would be great. Have you seen my, have you seen my here? Hey, here's some thrusters for you, some big you ones. You know, some people don't have still have not seen Office Space. It's like really? one of the best freaking movies what ever. What is wrong with you people? I don't understand. I like, blew up all of his containers. Uh, it's like office space is so iconic. It's like, how do you not know that one? It hurts my soul. This is me expressing myself. <laughs> no, I keep doing that right. It's so good. Okay. Me up a box on this thing. No, yeah. Okay. It's a four by four. Pistol upgrade. Yeah. All the sight pistol. Hey, I finally got a pistol. Yay! Congratulations, you won a prize. After all the pistol ammo I've looted. Okay. Oh, I know. Plates, plates, <laughs> titanium plates. Hey, I can make more blocks for that ship. Okay. Advanced right. thrusters. Yeah, in the back. Yes, please. You and can you can take them for your ship. Is there anything else in here? Mm, yeah, there's a lot of shit in here. I don't think I got all those boxes yet. And this is all hardened steel. Hello! Oh, I can't do that. I still need a lot of this for that hole. Alright, let's find the next one here. And if you find me in the deco antennas. Mm. I need, a, I need quite a few of them for the front of it. Copy that. 
There's some deco antennas on this thing in the front. Oh, I probably got a ton of them. They're I right here. I keep forgetting to loot them for that. the ships. Tri-beam antennas, yep. Deco. There's, there's quite a few on the front here. I always forget to get those. They Is make there... good deco. Yeah. Grab what you need. More of those rails like are missing from the ship. In the back, there's supposed to be two of these rails okay. on each side, too. Just All like right. on the front. See. Hell um, yeah. All right, this ship is ready to rock and roll. Let me check my ammo situation. Uh, tool turret. Still in good shape. Uh, what's it doing? Get some more missiles. Just a second here, and I'll be ready to rock and roll. No problem. Got all those. Now we Grab all these blocks you want, because we'll give you enough for the whole of that. That's fine. Um, the stuff so, for you is always I'm gonna put in the medical cargo. We're gonna That's do. Probably putting it, yeah. We're gonna be doing a long voyage this time, uh, Bradley. All right. We get. We gotta go find ourselves some toys. And resources. <laughs> These are the voyages of still the starship. What the fuck? <laughs> yeah, more or less. Uh, that looks much better. Oh yeah, I sorted so much stuff out now. This is way better. I've got these small thrusters too, because we may we may have an SV we need to replace it at some point. That's fine. I'm gonna use the tool turret on my ship. Okay, I'm still trying to, to figure uh, out to give you a hand. I... So while you do it by hand, I'll use the tool turret. Grabbing specific blocks this way, you know I leave that for the tool turrets and stuff. And Larry says, "Don't trust and agree with you. They shouldn't be bragging about it. The sad thing is that they seem to be the only ones doing the right thing." Yeah, that's. It's weird how one place does things right, the other doesn't. It... I I think it's a never-ending struggle because you're dealing when you're dealing with the problem that you gotta look at it is. You're also dealing with many employees, and everybody has their own opinion on things or how they ought to be. And you add put these other rails on the back. You add on top of that the uh, I'm trying to think how to word this. You add on top of the fact that there's also no rule is applied equally on any server or game that you play. Uh, Punishment. Yeah, I know. We all could. But no... No two uh, punishments right. or anything. The rest should be good plus. Oh, you, you need more laser? I I oh, got yeah. one. Oh, I need two each. That's fine. We're going to be going on a journey, so. Uh, going on a trip in my favorite rocket ship. Pretty much. Change my other one back, too. That's... Change your underwear. Shit's about to well, get real. Put, your, put a fresh change of underwear in the glove box. I'd like to unlock these mining missions. Apparently, somewhere we can get. I start unlocking mining quests. Oh, uh, there's a lot of them places where we go to that have jobs. If you look when we go to buy stuff, we yeah. we need to find a shipyard or 
bounty so, place, or scrapyard or bounty place for the colonists. So keep an so eye out for that. What you're telling me is it's not going to be in the solo missions area for the renewals or anything. It's going to be maybe. I don't know. Huh. I'm just guessing. Oh well, my god, I gotta eat again. Well, I'm going to go warp to UCH real fast. Because oh. I'm going to do a turn in. So when you're ready, I will just have you warp wherever I'm at. Let me check my Pentaxa tank. I'm, I'm ready. You are ready? Okay. Okay. So if you're going to go to UCA. We can, I, don't I can have hold anything. off on that. I don't have Oh, you any. can go do that if you want. It's one item. I'd rather turn in more. So okay. I can wait. I'm just going to kill time. All right. So let's look at the map here. Galactic system. We have not been. Let's go to the gap A alpha. It's D A G A B dash A E. And we're gonna push us pretty close to the Polaris Empire. So. The gap A E alpha. Yep. Are you still in there, Stone? I don't know if you Oh, you're in the seat. I got you a shit ton of blocks. Probably gonna get ready to move. Okay, I'm ready. Alright. It'll be in the uh, harvester. Hold on. Oh, wait, I gotta turn all my shit on first. And go into the sun. I will be there in just a second. Hopefully. You just have to work on that other <laughs> ship over there. Yeah. Uh, and oh, I can't jump there. I you'll have to do a double jump then. That's fine. I just needed to see where we's going. Yep, that's fine. Uh, over at Give me a chance to look at the sector map. Ooh, this uh, should be fun. Well, we have. The Xerox Empire. Oh, yeah, this this should be loads of fun, this system. Oh, this is interesting. It's owned by Polaris. Lots of Arrestrum. Pen, uh, Pentaxid, Prometheum, Neodium, Sathid. Ooh. I like that one. Hold on, I'm trying to figure out where I can jump between be careful with that one. Why is that? Because that's, Xerox, that's a Xerox held system. This one isn't. This is Polaris. Yeah, red, yeah, yeah red one? that one. That one probably will have dreadnoughts and everything in there. I'm not gonna yeah. mess with that. Why can I not? Let's see. So we're gonna go to the Polaris sector to get all those goodies, oh, see what's going on, and then we'll hit the space that's owned by no one. Yeah, if you're going to that red one without without backup. Yeah, I have hope no. I hope you're free. Oh, I can't even come <laughs> Oh, I have no plans of going into that one head, head yeah. on. Yeah. yeah, not yet anyways. No. Yeah, if you're going to one like that without any backup, I hope you're like I hope you're free loot. Because they're not gonna do it first. <laughs> nah, no. I imagine it's a... Uh... oh hey. You just, your uh, ship's gonna get blown up by like probably every destroyer known to man. And that plus... is not even what I clicked on. I just jump in there and say, oh, hey, look, you're an Amtrak now. <laughs> what the? <laughs> every ship in the sector is gonna take its turn. Yeah, that one is a no hope one. <laughs> yeah. Neodium, silicon, sathium, copper, titanium, iron, aluminium. Nice. I almost lost the Vezier with all that firepower on it. That big one you saw earlier? Yeah. That was where I took all that damage. I took out two Toveras at once. Oh, hey, I found the Flor Polaris Foreman yeah. again. That's a bandit robber. Cool. Well, 
Just let me know when you're there, Bradley. He ain't gonna like me. Uh, I'm trying to. <laughs> well, he certainly didn't like it keep the cockpit blowing up, did he? The fucking triple shot this time. Look at that shit all up there in front of the ship. Oh, like we are in for a fun time, boys. Woo! Oh, but they're all small shit, though. Yeah, it's all right. It's a shit ton of them. That's your party. You're having trouble, Bradley? Oh, I'm sure there's yeah, more. Yeah, I'm trying to find some place in between is my problem. These are too fast. Well... Some of them might be too fast. Hold on. Don't somebody bro. I want to see something real quick. Oh, never mind. There's a party right there. That. There that we doesn't go. Doesn't look like a party. <laughs> I He's finally found dead. one. That... Hopefully this won't. Bandit looter down there. You just have to hop, skip on over. Oh yeah. Well, that was my problem, finding one that was just like... <laughs> Kaboom! Yeah, he raged back into the asteroid and stopped moving. Oh, great, <laughs> he got fucked up. Oh, we're gonna get full bar now? Where's your bar? You're about to find out. Oh, 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 I got one. Yep, pillager. Bam! Oh, something. Oh, one shot. Wow. Damn. I just and, plowed it. And Alaris, you got good Alaris said, shot. It's okay, Brad. I believe in you oh, and your wow. abilities as a weapons officer and helmsman. See, Bradley? Somebody believe I'm you. there. I don't I don't like the star map. It's I'm trying to figure out sometimes looking at it. It looks 12 o'clock. I'm at I Ada Hemo. Ada Hemo 2. It's an asteroid owned by Polaris. I will be right there. I just got my system. There you go. Yeah, he did. I just hit him right there a few minutes ago. Nice. Thanks for the likes. Definitely appreciate that. Always with that. And the YouTube. turret survives. Look at that. <laughs> oh, the only thing that survived on the bad kid was the turret. Oh, shit. Look at all this loot floating here. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Let's fucking go. Yeah, Let's go get I the booty. About that. I forgot about that to check the space once you, uh, No, you're fine. Ship. Yeah. I forget about that. Okay, that the loot is not totally destroyed. It's just floating for a few minutes. Yeah. You can find all the, uh, hardened steel blocks you can find. I can use them. Okay. You got, I'm in you the got sector, a, uh, Kai. You got yeah. a core on it? Just, I'm over no. here from Ethium. I'm about to put That's one fine. down. Put one down. I'm going to grab this real fast. And I'm going to, uh, my goal there is for Sathium, a restroom. And if we can take some yodium home, cool. Okay. And there's Pentax in there yet, too, when you oh, first Oh, let me make in. sure my harvester's empty while I'm thinking about it, because I think I did empty it. Did I turn my lights on? Check for crew. You can recruit yes. the crew. There's another medium so I can throw in the... Throw in Horus. That's another small. Oh. Mercenary I, I can't do anything because you've got control. Uh, okay. No, oh, what's this over here? Okay. Uh, I figured we'd hit the calm one first. <laughs> okay. Let's see here. Oh, you don't know how to do it? I do. <laughs> You're mercenary like, cruiser. Hmm, I had to see. pick it up because I because I only got parts too. I had to salvage the gun. I put it on. What the hell? The heat signals are way out here, away from everything. I'm gonna go check this one out. Yeah, I'm heading to one. It's ways out. Yeah, because I need to get some more restroom and for weapons and stuff on here. All right. But there's that Pentax if, if we really didn't need it. I mean, we. <laughs> Titanium I mean, over here. Yeah, we don't really hurt on Pentaxes anymore. Ever since I'll sometimes grab it when I'm out, just if I'm here. Yeah. Well, I'll still grab it if I see it. it. Yeah. Wow, look at all these Polaris stuff. Yeah. Mining barge? Mining foreman? Yeah, mining foreman's the one you can do that Polaris quest. 
where you have to make uh, 25 crafts of the dual Promethium. It's in your PDA. And then you okay. just take it to the... There's two foremen on one of those ships. You just take it to... I'm going to leave the Osiris with ships. you. I'm going to take it's my fighter out to uh, 50, credits, the other spots. All right. Oh. Meanwhile, I'm going out this thing way out in the middle of nowhere. It'd be funny if we found like a right. half-functioning dreadnought or something out here. <laughs> we'll be towing that thing back home. <laughs> There's just some restroom. Oh, yeah, there's a restroom. All right, I'll get that one. Then I'll come back into the main area. Because restrooms used to make that liquid that's used in a lot of plasma weapons. Oh, you found one too. I was trying to figure out what this ship is. It says heat signature, and I'm right next to it, and it will not pop up for me. I wonder why it does that. Must... Oh, oh there it's it is. a Harkin Sunseeker. Go out to this refresh. Allied or? It's, like it's Polaris. Polaris. Yeah, we're in Polaris. We're in Polaris controlled sector. Polaris love us. I think if you have your radar on, it should just automatically ping instead of having to hit the button. Because that's kind of how it works in real life. Wait, wait, did you say a restroom is used to make liquid used in plasma weapons? And no, e restroom. But when yeah, you we say pee it in fast, a toilet. But when you say it fast, it sounds like a restroom. <laughs> it's a restroom. It's a restroom, guys. I'm sure there's probably dozens of memes on the fucking internet for that one. I mean, it is green. It does look like toxic waste, so. Echo. Yeah, that's the stone. I know. Are you eyeballing me, Scoot? Well, this is a safe place to take him. Yeah, I know. I'm. He's not. He just sat up. Alaris likes the restroom method more. And all we're doing now is doing the old Galactus style devour the asteroid. Um, nom 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 nom. How many uh, additional guns did you put on yours, Bradley? I've only got two miners right now, but they do pretty fast. Yeah, I'm hoping we find 50 more Xeno still, then I'll finally finish this mission. I and need I to go land somewhere and just kill a bunch of Xerox for mine. No, oh, we'll be doing some bunker busting tonight. You don't have to worry about that. We'll be doing that tonight. Much better. I busted them so good last night, they were all dead except for two or three. <laughs> <laughs> oh, where me and Rebels are, we kept fighting a bunch of them nonstop. Well, I thought when I go to like the smaller ones, I could just sit on like a spawn or something, but they wouldn't spawn in that quick. No. We have another ammo controller. Nice. There's a third ship somewhere. They need like three more, and we'll have it up for all of the weapon systems that I'm thinking of for that ship. Look at that, we're just devouring all this goodies. The good stuff wasn't just steel. So did that Legionnaire come as combat still and hardened still? Hardened. Hardened? That ain't bad. 
Yeah. That's something I need to do is go around the Hard outside with of mine a lot of carbon and on the upgrade interior. all that. So yeah, that seems to be the typical thing for ships. Yeah. Heavy exterior and interior is just soft and chewy. Which makes yeah. sense. Okay, so never, that is the pillager. The one I need is the never be able to get breached that Jeez. hard unless you uh, really make a really bad dumb dumb. You should never get breached that hard unless it's been shooting you <laughs> with an artillery cannon. Yeah. I don't know what it is with that. When I hit people in the wrong spot with an artillery cannon, they just go. You mean they splat? Yeah. Leave everybody sitting around like there wasn't the 4th of July. Ooh. <laughs> you sound like the aliens out of Toy Story. <laughs> it's by the Iron Asteroid. By the Iron Asteroid. I made that joke one night and somebody said, there were no aliens in Toy Story. I'm like, the claw. Really? Do me a favor. Go watch the movie. <laughs> go, go slap yourself in the face. No, go slap yourself with a, with a desktop, please. <laughs> Repeatedly. <laughs> oh, one of them, I wanted to tell. Congratulations. Did your parents have any children to live? <laughs> Larry says, Larry says, I was looking at the pre-order for Starfield and it's $112 with tax in Canada and the province I'm in, but they added it to Game Pass PC, so I might do that to play it. My issue with it is I saw something weird on Twitter and I want to confirm, but if, say, me and Ruggles do pre-order our Starfields like we were intended, so we get it five days early, now there's, look, the way it was reading, we're not able to stream it for the first five days, even though... Yeah. We're so I need to confirm, because I even response is, wait, 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 wait a minute. Are you saying if we buy it and get that five days early, we can't even start streaming it? I don't see why they wouldn't let you, because that would just pump more people up to buy it. That's what I would think, and I'm like... Like a lot of the stuff I'm gonna be doing probably won't be story unless I have to, unless some of the shit's gated. It'll be literally. Alara said, "Yep, you can't." So the first five days, you are not allowed to release any streams whatsoever. Wow. So you could record for the first five days. Yeah. That fifth day or that day that it's allowed, then you can like release, release a bunch it. of episodes yeah. and then. Do your streams basically be like some of the uh be like some of the people that recorded uh, alpha 21 over the weekend oh yeah basically didn't and release any content on the fifth day Alaris says, <laughs> Alaris says microsoft ha and bethesda has done this before yeah, that sucks that they've basically embargoed you even though you can't even though you own it early I don't, I don't know how they can tell you can't stream it. That doesn't make sense. They own the game. They can. They can. They own the license. Yeah. So, like for example, they, they uh, could tell you that you can never, yeah, you know, stream it ever yeah. after release. Yeah. After you buy it, they can tell you you can't play. You can never allowed to play it. Yeah. I mean, if they feel like it. If if you if you make the wrong developers mad or something, they can strip you of all your games. Yep. Then they better give me my damn money back. They won't. That's a lawsuit it. waiting to happen. No, they, oh, right. and, there's oh, clauses. And, yeah, there's tons of terms of service in that big, long spiel of legalese that most people aren't attorneys, so they don't know what the hell they're reading. I can read it. And Alaris has already said they're they're going to be actively looking for streaming, and you could be a zero viewer streamer, and they will hit you with it. Yeah, yeah, well, they, I, I know companies that where people have gotten hold of copies weeks before the game was released and had it on stream, and oh. nothing was done to them. Right, but YouTube, how big a dick they want to be. Yeah, and on YouTube they can hit you hard because YouTube, all copyrights, everything, is on the burner proof on you. 
Yep. So you could be that one dude that goes and just hit the copyright cl copyright claims every one of your videos for no reason at all. And guess what? You have to fight it and justify it. And a lot of times, this is the shitty part. You may have to threaten to take this person to court and sue them for them to back off because there has been some big YouTubers that some guy was basically copyright strike in every one of their channels and every one of their videos even had none that says, I own the rights to this, this is mine. And basically until that person relinquishes that copyright strike, you can't do it. Um, so the only th recourse you have is lawsuits. That's why when you saw stuff like uh, Roberto and all Coming the in, saying, Moon. Saying what are you shooting at? Trying to get this thing to... I'm, I'm switching over to the scanner and clicked it. Ah. Uh, what I was saying is that's why you see a lot of guys like Roberto and all the others always saying that the copyright system and all the report system needs revamped royally because... Yeah, they can make your life hell. Yeah, I was swapping, swapping over to the long range scanner and I clicked it. Oh, you're good. I mean, it, it's crazy, but I remember the quartering had one, somebody doing that and says, if you don't rel relinquish this copyright claim, believe me, I do have a lawyer and I will sue you for every dime you have. And they did release it after that happened because, well, he does have a high priced lawyer on retainer. Got three of them. Yeah. Two I mean, of them are his best friends. Yeah. Yeah, he don't play around. His advisor is also his best friend. Yeah, and he has the same uh, attorney as uh, Crowder, who has a big wig attorney, too. So. Yeah, and the lawyer says, yeah, but this is different. It'd be like getting an early copy of a Nintendo game, streaming early, and expect it to be fine. LOL. Yeah. yeah. That, that's what they're probably seeing it as. So once once the early access is done, you can. Now granted, people like playing Diablo that got it early, or all those, Blizzard didn't give a shit. Me? Yeah. But, in a lot of companies that you get early access game three or four days early, they don't care. And there's certain ones that really do. And they're the ones that will hit you hard. They'll spank you. Blizzard which is, doesn't really care, uh, you know, uh, who is it? So, I mean, realistically, the best thing that I'm going to do then is if I if I just still decide to pre-order it and do the early access, I'll just probably spend four or five hours recording and making videos and just start se yeah. sequentially releasing it as a premiere um, uh, for streaming. Ubisoft didn't care with Division 2, I mean, yeah. yeah. hell, I did that. Well, and Dolores is right. Microsoft, but those Nintendo are companies that really care way too much. Yeah, there's a they thing is... too much about the money. Protecting mm -hmm. you. But that's this crazy part. If I watch somebody playing Starfield on day one of an early access, I may be watching and says, man, this actually looks fun as I thought it would be. Yeah, which then they may want to it's, buy it at that point. But the logic behind it does isn't there when you're dealing with a bunch of suits. Remember, yeah. re remember something about suits, guys. There's something about once you put a suit on, the oxygen to your brain seems to fade away, and you don't really think logically. So you know, if they've got a 17 inch neck, they've got to stop wearing a 12 inch tie. Yeah, I mean that's that's their <laughs> that's their problem. The oxygen, like I said, the oxygen in their brain isn't there because they're wearing that suit. So I mean. I'm going to take stroke. out this Sun Seeker. Uh, <laughs> you don't want to take out a... I would not pick on Polaris. They will destroy no. us. I wouldn't do that. That icon might whoop you too. It might surprise you what it's got. Check on the Steam Workshop if you want to know. <laughs> but, I mean, that's, that's the thing. I mean... And believe me, I don't like wearing suits either, so. I do feel like I get dumber when I wear suits. That's why I'm glad I don't wear it very often.
because you're hanging. That's because the people wearing those suits are truly dumber. They have no common sense. Yeah. See, if I was running a company and I announced, okay, we're gonna have a 10-day early access if you pre-order and buy it, I wouldn't care if you streamed it because guess what? Oh, if bandit people like it. Hello. I see. Because the people like your game, that is literally free marketing that I don't have to spend money on for marketing. You just better have a damn good game. Hey, and Ruggles, if you're, yeah. When you get done, I want the precious. <laughs> yeah, but, I'll, I'll let you shoot. <laughs> but if that's the case, maybe I'll work on a day one review of Starfield too. I want to see if I can pick his nose from here. There you go. That give you plenty of chance to do a review for it. Yeah, right when it first comes out on the on the first day when they lift the freeze. You had time to play it. Had time to play it for a few days. Have it have the review ready to rock and roll that night, or the night it, or that whenever the time release opens and you can stream it. Bam! Throw that out. Maybe throw some starter guides out. That's probably what I'm gonna, what I'll happily be doing. Granted, hopefully this weekend I'll be working on getting those final reviews out. Is you done eating on asteroid yet? No. He's... I want to see if I can pick his nose from here. I still got pick his so nose. much. I gotta get the gun down. Shoot him. But yeah, I have wondered about that because yeah. I saw Vera Dark on Twitter was even ta asking about that. Cause he's like, stuck Wait a to minute. an asteroid, isn't he? Yeah. Looks like he's docked <laughs> to it. Shoot him. It's to the I right. I am wondering how many channels. Turn around. I am curious how many channels are going to get struck and shut down for streaming that stuff early. There you go. Uh, too far. Right there. Right there. Okay. Oh. Have fun. That's why, okay, so here's, and Laris made something. The reason why people got upset now is they were offering the game free, the premiere edition, to streamers. You had to report, report, uh, apply here. For small streamers, though, with small channels like ours, good freaking luck, Chuck. You're not going to get it. Oh, not, I think I found his joke. I wonder page. if there's anything I can go over here and buy. And Alaris says, I'm waiting for them to walk back on it, though. A lot of streamers I heard are mad, but they'll likely give certain streamers exclusive rights to stream early appeasement. Yeah, that's what they're going to do. That's what that whole licensing that Vera Dark was talking about was. Is this is cool. Looking. Apply today to get your streamer to be able to stream or get the game free. And be able to stream it on day one. The way everybody was like, wait a minute, we can't stream it if we buy it. Early access. Nope. And then, it, then it snowballed. So yeah, that's that's valid. They're gonna just select which streamers they want. So your guy guys like Asmund Gold and all those that got mega millions of people that watch are gonna get it, whereas small channels even if the ones that are small that aren't looking for a free game or willing to pay for it are going to get host i don't know that asmund gold will have a shot at it he's a big he's, channel he's he's but that's the off in the past that guy's guy. a jerk yeah but i'm sure he would oh wait I'm, do i have one in the i'm sure he would get it i mean including recently when he tried to get when he tried to get bethesda review bomb because they can't make a good game up Fallout 76 proved that. Well, I'm just using him as an example because <laughs> yeah. he's a big mega stream channel. Yeah. My, my point is I'm not looking for a free game. I'm looking yeah. to do business. That's he's all. always looking for a hand at him. I hate to say it. And Alaris agreed on that. That they're going to choose the biggest streamers they can. Yeah. And, and that is true. And, that, and that's the problem. So it cripples the smaller streamers that, hey, I paid for the game. I'm willing to do this. Yeah. You know, I'm buying the game. You don't even have to give me a free copy. You don't have to do it. I'm paying the $100 to play it early so I can stream it for you guys to give you advertisement. 
Oh, and they've already said they've contacted Asmongold to be one of them to stream early. Uh, you probably gonna have restrictions on him for what he can say and do. Oh, they all will. <laughs> they're gonna have that. They're gonna have heavy restrictions on it right off the start. You know, I've never really been interested in his form of content, and I still, I, have either. I still I have YouTube see. recommending his shit to me. I'm like, stop pushing his shit to me. So I will say, I I'd rather see some, some other new streamer. You know. So I'll be honest with you. I watch some of these main streamers. They're no different than us. Seven days, they're no different than us. They're really not. And some of them are have as much personality as a wet noodle. <laughs> I, I, I'm not. I'm not trying to say it to be uh, mean or cruel, but I've seen people that just like. Yeah. It's like yeah. I wish I had. I had like you know the money to spend on sound systems and and put and have a, a silent recording studio for everything. That comes in time. It's just an inexpensive computer. Yeah, it was only like seven, eight thousand dollars. Oh yeah, you spend like eight, nine thousand dollars in the computer. You spend two thousand dollars on the soundboard, so you can ha plug in all your headsets and sound quality. Then you have a whole room that's completely padded, so it absorbs all the sound and whatever. Yeah. I don't know if you know who Terrorizer is, but I love his take on that. He, uh, somebody said, "Yeah, you guys have." Seven, eight thousand dollar computers, and you know, three, four thousand dollar soundboard. They call it affordable. Well, guess what? Fuck you. Normal people don't have that shit, and they still do better than you. Yeah, well, normal people are guys like us. We're the other guys, you know. Yeah, Terrorizer and, has all the expensive shit. And, and you know, we're we're the other guys because we just haven't had that viral video or that yeah. luck that sends people our way or we haven't said anything super controversial that yeah. IGN and Dexerto suddenly talk about. I mean... Yeah. You see, Terrorizer has all that expensive shit. Why? Because he was part of the Vanoss crew. Yeah. I mean, don't get me wrong, my setup wasn't cheap, but I don't have the, yeah. like, the advanced soundboard. Oh, God. And no. I was asking a friend that bought a soundboard and, and I'm not saying like a deck so you can play sounds, but it's 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 a uh, it's so your mic and your headset is not through USB anymore. It's through mm -hmm. a direct connection that feeds into this block, and you can auto tune yourself and all this crap. Yeah, those aren't cheap. I was no. looking at them. I was like, those are three like, four thousand dollars for that. Yeah. Would I love to do that stuff for the show? Hell yeah! But I still got to get monetized first. I'd like to be able to do stuff like that on mine, but guess what? It's not going to happen until I can take care of my family first. Yeah. Some of us have responsibilities. Yeah, I, well, I just can't take thousands of dollars and go buy a bunch of expensive shit to make well, my yeah, stuff look nice. And I can't hire an editor, even though I, I'm i not bad at editing. I just don't have the time to yeah, sit there and edit, which is problem. why it's harder for me to do long form. It's harder for me to do long form because, like tonight, I already had an itinerary of what I was doing tonight, what I was planning and stuff. That's why I spent this afternoon working on stuff for, so mm -hmm. the show wasn't super boring. And guess, you know, the, I have to plan stuff. Like, I haven't got it this weekend. I got to send Miles an itinerary of what we're talking about on Wednesday. I don't throw softball questions when I interview, but... I just want him to kind of be aware of what subjects we're talking about, what kind of how the format's going to go, because he's never done that. I have to do yeah. stuff like that. Or when Seven Days to Die, I kind of had to plan. You know, like I pulled pulled uh, the name Happy Town out of my ass because it just seemed stupid and funny for Seven Days to Die to call it Happy Town mm -hmm. and pretty much say silly quips about being the mayor, population one of, you know, <laughs> <laughs> and, you know, Population about, me. <laughs> and, well, I was. You weren't there on some of those, but I was saying, yeah, I gotta put down these uh, protesters down. <laughs> <All sorts of shit. laughs> like, you were going all out, huh? And I was giving yeah. hell about his burning chaps. Yeah, I was like, just saying, like, uh, like, yeah, you know, I was just being funny because you know all the zombies, like, hey, hey. We, there, there's no attack in my base, and 
I was evicted yeah. out of my man mansion and stuff, and saying this is my town, I have to defend it using all the local. Yeah, if that's the goal, they already contacted you. It's iffy whether that's true or not. It's hard to say. He probably shit like that out of his ass. Just Yeah, it's it, who knows. But my point with it is, yeah, not everybody has that luxury, and. I know me and Ruggles are willing, we were willing to spend the money to yeah. be able to stream that. We're not asking for, oh, hey, we want to do a damn handout for the game. No, we just yeah. want to play it. We just want to stream the game for our audience and play it and put the guys up. It's like the Alpha 20, uh, 21. I would I would have actually worked on guides that weekend yeah. and, and actually experiment with it, be able to tell you what it is. I would have actually stopped my regularly st scheduled programming to bring that stuff to you. See, yeah, that's, they like. That's, that's why I like people like Brian. He's got a lot of followers, but he will tell you flat out that the smaller streamers are better to watch than them, than the big streamers, because they've got more personality than a wet noodle. Yeah, they do. Like, they Whoa. freaking do. I mean, there's a lot of undiscovered out there. I mean, he's, they're... He was Van Oz crew, so you know he's not small. And guess what? The, the person that I will say that inspired me, and I'm probably controversial as hell, I want to say this on, on the stream, Ricada Law. I watched that guy grow very small to very large. Yes, does he say shit that pisses people off? Yes. But I watched him grow, become very successful, and when he got his channel taken down on YouTube... 27,000 people were watching him on Rumble and supporting him and also pushing YouTube to get his channel back that was taken from him. Okay. That, that, you can't, there, there is no, fake but, that. no, you can't fake that. And his personality is real. Whether people agree with what he says or not is beyond the damn point. He it's irrelevant. is also entertaining. Not but, everybody agrees with what I say, but does that matter? No. Well, no. I disagree. And no, and not everyone's going to agree with what I say or Ruggles says or Bradley or. And they don't anybody. have to. And guess what? It's like I said something to a friend You're the wrong. other day. You have to, Ruggles. <laughs> Hope you're ready for some more bandits. And Alara says he backed Vic. He's good in my books. Yeah, that was how I discovered him actually. When I heard about him getting fired from Funimation, I was like, "What the hell's going on?" There, and is I, there Krill in it? Oh. Oh no, that's you. Don't maneuver too hard. The, the gun can't keep up when you do. Well, I've got a suggestion. What? I you can pilot the Osiris, and I can take my fighter out. Okay. Just don't but, get don't get too close to the lookout because this one's actually an actual base. Well, I know. But I can't, I can't get up and get in the pilot seat until you stop it, anyways. Oh, I know. <laughs> But I'm getting I'm about my point. five kilometers in, then we'll... Yeah, you don't have to tell me what's base and what's not. I've already got, I've been there been eaten by that. I'll be right back. Copy. No but what I was going at with my opinion on that is a lot of those guys were inspiration. And I, I get, Laris, that people need to understand others will have different opinions. That is very true, but not everybody's going to agree with that. I mean, I have a very strong opinion about student loans, for example. I'm not going to get into it on this channel, but I have a very damn strong opinion about what they should do and what how they should fix it. That's my opinion. Meanwhile, I've heard people have different opinions, I such as like, oh. such as you borrowed it, pay it back, or whatever the case All may right. be, whether I agree with Let that. Let me get down to my ship. But that's what makes us special. Oh, I need oxygen. And as I tell you what, the world would be pretty boring if we were all automatrons that just basically had the same brainwave and thought and we didn't have well, any that, independent Well, that's why thought. we don't follow what all the big folks do. Fortnite, Call of Duty, and all that other bullshit. Fortnite, Call of Duty. Apex yeah. Legends. It's like when you see the guru say, oh, everybody just needs to copy Mr. Beast. because Dude, it, like, his no. thumbnails and shit are so fucking generic. It's just him smiling like a, you know, whatever. Every... Yeah, I usually see him <laughs> smile or look shocked, and then he has some outlandish picture like his chocolate factory build or something. It's like that's no different than mine, you know, smiling with the thumbs up or the point and, you know, 
but I, I do different fucking faces. No and different. Lars, that's, that is the way it should be. Lars says I have friends on both left and right, and I'm in the middle of myself, but I listen to them, and I can still be friends with them, even with their extreme ideals. doesn't take on a person. Else. See, that's how I am, too. I don't. I respect the person. And the I respect that I just cut off for the ones that insist that I do it their way, think their Correct. way. All right. Those are the ones that I have steered away myself. The ones that are shields are. You're gonna, hmm? So shields are going up. Did you know though, Alaris, the sad part, and, and this is what Lars says. Up. I think it's not that so many people will break friendships over that. Friendships, families, everything has fallen apart in the last eight years over politics and beliefs and ideology because nobody can oh, actually. Sure, yeah. Because nobody will just be understanding and res agree to disagree. And that's nope. the problem. It's we disagree and you're wrong. That's it. That's in the story now. Correct. That's the way they want it. And that is the problem. I know, I know, the that, <laughs> I know we kind of went on a tangent here and it, it was kind of funny how we were just talking about this because of the Starfield thing and how it irked me and how it's kind of screwing us, but it's like, I think I think the subject and discussion is important. I think sometimes just conveying your beliefs and feelings is important. Like, I really disagree with how small streamers, even if they're paying the money for it, I could get it if I was like, my channel's like 720. And I'm just a small fish in a big pond. Did and you guess get shot by that base? Nope, I'm fine. And guess what? Okay, so I'm I'm tiny. It's I'm not asking for a handout or a free game. I'm saying, hey, check out my channel. Hey, you know, I'm gonna go ahead and buy the game and talk about it. I believe that it's to understand that yeah, you're not going to be this one guy that suddenly game companies to say, oh yeah, we like your content. You're, I know you're small and tiny, but guess what? We're going to give you a copy of this $100 game so you can stream it. No, they're not going to do that. They're going to go after the big ones. But if I'm the same guy that says, hey, I'll give you early access too. I'll pay you for the full price of the game and everything. I just want to Fucking took out the... <laughs> Took it out with the fighter. Nothing, there's nothing wrong with that. But the uh, ship that was there? For the most part, yeah. Yeah, it fits a couple of them. And Alaris says, all, yeah, all those, it was just, I was just being broad, but everything is breaking apart and no one sees it except these different ideals causing too much infighting amongst her. Yeah, it does. I mean, it, it, it happens in businesses, it happens in everything. And. Getting kids arrested at 11, 12 years old or trying to for having a lawn mowing business. I've seen that. I, I actually Lemonade saw, stands. I, yeah, I yeah. saw that. I'm like, what the hell? What the so, hell is wrong with teaching the kid responsibility with money, too? I'd be so proud of my kid if they were big enough at 12 years old, they wanted to you know, start a business and do lawn mowing, and then they hired their friends and stuff. I'd be so proud of them. 12 years old, I had a lawn mowing business. What the hell's wrong with it? I, I'd be so proud of my kids. Earning their own money, paying their own way already? Yeah. There's a story There's a story about a kid that had the cops called on him. Lawn mowing business. Yeah, I heard about that little black kid. Yeah, and he now has a massive business, and he's not even 18. Oh, yeah. He's got his yeah. cousins and his sister and other people. Yeah. yeah, massive business. He's and got a uh, thousand upon thousands of dollars worth of business. You know what I say to that? Go get yourself. Yeah, take it and run. I'm proud of you, because that is amazing. <laughs> I wish we had more inspiration like that to do that stuff. Yeah. Hmm. Villager! Right I'm working on him. I'm biting my tongue. I want to say something, but I won't. <laughs> yeah, I saw that story. He took, um, it, he took it and made something positive out of it. Good. Yeah. Don't do it. And there is one called Ulala PSI Bradley. Okay. Yeah. Uh, it's a bro boat! It's a space one, but. 
Yeah, just going back to. Get back here for the table chip. Yeah, but just going back to it. Hopefully they change their mind and could people buy the game to let you stream, and if not, we'll get some content out afterwards. It's gotta be weird though, because Nightingale's supposed to come in around that time too. And I don't know, it's gonna be an interesting fall. Oh, that probably is taking a beating. That thing is Pillager too. Pillager's currently, which currently taking a beating. <laughs> We'll see what it is. PSI. Oh, you touch my tra la la. PSI. Mining class one. Ooh la la. Ooh la la. Ready? Are you ready? Yeah, I'm over there. Great, now I'm thinking back to the future. Ooh la la! Ooh la la! Ooh, baga! 98% shields. And uh, gone. Uh, <laughs> uh, I feel like the food goes a bit fast. It can, I don't know why. But. <laughs> That's fucking awesome! Yeah, Baldur's Gate official release is late August. I do have the game, I'm just waiting for it to fully come out. Hey, Ruggles, you better be careful. I got down to a whole 96.8% on the shields. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I went below 50. It, I didn't go below 50, and I only have 1,400 shield points. <laughs> An another Promethean mine? Hell yeah, and magnesium. Um, what the is that? What's the matter? It's called a dreadnought. Uh, <laughs> no, you see it? No. It's called the progenitors. Something is turning orange on the map in front of this brabee up here. Unless it is his brabee, you just do a weird That's shit hilarious. Your ship, your little ship, is showing up in a different spot on my game. Uh, I'm coming oh, yeah, to you so that. until we figure out what it is. Yeah, I'm right here next to the ship, so. Yeah. Oh. Interceptor. Good God Almighty. Excuse me. Bam! Oh man, these rail guns are so fucking sick. Oh, you learn unlocked rail guns? I've been using rail guns on my little fighter. Oh, from your creative oh, mode? Yeah. Oh. This is but since I've unlocked it, yeah. I've I've made more rail guns to put on it and ammo, so I got like four of them that I shoot at yeah, a time. Yeah, I've been wanting to put rail guns on my capital ship. I, but I'm choosing the cruise missile first. I can't do much of this. Oh, this thing that's floating. I can't. I can't click on the boxes. Oh, what was that? It's me. I'm blowing up I the. Uh... Okay, I thought something just shot at no. you. No. Like, what the? No, I'm shooting the thrusters so it stops moving. I don't even know if they're running. There's not a single generator left. Now it's going the other way. But, speaking of Imperium, I actually enjoy the game. I, although I did see a rant on Twitter today about Seven Days to Die, Imperium, and others. And somebody's ran how Imperium's another game that's suffering on the slow development because it's only done by like one person. I'm like, okay. How fast do they want this one person to be? Oh, they, wait, they wanted to be a whole team of. Yeah. And people forget, guess what? Programmers cost money. It's the same concept with YouTube. Editors cost money, and if you want a good editor, you're probably spending a minimum of sixty to 70000 a year on an editor. Yep, that's how you do it right there. You just get up against part of it, counter thrust. <laughs> Ooh, la, la. 
I can't even drop a cord, which to me means so hard. Oh, because it's still got a core. I've never seen that mm -hmm. before. A sensor what? repair kit. Yeah, it's for uh, if you run into a distressed call and they need their stuff repaired. Let's see what I can find. I know one guy was asking me for some stuff. I couldn't even get on to one the of his ships, but I haven't well. seen him. That's because there's a bunch of invisible glass in the way. You gotta shoot it. Found some cheese! Yeah, I think computers. So, while we're chatting here, I'm curious. I'll not ask you first, Bradley. What do you like about Imperium? What is, like, the biggest draw that this game has for you? Um, uh, the open world of where all I can go to. And how I can build. Um, I mean, I can take any little ship, make it, or I can get one of a factory and make it, but the, I always like open world things. Like, planet to planet to whatever. Mm -hmm. That's my favorite thing about them. And you don't have to follow a story to do whatever you want to do. Yeah. This is why I play games like this. You make you your story. And that, that, that is a huge thing. So what about you, Stone? That, what he just said right there is why I play these games. Because you're not set but you're not set to a specific script. And your survival is on you. Also, Larris finds the lack of faith in our eating pizza uh, disturbing. And the Empyrean says we're always eating cheeseburgers, not pizza. <laughs> in real life, yes, but I, I can eat pizza cheese. every day. I can have cheeseburgers. Yeah. So what about you, Ruggles? My favorite thing about this is how much you can actually um, explore. I mean, build, explore, attack stuff. And you don't have to, do it, like you said, you don't have to use their stuff, you don't have to build your own. You have a choice. Yeah. I find it more challenging to do what I'm doing Oops. with the Legion here. Oops. So, my answer is pretty much mirror to yours. The fact that we can do true exploration, the warfare, the ship battles. I, I wish that they didn't shoot like crack troopers where they can just hit you in one shot. It's on ours now, Stone. Ground combat when you're on foot. But the exploration, the custom building, the being able to, okay, get a blueprint off a workshop because they built this really kick-ass ship or the fact like you said stone you guys found a really cool ship in the middle of nowhere so you guys just took it home and you're rebuilding it that that stuff's cool to me you fucking salvage man it's fucking awesome what was that bradley i was trying to figure out i was right next to the station all of a sudden i'm like way far away from it I was going to go inside and look at this one. Now, I will say what I would love for this game, and this is where I probably will differ, I'd like to actually have NPCs commanding ships to follow you like X4 does. I would love to actually build cities and stuff where they're producing resources for you, things like that. I'd like to actually have negotiations, ship alliances, so... You literally do work with the Polaris, you know, say, hey, yeah. we will trade this or, hey, how about a non-aggression pact where we work together and we fight the Xerox or we request favors to go attack the Xerox here and they're, you know, and have these massive ship battles. 
I feel like that would be icing on the cake. Oh have yeah. Have Xerox randomly attack your stuff too, if you just if that's your enemy. If it's somebody else, you know, that type of stuff is big to me because I like X4, but my problem with X4 is once you get to a certain point and you start massing fleets and space stations and everything, the game just breaks goes to a crawl because it's not using C GPU, it's using CPU. And it, and there isn't a core alive that can keep the processing speed of it up. And it and it's not their fault, it's just since the game has to run and calculate so many factions and so many things, it it has a hard time being able to do that thing. And I think that's what I would like added to this game. It makes it even more wild. But for the game that it as it is, it's still with a horde. But <laughs> I said my piece. So, what do you think, Bradley? They could do to improve it. Um. Let's see how it's... I do like the if you could get them to like. Do those treaties and things like that. Uh, I was trying to think what. I don't know. It's hard for me to tell. I've only been playing this for a little bit. It's only for the horde unless you're Tori. Then it's for the herd. Right. Um. Oh, I want some ideas earlier. Now I totally forgot. More interactive totally NPCs. Forgot. That would be nice. Like Starbound, for example, you can build cities and they run around and do stuff, they, and you just collect money from them. But, collecting the fuck out of container extensions for you guys. Okay, wherever, cool. Wherever I find them. Appreciate mm -hmm. it. Because we're all wanting them for our controllers. Yep. But, Bradley, you said you had ideas? Earlier, yeah. Now I've drawn a blank. <laughs> oh, what was it I thought? I don't know. I have to think about it again. How long ago was it? <laughs> it was, was it about, about the, was it about five the time hours ago. Sort of flickering about ten minutes ago. <laughs> it's Wait, about the time a, Stone got online. There was a light bulb, but then it just went dim. It dis <laughs> it disappeared. Uh, and Alaris says, "More Stone versus twenty-five ship armadas would make the game better." <laughs> Did she like that? She's got your number tonight. <laughs> well, he basically did. I I yeah. got in my fighter and let him command the Cyrus, <laughs> and I went out and I took out, like, a capital vessel and damaged one while he was trying to attack the Cyrus from behind, and then Stone came back after he finished the, the one he was working on off and blew it up. <laughs> took the big one first. I got the, the two smaller ones. Cool. I, I had to get that pillager yeah. down. Oh, yeah. The pillager is nasty. It can have heavy lasers and plasma. All right, so the next one I'm looking at is Tulo Delta A. Can have. Most of the time, it's just got regular lasers and those uh, jet legs, though. Let's say we go back to Haven, repair. Nearby. Did we go out and check out the... Blow some shit off. Drop, yeah, Haven drop some shit off. Asteroid field? Oh, did. It's in our the system we're in right now. Oh, it's if all I, ice. I, I guess we could. Oh, is that ice? Yeah, I thought just, it might be. What's that? Oh, yeah, never mind. It's just since ice. If I give you a cargo controller, I thought maybe it was uh, calling this. Yeah, that's why I skipped it. it but, oh, ice. in the ship? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I, I can I can put a, a cargo box in there we for you. We need Ruggles to come here and go see Mandy. We'll do that when we get back. You with Tulo Delta then? Uh. It's nearby. We'll join you after we it's do a few things. Camera. Oh, you don't have sure giants. We're just exploring. Uh, I'm pretty sure there's a cargo controller in that medical. We don't need a cargo like controller. I can just give you a cargo container. Yeah, saying, put a put a controller in a. Why did they give me a controller and a couple of uh, extensions down? I don't for know. Runs. It's T U L O. Yeah, yeah I know. Just it's just for our big runs like this. 
Okay. That's fine. And you want gamma, right? I'll show you. I'll show you where we can or put delta. it. What's, yeah, what you Tulo, say? Delta. delta. T U L O. I got it. Right? It's like next door. I just went. yeah. There it is. For some reason, it went to the wrong one for me. You should still have room up front, shouldn't you? Come on. Lock target. Yeah. Yeah, that, that little Ooh, this area up front that like that cubby. Blocks. Yeah. Yeah. I remember you had that up there. Damn, this is gonna be a huge. That's why I left this before. Yeah, I know how to fight a ship. Holy crap, bro. <laughs> There's so what I do with many that, places with that, uh, here. Imagine what I can do with that monolith when I get it decked Jesus, out. the fucking spirit of fire sticks out like a sore goddamn thumb. <laughs> oh, yeah. I told you, I can see that fucking two miles out. You fucking... Oh, yeah, I, Jesus. the two I always see is your ship and mine. Yep. Everybody the spirit else and the is, liberty. Oh, and the base. I see the, the base, too. I'm like... Good lord, our ships are huge. <laughs> last, last night, I, I started hitting the brakes at two miles out. Mm. When I first saw the when I first saw the spirit, I started hitting the brakes. <laughs> You're like, uh, yep. Until I got to the repair platform. <laughs> You're like, I know where I'm at. Yep. I didn't stop. I didn't actually get to stop until I hit the repair platform. Oh, I bet this one has a lot. Oh shit. A lot of pentaxid. It's called a crystalline moon. That's what I'm working on the thrusters for, so I can move it away from this. Because this is just where it stopped, and I did not have a lot of control. Okay. I have not left Tulu Delta. I'm just waiting okay. for you. Oh, I'm here. Okay, let's go start okay, with go. Beta uh, 4. It should water. repair it's now. It's an asteroid. Yeah, you know what I'm about to do while it's doing that, right? What? I'll move the ship. Offload, offload these parts for, the, uh, for that ship. Five, four, got it. Medium thrusters are going. Uh, ammo Locked controller. Targets. Ah. So yes, there is a there is a container controller. Yeah. And I, and I will leave the extensions in here. Okay. Yeah, I need to put some. There's uh, thirty-two extensions. I need to put some resources in here because. And th and this is all uh, spotlights also and those. Yeah, I know. It's... Oh, so I'm jumping. <laughs> we do have ventilators missing. I will need the doors. I wonder why. Polaris. <laughs> yeah, but asteroids unknown. We don't. Okay. It, it shows one, but it's invisible, which means you don't know what the hell's in here. I might need those because Mugglers. they blew half the doors open on this thing last night. Oh. So continuing the conversation, Stone. Yeah. What would you like to see them improve in this game? Less elevator bosses and door bosses. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so bug fixes mostly. Yeah. It's just really minor shit. Yeah. Well, I want to see them build onto it, but yes, I do want bug fixes done too. But I want, I would like to see them build onto it. You basically could build your, literally build your own faction, living, breathing faction. Player two. Right, but I mean, with the NPCs, so you could go down yeah. to the a place and you made a city, and you got guys walking around and shit. Yeah, that's what Far and Creel and all those are. Yeah. And I, I'm surprised at the number of people that don't realize that Far is not. A core faction. Oh yeah, I'm sure a lot of people Same realize thing. that, but it was built specifically for a server. Yeah. So what about you, Ruggles? Uh I would like to see more interactive uh NPCs. Like so ones kind that of like what I'm talking about where you can have them do shit and build. Yeah, yeah, yeah basically build make it feel like you're building it a yeah like when i put the the crew in here in the ship actually have them move about you mm -hmm. know with their little stations and shit instead of just stand there like robots put yeah. a put in a you know a guard and and they actually patrol shit like that yeah i'd love to see stone where, I, where'd you put that 
What, the container controller? Yeah. yeah. Medical. Just, oh, medical. what was that, okay. Kai? Just a second, I'll be done moving these parts. Uh, okay. Guys. Oh. Yeah, there must be an active the core there. there. Yeah. Was an active core. Whatever I leave behind is all you. Copy. I'm just flying over this way. I see not one thing. I gave you some of those drone things because you helped with the oh. one. Well, yeah. the plus side is I see more uh, Xeno Zeno? material. Yeah. I need yeah, 45 more to finish one. this. Okay. There we go. Copy. Copy. Let me see what all. I was doing direct fire. transfer so it was faster. Let me see if there's some smugglers. Right, Cerulean right. Star Convoy. Well, All right. I, need those, I need to find those hardened steel blocks too, so I can put those in here. So the container controller and the extension. Just a couple of just a couple of extensions will be fine. Okay. I'll do just those. For a long haul, so that we can dump a lot more stuff into that without filling up your other boxes. Copy. And that'll be exclusively for the group parts. And, stuff like that. and then I can change the the. I already changed the name of the dump. Dump. I thought it was Osiris. <laughs> Not, you know what I mean. I had a cargo <laughs> dump. Or do you, does he? Not so much there. Okay. Um, this is a medium thrusters. Okay, so good news is I am down to only needing 31 more. I'm looking Ooh, I found for, you another I'm wreckage. For those steel blocks. Nice. Might have that on it. All right. Where did we put those? Okay, so the the uh, the extensions won't show up under cargo boxes. It just counts as part of. No, just under under controllers. Oh, cool. Okay, I found them. I found the hardened steel. It was in the uh, hardest controller. I forgot. To yeah. Yeah. I don't see one of them. Oh, is that it? No. I'm still getting used to the idea that we can do it with the ship. All right, I, I changed the uh, container controller name to Allied Cargo Dump. Yeah. So. There is definitely none of that here. This one, Kyle. No, no, Zeno still. Okay. Steel, cargo no. boxes, and, and this and wreckage I'm going to go check out. Externals. Okay. Small thrusters are showing there. Mr. Sandman. Cargo, hell yeah. Bring me your dream. Do, 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 do. Put those two on, on this ship. Um, I got. Did I give you those other two advanced thrusters that I put this in? Is like at one medical. Yes. Other one we found okay. Was huge. Because you should have had like four. Yes, I got four. Did it have, okay, is cool. It in, in a whole entire so I'm like, ship? I don't no, need them. I'm just giving them to you. Scattered. Yeah, I know. I need them for this ship. But I mean, there's a that one that we found in big chunks all over the place. Yeah. That's what this one is like. He's going to oh, blow right. chunks. He's going to blow chunks all over the place. If you blow chunks and she comes back, it was meant to be. If you're going to spew, spew in this. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I don't love that movie. A refrigerator. I feel bad for anybody who can't tell you what movie that is. <laughs> found me a fruit pie and I'm going to eat it. Fruit pie. Okay. I think I've got the bottom just about done. What? what? Oh, oh no, I see snap. A bad wolf. I think I got the bottom just about sealed up. Oh, I found it, another fruit pie. Except for that Save broken out later. arm, I think I'm sealed up on the bottom. He sealed himself in, he said. Yeah. <laughs> Should have just named your ship. Tardis, if you're gonna go bad wolf. No, no, no. Don't forget you your do. salvage drone you know swarm. What you should do make a small vessel okay. and make it a telephone. I'll get him in a minute. I'm just doing. I just... could just put. Yeah, I could do that. I I already know how to do that. <laughs> now that you say that, I don't think I could I could do that without a problem. Uh. Okay. It's it's still good. Some people do remember Doctor Who, the good times, not the bad. You mean Doctor Who, not the Doctor What the fuck? Mm. That's been <laughs> like the last three, four seasons. Yeah. God. Oh, Kai, I've been saving hydroponics units. 
I got 19 okay. so far. Yeah, if you just want to add them to keep where you see the grow pots, because all those vegetables are ready to pick and put in prime so we can keep making more food, so. Awesome. There's a lot there. I'm gonna harvest some stuff. But there we go. I've been also seeing on uh, Twitter a lot of people saying, Alright, which one of you fucks caused season two Velma to continue? <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, uh I did make a smart story. I said that would be the hate watchers that watched it to gripe about it. They're the ones at fault. Yeah. Yeah, I know. A friend of mine on Discord sent me the funniest article. Uh. The name of the horse was Spook Party. <laughs> <laughs> Say that fast. <laughs> so, so sorry to disappoint you, Laris. Yeah, there is for sure a season two. Why do you think I don't watch this stuff? I don't either. Because if you watch it, they count it as viewers. They consider it a success. You. That's why hate watching is bad. That's oh, severed ship. That's why guys like Howard Stern made so damn much money. People hate watched him when he was younger. Here's a question. Who made the glam the uh who made the shock rock scene where it was? The what? The shock, shock rockers? No war and who made who made them as popular Primus. as they were? No. <laughs> Just the very Baptist coalition that was all over the news trying to get them banned. Mm. They gave up millions of dollars in free advertising to millions. the very people they were trying to get One rid of. One billion dollars. One billion. Billion with a B. Oh. Uh. I did find a severed ship. Yeah? We've been finding a lot of cool shit. Not gonna lie. Mm, I'm gonna take them. Oh, wait, I gotta get rid of Nick's face first. <sighs> Where's my ship? Well, I show you a lot of cool shit in this game. At this point. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Can, I got shit in the harvester. If you could somehow anchor this ship and put it back together. You could take this one home, <laughs> but I, I don't. I don't really see any way you can do it. Really. It would be cool to do something like that. Yeah. Anchor oh, it back together. Warp core. Okay, we're taking that too. This is warp, warp drive. It's been tested. Tanked. If he's got a fusion reactor, take that too. Yep. Everything. <laughs> everything is. Everything yeah, must go. Everything uh, is fair around. game. The five this server had, had two giant generators, so large generators. I'm getting them. Advanced? I don't know, and I don't care. <laughs> yeah, that's the, the large ones are the advanced ones. All right. So it just says large generators, but I'm going to take them because I can always scrap them anyways. Nothing like finding beautiful salvage. Uh, is that an art? Oh my fucking god. Yeah, I'll take that. Hell yeah. yeah I don't want you. Bam. Alright, I am ready take. for the next mission. So, what system are you guys in? We're at too low something. We're way out there. T U L O. Yeah. Too low delta or too low yes. gamma. Too low delta. Too low Check. delta multi pass. How can you hear him if it's too low? If I can't. Oh, I found me a gun. Okay. I, I know. I know some people here are taking you. I found an in-between point. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> oh. You shut up, you. This is nice. This is all large composite. Yeah. 
Yeah, something had a really good time eating through the chewy center of this place. Was it crispy, crispy peanut butter? It was. I don't think I want doors. Okay, these are all doing something. Get all these constructors going. Well, I got some salami for you there, Stone. <laughs> I got your salami right here, he said. <laughs> Shlama lama ding dong. Yeah, well, I was going to hate to inform you, but that's deserved. I'm married. <laughs> it was an offer. You an just offer had can't to. Refuse. It's an offer, offer that you I should not have refused. <laughs> it's an officer. It's an officer you can't refuse. All right, you can teleport to me when you're ready. I'm putting more blocks now. Happy. <laughs> I'm back to my obsession here. <laughs> my it obsession. is a really cool fucking shit. My obsession. Niru Beta. Did I get your stocko yet? Oh no, I did not. Really, this was a hell of a find, sitting out there like that. That was a hell of a find. I keep finding ships blown apart. <laughs> Sorry. Next time we'll leave a couple hundred parts for you. <laughs> Too low delta. Jumping. Hoppity hop, 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 hop. Uh, you see, the challenge is like this right here. The damn jigsaw puzzle of a... That's the part that I like the best, though. Trying to figure out how to fit these damn pieces in here. Oh, yeah. What system did you guys go to? We are Mich in Michigan. I mean, <laughs> we're in Beta Four. Beta Four. Okay. There's another wreckage I want to scout because if it has that's Zeno, the Polaris, isn't it? Yeah. Start with them first. Uh, let's see. Where did I do? There it is. I will. Yeah, there's a wreckage I gotta find because if it. I saw that you didn't see, because if it has Xeno material, I need to harvest it, because I'm 31 from finishing that damn thing. Oh, that's why I came over for this one, to look to see if they had any Xeno, and they didn't. Yeah, we, we haven't even really uh, hit too many of the asteroids. I was going to hit the Sathium. Cerulean Star Convoy. Yeah. Makes sense. Get the shit out of my hand for now. Is that yeah. what she said? Shit With anger. authority. It's a party. In your pants. Yeah, there's a severed ship. There's a party in my pants and I'm not afraid to show it. When you look to the uh, side, you would say, wouldn't you fucking know it? Oh, dear lord. Uh, what direction headed to? Hey, I'm looking. Did we miss uh, this right away? Here's that. That's an awful far way out that way. Yeah, I'm gonna hit this one. I think that wreckage is the one I was looking after. Hoping it has, you know, material. 
It's not like you have a lot of choices, but I'm either doing it that way or this way. Or this way. It's up, up, down, down, left, right, left, oh, right. Captain PA Ruggles. Up, up, and away. Captain Struggles. Hi. Following us. I am here. Or over yonder. Brilliant star climb. Does he have the struggle is real? Oh wait, that's that's a ship that's done some work on. No, <laughs> no, it's it's the uh, the rugglesnuggle.com where you get uh, to snuggle. I don't know if I, I trust that snuggle. It's it's all right. It's copyright claimed by my wife. Uh. <laughs> Which ship did you change? Did you take the uh... Osiris? Oh, I thought you took the Spartan. I thought you took John out. I could have. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna paint that on there now. <laughs> you put John on there. Yeah. Just don't put Grand on there. No. John Grand. It's John Spartan. Nice ammo. We find a lot of good shit with the loot. Cancel. Uh oh, hi there. Hi. I'm looking for the ship I just there it is. That's what I need. That hopefully it will push me to the end where I can finish this damn quest. Arkin Sunseeker. Go after the smugglers. What happens if you go to the smugglers way station? Shouldn't I mean, be we're back or neutral. Just curious if there's anything there the I could buy. What the fuck was that? Destroyed the core. Ah. I need to get the Xeno material. Go for it. For this quest. Promethium pellets! Yay! I am. Almost there. Almost there. Damn. I'm gonna need. 13 more Xeno blocks I have to harvest. So those things right there in the wreckages have them. Damn. God, so close. So fucking cool, all this shit that is in this game. It's like, this is literally space! And you got all these fucking rocks and debris and ships and... Uh, I get it. It looks like that one Xerox station kind of. This pirate way station. Go inside. I have to go inside. Pirates. Hydroponics units. Don't mind if I do. All work and no beer make something something. That's just hard to steal. Oh. Can't go inside. Oh, the Polaris. No, it's yeah. the pirates. Oh, there's nobody here. It says not allowed. Yeah. Only, only allowed for the cool kids. Yeah. I thought maybe there'd be something we could buy or sell, or yeah. there ain't even no NPCs inside of it. No, yeah, why would You're we not do cool that? Enough for the cool nerds club. No. You're not turtle enough for the turtle club. Turtle, turtle. No, access to nine. I'm gonna blow him up, fuck him. You're, you're, you're gonna what? Whoa, whoa, blow whoa. Blow up, blow up the pirates. Oh, I thought you said something else. Yeah, but that puts us back at war with them. Uh, That's not what I was talking about. It sounded like he said something else, you know what I'm saying? Oh, uh, yeah, well. Well... Whatever he wants to do. Blow, blow him up, Buck Muckum. <laughs> but but, but this, not those exact but words. But if you notice this map, there is two Xerix Empire places we should not go. But there's... I think we should. <laughs> <laughs> you feel free to take the bad wolf into those places. <laughs> <laughs> and we'll solve ah. it later when we get enough firepower to take you down. Um, uh, con uh, considering uh. it... It took me, uh, I, I got just, I only lost like four pieces off of my ship taking out a Corvette that was a 
Um, specialized Corvette yeah. wasn't a normal one. If you run into a bunch of those, you're fucked. I'm gonna use the restroom. We'll hit that Satium, and then I got the next one. Oh, I'm on the out. Satium right now. You are okay. I'm gonna use the restroom, and I'll be back. And then, and then we'll do number five, which is occupied by pirates. Be right back. He runs into a pair of Tavera at the same time you get a Braveheart moment. Braveheart. The lad is pretty sure he can get me out of this, but uh, I'm pretty sure you're fucked. <laughs> I'm pretty sure you're fucked. I actually did have somebody tell me he said Lord when he, when he was talking. I was like, you ever heard the Irish say that word? I've never heard one actually say Lord. No. I've heard them say Lord. Oh, good Lord. It's usually how they say it. Uh, yeah, yeah, we bunny laugh. When I found out that I didn't have any Irish in me, I was a little sad. I'm like, huh? <laughs> well, you didn't find somebody to put a little Irish in you? I always thought I had some Irish in me. My, I think my wife's got Irish in her, but... Oh, did you do a DNA thing? Yeah. I'm, I've done that. I'm like a third German. I'm like, oh, that's cool, considering... Went and wanted to learn German in high school and didn't even know I was mostly German. And then, followed by that, English, Scottish, and then uh, Baltic, Eastern European, and Nordic. Like, that's quite a mutt mix. Yeah, I have a. Uh... I thought I'd feel a wet dog every time you got in the room. Hey. <laughs> Just because I'm distantly related to William the Conqueror does not mean. <laughs> Which is true. I've I, Ancestry.com. I've traced it all the way back. I'm like, what the shit? Well, you are a mutt. Yeah. You made it yourself. Like I said, yeah. I thought I smelled wet dog every time you got in the room. It was it William the Conqueror through Matilda of Scotland? That that's my that's part of my lineage. And, and on my, my mom's side, there is uh, William Wallace, related to his cousin, yeah. which is really fucking cool. I'm related to Nile of the Nine Hostages. Nice. So he was a king of Ireland. That is awesome. Isn't it you funny? Know, you look back, you're like, I'm former royalty. <laughs> you, you know what's really funny? Listening to the number of people that claim to be experts on on the Irish. Yeah, you that know, aren't. You, Lord, uh, Lord Stephen never really existed. Really? The, the person that the character was representing, I'll tell you, never existed. I'll tell you, there was never a king in exile of Ireland. There was. I mean, the English... And the or British ruled over Ireland for the longest fucking time, enslaving them and all that shit. The Scots yeah. fought back all the time, lost a lot. That's why there was so many Irish fighting alongside alongside Robert the Bruce. Yeah. Because the guy that was I think I mean, that's were, all that was constantly was. yelling "My Ireland," why are you saying "My Ireland"? You're saying "My Ireland." Yeah. Like I said, more All right, I've returned. <laughs> I've returned, and Claire says, Whoa, Brad, this is a PG-13 stream, not Triple X. Damn. <laughs> and it's whatever I want to make it. It's whatever <laughs> I want to make it, you see. Well, how do we know it's PG-13? We do, we do spend a lot of time watching Ruggles get fucked, usually by himself. <laughs> yeah, that's true. He's not wrong there. <laughs> All right, I'm at, I'm ready to go to beta five. Okay. Beta five. Oh, it's right here. Okay. Yeah. Lock on target. And warping. Target. 
Bay. This one is a pirate faction, so we could see Xerox. And we could see bandits. For fuck's sake, where's my jump point? Another bandits. Wreckage. Yeah. Hmm. Enter a big piece of wreckage up here. Let me turn off my turrets. So it doesn't blow it all up. Bandit robber located. Coming my way. There's three ships moving? Holy shit. Oh, there's something red behind me. Oh no. Bandits, okay. Well, I guess ah. today we're gonna play a test on how fast to watch the bandits die. How fast can you run? Oh, he's already running and I ain't got to him yet. <laughs> and I'm the weakest link. <laughs> Goodbye. You, you are the weakest link. Goodbye. I, 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 always, I always loved the way she did that. Excuse I, I, me, Mr. I just Pirate. absolutely love facing off against these bandits. Well, you know, I guess I should make sure everything's on. Well, I'm sure you do. Why aren't my shields on? Son of a bitch. Because <laughs> you turned them off. I you did hit, not. You hit X? I might have. Promethean asteroid, nice. Shields are X-rated content in this game. There's I started to say... A bandit browbeat, huh? Yeah. Bandit robber. Which one's closer? Oh, the robber, yeah. Hey, robber. How you doing? <laughs> Goodbye. He'll yeah, have... If he's a robber, he's got credits and shit on him. Yeah. 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 Some of them will have bandit tokens. Which we got, we, we gotta, yeah, we gotta get real chummy with the colonists to do that. Uh oh. Ooh. Uh, there wasn't much left of that. Just I was now. gonna say, he went boom, didn't he? <laughs> <laughs> More than yeah. that. Oh. I've been a bandit thief, alright. Uh, turn my turrets off. Uh, why can I not find? There is a browbeat and another one out there, just FYI. I see him. Did you go in and check that wreckage? I'm going over here now. Okay. Got the insignia. Alright, where is... Take their ammo. Bandit thief, dead ahead. Holy crap. There's not much left of this ship. <laughs> um. Oh, we got a crewman here. Jesus Christ, look at all the pirate crap. Yeah. Oh God, can I navigate through this shit? I believe in you. There's another wreckage. Yeah, there ain't nothing left of this ship. He's... Who are you going after, buddy? I blew that ship in half. I don't even know who I'm shooting at. I can't get turned around quick <laughs> enough. Oh, that one right there. Probably. Oh, another looter. Yeah, there he is. We got thief, probably, and looter. <laughs> trio. He's just trying to circle asteroids to get away from us. <laughs> he's like, he's, screw this shit, oh, I'm out. He's fucking scared. He's like, F this shit, I'm out. <laughs> Basically. Somebody's hitting me. I don't know who, but... Oh, he's stuck on a... He got stuck on an asteroid. He's screwed now. Oh, I know what that feels like. Oh, the pirates are even shooting at him. Oh, the pirates? Yeah, they don't like yeah. him. Yeah, they're not part of the bandit uh, pirate faction. Nope. They steal from the pirates. Pirates don't like that. Oh, that was a big boom. Bandits will steal from anything that's out of poles. Yeah. I think the only one that likes them is Xerox. Not even them. Oh, no. no they... He's down. No. Wow, a big chunk of his ship just went missing. Big 
I'm just kind of hanging back watching the pirates fuck him up with me. <laughs> yeah, they got a Corvus in there, so what do you expect? Oh. Okay, Corvus everybody stop the firing. Yeah, the Corvus oh. seen up a bandit. Yeah, they'll do that. Okay, I'm gonna go on board here and loot this bitch. Yeah, the Corvus get hold of the bandit. Hey, he's a happy with the Corvus. Yeah, there ain't much left of that. Where's the ship at? Medical. Me. Oh, look at all these containers just floating around. Yeah, yeah. you want to loot those. Yeah, those are all loot. Yo. You'll be busy for a bit. Go get the go get the rail loot while he's busy. There's the wreckage I want right there. Here's my pirate thing in Bobber. and take it home. Yeah? There you are? No. Just missing the midship. The front half is still here. What the fuck is this? <laughs> I found ham. I'm gonna eat it. <laughs> I'm gonna eat that ham. Yeah, the front? Well, there's no... What is this? Oh, it's an armor. it due to security protocols. Yeah, we have to blueprint it. I wouldn't blueprint this. There's, <laughs> there's nothing missing. <laughs> there's nothing I here mean, to there's blueprint. Just a big, I mean, there's just a big section in the middle missing. Gives you something to start with and create it, Mo, but that's about it. Yeah. No weapons on it. Man, there wasn't much loot to this. Sometimes there is, sometimes there isn't. It also depends on how bad you destroy their supplies. What is all this shit floating out in the middle of space here? That's probably yeah. the leftovers of their cargo containers. Yeah. It must be, because it's a st whole stream of... Yeah, go collect yeah. it. Oh, damn. I just happened to look over and seen them. Yeah, you need those. Uh, I don't need yeah. that. Hey, what do you know? It's rolling now, because I got medium thrusters on it. I'll take out maybe. Oh, hello, magnesium and promethium asteroids. Undelivered cargo. I remember there being a big, uh, big bada boom over here. Big bada boom, big bang. Oh yeah, she stops good now. Oh man, it's a lot of shit. Found some ham. Mm. It was delicious. Don't make fun of my ham. I'm not. I found. I said found, I, found, I, found, I, found some. a couple of hams. That's for sure. I'm just you saying, like I some? found some and it That'll was delicious. For me today. Copy that, Stone. You, sir, have yourself a wonderful night. I think I made some pretty good progress on that ship. You did. Yeah. It's fucking awesome. 
It's like a jigsaw piece. Mm -hmm. Jigsaw puzzle. It's like a jigsaw piece. The whole thing is like putting together a jigsaw puzzle. Oh, I can see that. Some things I may change up a little bit, though, because it's a pain in the ass. Understandable. I still got strawberry pie. Strawberry pie. Good you too, have brother. Night, have a good one. And now the real party begins. Did you? Did I what? Uh, I just wonder if Kai got this wreckage. Uh, There's no stuff here. What's well, kind of interesting? What the frack was this? Is it, I found the the remains of the Hall of the Galactica. The Galactica. <laughs> I mean, maybe. Destroyed satellite. Destroyed satellite. Did you already pick that one? Which one? The one you're at. No, I just got here. I didn't know if anybody been to it or not. I just want to look and see if there's any... Whoa, that's a big ass ship over here. I'm it's a turning off guns. Pirate ship, I believe. Oh, I see some more bandits. Or no, that's probably the ones we already killed. Yeah. Whoa, this is a big ass ship. Whoa. Hello there. Relatively and still intact. Yeah, I hadn't gone in yet. my loot in there. It doesn't have any thrusters. Kind of looks like the ship from the black hole. The Black Lagoon. The Event Horizon movie? No, uh, the Disney movie Black Hole. No. Oh. Have you oh. ever seen that one? Negative. I have. It's a good movie. Let's see. Right, nothing in here. Colonist light missile turrets i got eight and colonist bolter turrets i got 11. unfortunately nice. most of the components are missing on this that i don't think it's worth salvaging no may, it may not be i mean there's literally nothing although there. might be an interesting blueprint to work with yeah here let me drop one down I saved it. Maybe it's something that can be built in salvage uh, mode. <laughs> Drill. I didn't want any. Oh, yeah. It's a wreckage. There is a, a tank somewhere on here. Right back here. Is your core still down? I, I can't grab it. I'm sitting full. I can grab it. We never know what we're going to need if we find a real ship. Right. Oxygen tanks. Okay, we're all the way at the back. Alright. Oh, Jesus. There's an RSC or whatever over there. This thing is all sorts of fucked up. you want that, RCS? Up. Come on, grab these. Just in case we do find a ship that needs something to get out. Uh, is this a thruster? I found a thruster. I could see potential in this. Yeah, in creative mode, but I don't definitely don't see it. Right, right. Take it in creative it. mode and see what it does. Yeah. I don't see anything oh. else on this one. What are, oh, there's an armor locker. What is this? Oh, that's an armor locker upside down. Oh, hey, Ruggles. 
I don't know if you want any armor lockers, but there those are. Oh shit, I just hit my head. Yeah, for the hell of it, I saved his wreckage long. Yeah. All kinds of mining lasers and just drive through the field. <laughs> yeah. Is there anything in these little pods outside? Oops. Whenever you guys are done, go ahead and take that core out. Oh. Are you done, Ruggles? I'm done. Alright, what is this thing? That's just a small constructor. Okay. I'm gonna turn my turrets back on now. I never turn mine off. Oh, sometimes I do in case the ship gets destroyed. It'll do that if it's got power. Safety note, I'm gonna hit that real quick. And then the next jump point, let's go to once once we get that safety m it itantia. Itantia. It's near next door to this. Looks uh looks good. I'm just gonna hit the safety m first and I'm gonna scout ahead. Colonist yeah. frigates mining. Where did you say we was going next? Magne magnesium's here. Well, always need magnesium. Yeah, I'm going to go for that right now. Is that a different system? No, it's just southwest of this one on the map. I T A N T I A. B O L O G N A. It's that little small system there. Yep. Gotcha. What? There was one way out here. What is this? That has something undiscovered, uh, beta nine, beta six. It's an asteroid field like outside of this. Yeah, I figured I was gonna, we'll hit that one next. Okay. Just since we don't know what's out here. It could be pretty easy, but who knows if there's really nasty Xerox out here. Right. I don't feel like having any of us get faxed in the machine. For sure. So far it's quiet here. Oh, you're already there? Yeah, yeah no, nobody's bothered to... Uh... Yeah, he said he's scouting ahead. Happy. The magnesium's hard to see in the sunlight. It can be, yeah. Okay, I see it. I had to get in the shade a little bit. Mining. 
colonist. Ooh. Yep, yep, yep. They need to be our friends. Let me go back here and see if they got anything. Ooh, that smell. Gotta smell, smell that, that smell. smell. Smell that smell. <laughs> You know, I used to hate that song when I was a kid. Now it's like, whatever. I don't know why I hated it as a kid so bad. Cut the cheek. There's a, there's a lot of songs that, you know, I, I always made up my own lyrics because I would say what I thought it said. Yeah. Right. I think we all did that, though. <laughs> Oh, I guess I could put some fuel in my tank, huh? Yeah. If you want another adventure, probably. Mm. Yeah, that's a oh, wrong button. I keep hoping we get one more damn wreckage. I need 13 more Xeno blocks harvested. And this long, painful quest is done. <laughs> Now you just need your high heels. Iron or Neosden. I don't think there's any more magnesium on here. I'm taking the one dead ahead of me. That's a heat signature if you want to take the other one. Let's see if I can buy anything over here worth buying. Copy. I got to figure out where you're at. I am going 1 o'clock-ish. Towards the smuggler hideout? Uh, whatever it says, white heat, heat signature. Yeah, there's two of them. An oh, that's kind of yeah, cool. Yeah, there's looking. another one. You're closer to the other one now. Okay. I'll go to the one by the smuggler hideout. Yeah. I like the looks of this ship. Corn thruster array? Yeah, you're closer to something else. I'm going to stop at that. Yeah. Okay, you found a kobold over there. What is this one? See, this is one of those times I wish I could uh, blueprint friendlies. Yeah, they want you to take it, though. I know. Titanium out here. What the hell is this? Alright, I'm going to see if I can get on your ship. I'm going to see if I can get on this. Whatever the fuck is this. Well, it's got a core, so. Is it something big? I mean, it's a big structure. Huh. I, think it, I think it's hollow on the inside, kind of. I can't. Excuse me, sir. There's generators. He is selling and buying neodymium. Laser drill, drill, drill. <laughs> Buying them. Okay. You ain't got nothing to sell but a little bit of neodymium. Is there anybody else on this ship, sir? Ah. Breaking through. Enclosed advanced in th thruster. Let's, let's get it. This thing's got a lot of advanced thrusters. Holy shit. That's a good thing. Now 
I'll take him. Give him the stone. Yep. Can't ever have enough thrusters. No, yeah, need him for that ship. Make them. An absurd amount of resources, yeah. I wonder how much trouble I get into by starting mining on that same asteroid. <laughs> a lot. I'm not gonna find everybody where y'all at. I'm clear out on this titanium asteroid now. Rebels is at some thruster near the cobalt. He can go for the cobalt. I was way out in the middle of nowhere. Makes me wonder how much stuff we can miss because we don't have, we don't go out far away from I where we are. I usually try to a little bit, but in some places, like mining stations and stuff, the most of the action is in the center, and it's almost rare if there's anything actually outside that center area. <laughs> yeah. as much titanium as we'll need it at some point for anything really. Pink Panther. It's more like <laughs> Shit. Um. <clears throat> All right, titanium's done. I'm looking at the next one, which I believe, yes, it was pointed out by Bradley Beta Six. Far left corners of the sector. Awesome. We'll do Beta Six then. It has an unknown there, too. Yeah. Dippers. And I'm off. Me too. This is a pretty empty planet. Nothing much there. Pirate asteroid, we do have a heat signature. Beta 6. Ooh. Burnout Raycon vessel. Where the hell is that at? <clears throat> trying to find it. It's way, way out past. Oh. I see. Oh, uh, we it. have whatever is coming our way. It does have movement, whatever that red heat signature is. I'm coming. Oh, I see the burnout recon vessel. I just found it myself. <clears throat> I'm looking to see. I see. All I care about is the Xeno steel. Uh, I don't think it has any. I'm not firing at it. Yeah, I'm not either. Which means there's no core in it. It's still mostly intact inside, but we do have. I wouldn't want to mess with that yet. We do have something coming towards us. It's and it showed up on me first. It's 18 km, and it does have movement. It did. Unless that's me. I'm going to go check it out. Uh, if it is a dreadnought, gentlemen, change coordinates to... Boom, we're dead. Okay. Yeah, beta yeah, 2? Yeah. Beta 2? Oh, I don't know. 
Um, I don't know. It's a... There's magnesium. Go to Can Carn Carn Dam. There's two magnesium nodes on there. I'm locking that one in. Okay. Hopefully we're not bouncing from one trap to the next, but we'll see. Okay. I'll check out this. Uh... It looks like it is from a distance a space station. So. Okay. I might check out this recon vessel. Okay. It's this cozy miner. You must have like a better scanner than I got. I use a long range. It's uh, just an advanced upgrade kit and uh, a few little parts and pieces, and then. Okay. It's used. It, oh, 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 oh. What? Aluminium. I yep. Am, uh, I'm diverting course and going after that one. It just popped up over here from. Oh, Neodame. I got. Uh, I was going after this one. I've got to get that long range in. I don't know why I don't. Oh, it's just copper. Yeah. Well, the next ion. Yeah. That gets destroyed, you know. You can see what these two Xerox stations are, because now that I can see that they're stations and not capital ships, we just have to be ready in case they call in backup and it is a capital ship. Well, if I'm you. I'm hoping that the two items I turn in gives me the 300 that I can actually make the cruise missiles right now whenever we stop at a good place to trade i'm going towards it to see what it is oh what's this down here i'm shooting at interceptors okay interceptor, interceptor. fantastic it's intercepting us with its love oh oh you got it they're hiding on the other side of the fucking asteroid, you pussies. <laughs> Damn. You're hiding on the asteroid. They do that. They went yeah. stuck on the asteroid. We got Bradley the Barbarian. You bunch of pussies. <laughs> <laughs> There's literally like one, two, three, four, five of them just sitting here on a asteroid. Like, like do you want to go out? Nah. Do you want to go out? Nah, man. Is there anything good on the interdictors? Yeah. Ammo. You can find a lot of like Sometimes plasma ammo and. Kids, Hold on, yeah. I'm I might be stuck. Uh oh. Well, not really stuck, stuck, but there we go. Uh, okay. Let me go get some oxygen first. I need to put you on the station, buddy. Or on the station, on the bridge. You left, Reynolds? Oh, I'll be back. Oh. I gotta head back to Haven for a minute. Let's see what these two are. It's only two jumps away, basically. Basically. <laughs> I should take a screenshot of all these just sitting against. Xenu Shipyard. Holy cow. That one had quite a bit on it. Scoot, I'll help you. Scoot, scoot, magoot. He's wanting a cover to go to sleep, I guess. <laughs> Aww. I picked it up off the floor, I know. There you go. He's like, I want my blanket. Give me my blankie. He has several blankies. 
Let me let me guess. He has a big pillow and a and a, a recliner too, or a pillow or whatever. He has Postural a giant PA. pillow. <laughs> he sleeps on about every recliner around. The couch is his favorite in the winter time. Oh yes. Yeah. He get we have one of those covers over it. Mm -hmm. and he'll. Mom got it so he wouldn't like get hair all over, but he crawls under it. <laughs> <laughs> that's funny and I have a giant bing bag by my bed he likes to sleep in too mm -hmm. dogs are amazing I miss having a dog it's nice when my folks come and visit because I get to hang out with their dogs which is Where pretty much all I did today don't get me wrong I love reptiles there is something about dogs that I absolutely love Oh, it's a shipyard. Yeah. Can we blow it up? I don't <laughs> know if we can take on a shipyard. I have never tried. Well, I don't even know what it looks like. I'm afraid. I'm, I'm not scared. I don't think me and Ruggles have never took on a shipyard. Uh, uh we did. Uh, was that a shipyard one we that, took on? That was. Oh, I thought it was a supply Let's depot. Some reason. Oh, I still got plenty of ammo. Smuggler stash. Where the hell is that? I hate when something pops up and it's not in your direct line of sight. Yeah. I'm going after the other red signature. Let's see what that is. There's something else out here. Is that something? Uh, I probably shouldn't touch it. It's an actual, actual thing. Well, I don't. I thought we took out an orbital station, not a shipyard. Oh, I've taken it. Oh, I'm sorry. I've taken out a shipyard, but. And I have plenty of ammo on me, so. Yeah. I got more than I realized. I made a bunch earlier. <clears throat> Which is why I always have harvesters. So I can just grab material from jump to jump to jump. Get stuff made so you can just transfer it real fast. <clears throat> oh, yeah. Basically. Oh, yeah. Bonk, bonk. Chicka, chicka. <laughs> bonk, bonk, bonk. Chicka, chicka, chicka. Yeah. <clears throat> <clears throat> and... Another Xena ship here as well. Okay then. Curious what this one is. And guns I'm are behind loaded. Behind you. <laughs> Shields. Shields are loaded. Guns are ready. Okay. Let's get this party started. I'm gonna. See, I just like to go by full speed. <laughs> yeah, I want to test what this thing's capable of first. For I contemplate full. Barrage. What I should have done is locked something on target behind it. That way, it can just hit, boom, and warp. Oh, I think you'll be I fine. Ain't warp. I don't. I think you'll I don't be fine. Foresee warping. I'm not worried about it. I wouldn't be worried about it either. Stay on target. Boom, I'm dead. You are? <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I was about to say, damn. At you five kilometers. You said got fucked up. You got knocked the fuck out. Mama says so. Alright, 100% shields, level two. Okay. Coming in for a pass. Power. Good. Test this bad boy out. Oh, dear lord. 
make sure I'm still making fuel. I am, I am, I Mama am. Mama says knock you out. Mama says you still making that fuel. Try some. All right. Their shields are already down to 40%. I'm eating them like nothing. With my positrons, all that shit. Eating them like pie. Oh, my shields dropped real quick. I got I'll be there in a minute. I'm okay. All right, moving fast. I got to I just have to back off for a second. Let my shields regen. Shields are still offline, which is beautiful. I want now. That's a good thing. ate through their shit like nothing. All right. That's shields a good are back thing. back at 100%. No. Going in, their shields are coming up to 10. Don't you just love that? Yeah. And there's a ship inside. No, there is a ship in there, isn't there? Yeah. I'm gonna, man, they're, oh, oh, bob and weave, bob and weave, 13%. Yeah. <laughs> Get out of there. I, I... Uh-oh. Oh, oh shit. Backup's arriving in five minutes. Copy. Um, I'll be, I'll be there. I'll be I'm there. I'm trying to figure out. Wait, did we have, put... I have a jump point. Okay. I'll be there. I'm tearing them up, so. I'm worried about what might jump in. Where did it? I'm. Why can't I find him now? Oh. Okay, there you are. Shields are back up. All right. We giving a warm reception here. Shields are holding just beautifully at 50%. As I am literally basically playing a fighter and just encircling the damn thing. That's what I usually do. I'm going to try that now. So you're in too low delta? Uh, I cannot look at the map right now. I think, yeah, I think, I think, it's I think that's beta it. Beta 6, maybe? Too low delta, beta 6. Yeah, too low delta, beta 6, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I, I've damaged them severely. Their uh, shields are coming back online pretty strong. Yeah, oh, I just hit something sweet on that one. Bam. Hey, what is up, Chris? Wishing you a We're gonna have to happy pull out very Father's quickly. Day. I don't know how much more. I don't know what they're bringing in. That's okay. <laughs> Whenever you want to go, you just say, and we're out. We're not going to warp. We're just going to pull out. Because my shields are back up. I've taken out most of their guns, I think. Because I've just. I don't even think they're shooting at me anymore. They still got missiles coming at you. I see them. Well, then they're just chasing me. Yeah, I've got most of their shit down. Their guns. It's negligible now. Because that'd be nice if we get that ship in there undamaged. I of course, I don't know if... I don't... I don't think so. Alright, you said... Beta 6. Beta 6. If I remember right. Yep. Yeah, some... I'm below it, and it's not hitting me at all. 
Yeah, I hit some hard. Shields are still at 93. Alright, I'm coming in to give you a hand. Yeah, because they did call reinforcements. I don't know what's coming to say hi. Hey, I'm not shooting at it anymore. It's down, yeah, I think. Yeah. 60 seconds. Pull out. What do you pull want away. To do? Pull away. Follow me. Follow me. Regroup. We don't know what's going to jump in. I'm heading your way. Because we've disabled it, I think. We just got to Oh, yeah, because sure. we're not shooting at it anymore. Yeah, I think we took the core out. Yeah. Well. But I don't know what's jumping in to say hi. Regr <laughs> regroup with me. That's all I got to say. We're pulling back. If you can catch up with us. Oh, I'm catching up to you. Okay. <laughs> the cavalry has arrived. Did you bring Spirit of Fire? I sure as fuck did. Oh, good. <laughs> I'm going to come around you and hide it. <laughs> oh, okay. God. All right, we're turning around. I have no idea what's coming. Fucking... Check your ammo status before that damn thing warps in, whatever's coming. I'm I'm reloading all my shit. We're four point seven away from that shipyard. Checking ammo. M two hundred charges needs more. We got three three thousand volley of rockets, fucking okay. twenty six hundred artillery shells. I need M Oh whoa whoa. Whoa. Whoa, whoa. What? Don't scare me like that! I'm looking at my damn constructor. Oh, me? Uh, there was something. I just seen him jump in. Okay. They're 4.8 out, and my gun fired because I thought I was on my... Okay, they're 4.8 out? I don't We're see moving him kind of our ways. I don't even see him yet. I don't see anybody yet. I don't see any. And I'm, I'm 10 out from you. Yeah, I don't oh. see anything right now. I watched him warp in. You, oh god, it's right in front of me. What is that? You know how much fuel it took how to fill this up? How is he in front of you? I don't even see him. Probably an absurd amount. 3,000 oh, hydrocells. What's the timer left on that thing? Um, I see a timer. Oh. For I'm, your generation. Oh, for my fuel? Yeah. 2,500 just... minutes. What okay, is that? So, so you still have time. I have yeah. Time right. The ship is right. Destroyer, Xerox Destroyer. Oh, Destroyer. Oh, oh. boy. <laughs> we need to yeah. go, don't we? No, no. Get, Get with me. Regroup with Ruggles. <laughs> Made in voids. <laughs> well, let's... He's behind me. Yeah, hurry to Ruggles. Because we're going to get behind it, and once Ruggles starts in, I'm going to break to the left yeah. and start unloading every fucking thing. <laughs> that evil laugh. Now you yeah, know why I brought well. this, baby. Yeah. <laughs> coming your way, Ruggles. Copy. Where is that fucking uh, destroyer? Just straight back the way I came from. He yeah. wasn't showing up on my sensors. I had to get yeah. two kilometers. Yeah, he was showing All up. Right. All right, I'm covering around. <laughs> I'll, I'll wait for you. <laughs> if we're going together. You want to yeah, bring a destroyer, yeah. bitch? I got a battleship. <laughs> yeah, all right. I'm okay. I'm behind right. you. Uh, I'm coming in behind him too. Uh, <laughs> so cavalry has quickly. arrived. I you thought I seen more than one jump point at first, but it was only yeah, the one ship. Yeah. All right. I'm coming He's in. To your left. Okay. Okay. I see him. Breaking down. Yeah. Oh, it looks like he's trying to make a swing for you guys. Yeah, I see it. <laughs> Look at all that. <laughs> all right. Good God. All right, coming in on the other side. <laughs> Look at the fucking rockets on this shit. Oh, my God. Bro! <laughs> uh, with the oh my god! Spirit of oh. fire, here we go! <laughs> yeah, here we go! Oh god, stone's missing out. Oh, Artillery yeah, away. Oh. oh my god. He's not even shooting at me. Oh god, he's getting fucked up. Yeah, I'm firing all out on this shit. Okay, I gotta get. Somehow I got too close. He's only taking. Oh, we just hit. <laughs> oh, fuck. He 
He's only taking 6% off of my shields. Oh, oh my man. god. This oh. is like fireworks shit. Here. Bro, he got he just, whatever, he just fucked hit me with up. Damage my shields too bad. Uh. <laughs> is it still even firing? Dude, he's yeah, getting it... fucked up. Yeah. Oh There's shit. Left of his backside. Oh god, we blew an entire wing away. He is Yeah. He's fucking stuck on me. <laughs> oh shit. Yeah. Oh, oh there it went. There. Alright. Oh. oh he's fucking tailspin. <laughs> fucking yeah. tailspin, bro. Oh, oh We're decimating this shit. There I, and I'm still at 95% shields. Fuck yeah, you! <laughs> oh, oh shit, he's getting. There ain't gonna be nothing left. Yeah, there's nothing any left. There's gonna be nothing left to loot. Because, he's still fucking yeah. going. Yeah, because all of our artillery. You got a lot on there. I've got a lot. Jesus, he's. Gonna, oh fuck. He's melting. Oh god, how is he still moving? I don't know. There's nothing there. Your guess is good as mine. Fuck. Oh, there's another one. Oh. Yeah, that, he's dead. And that's it. Another yeah, explosion. Yeah, <laughs> Jesus. Oh. Uh, right, I guess it's boarding uh, time. I don't know. It's spinning. Jesus, there is nothing left. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go out and see this. Right, oh, stop. bro. Bro. Oh my god, there is nothing left inside here. Really? We, oh yeah, we fucking need Holy shit. shit. Oh my god. The power of Spirit of Fire. Oh, whoa. whoa. Oh, what? Something whoa. else. Oh, he, he's... He jumped. He, he warped out. <laughs> he said, get what the fuck that? out, get the fuck out. Oh Retreat. Oh, How god. is that even possible? That's hilarious. Okay, now I guess we can go board the Xeno station now. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, I'm that's like, so hilarious. So the other one may call in reinforcements, too, once we actually engage, so. God. Let's finish taking this one down. Oh, man, that that was amazing. Are you amazing. going after the other shipyard, or do you want to check this up, shipyard Let's out Let's check first? this one first, because I don't think he'll call in reinforcements, because I think we took out the core on this. Yeah. I'm not, I'm not getting shot at anymore. I am so. so glad I came. I had a feeling... I'm like you I. What you said the uh, reinforcements. <laughs> yeah, I was like, you know what? Fuck it. I'm like, I grabbed all the fuel I had made up, and and bam. Yeah, it's dead like, in the oh, water. Oh shit. So. Yeah, but that ship's intact, I think. Yeah. Inside. We're gonna, yeah, we're gonna see if if it's part of the base or its own thing. I'm gonna go and get. Whoa. Do we have some jump in? Let me know. Any scanners? Anyone running scanners? No. I okay. I don't think anything jumped in. Okay, I just saw a flickering light, so I wasn't sure. Alright. I'm going in. Any two. Let me get my shotgun. Oh, it's this thing. Alright. Oh, yeah. This ship took a beating. Oh, yeah, it did take a beating. But it's... it's oh, wait. Do we have one of these? Oh, there's some alive in here. Yeah. I hear him. Yeah. I need to kill some. Elite down. Alright, I'm about to join you. I had to pause for a minute and put a O2 thing in here to fill up my air. No worries. For my I'm suit. I'm glad you brought that in because we would... I. We probably would have took damage if we had stuck around. Oh, yeah. What? Sh oh, then what is your shields on that? Uh, my shields are... So I think I got 41 on. 41, 700. Oh, so we're tied on shields. You just have a lot more... Oh, yeah, my, my firepower and blocks are, you know, epic level. Sorry, I move oh, a little. Oh shit! What was that? Seems like I move a little slow, but I'm actually moving at a hundred what, meters per going, second. What's going boom? Oh, Zerix. Bitch. Yeah, there, there's a fight going on. 
I've broken a leg. Thank you, Xerox. Well, nobody's going to want to come bother us because uh, old spirit here will fuck them up. So this is my key for uh, fuck around and find out. N nice yeah, to work. meet you. Oh, my God. It spawned two Xerox right behind me. They'll do that. I killed him, though. He killed a man. He killed him, though. Just to watch him die. I found the core to this place. It's mostly intact. Whoa. Oh, I... I actually have a blueprint for this mostly intact. <laughs> Spirit of Fire found some targets. <laughs> Where is their spawn point on this damn thing? I don't know. It, it, it's just the Sunax, I think, that we've taken before. I think. Found their mess hall. Elevator. Yeah, I'm not seeing their spawn point. Oh, shit. I see you down there, bitch. What are you? I'm Batman. Oh, well, there you are. Thank you, spirit. <laughs> Two for one! <laughs> spirit of fire is like, oh, no, you don't. Might have been a civilian. Did it, do we shoot civilians? You can kill them. I don't think it'll yes. do anything. Fine. Oh. Whoa, what's hurting me? Man, there's a lot of dead Xerox. No. There is. Does that count? Does the civilians count for me? I don't know. There is something in here. Oh, God. What did I, I did, just... I did find Whoa, 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 whoa. I found a bunch of them. There you are. Oh, he killed me. <laughs> oh, he killed me too. Damn. Uh, current location will do. What the fuck? Are you kidding? Oh. Damn, I'd have been better off to spawn on my ship. Had the long run. That's what I did. I spawned on my ship. I will next time. I figured it just put me back closer than that. I think this is just the one ship that we already got at the main base. Right. I think it is. I'm going to kill some. Oh. Because I can get. I can't hit the core. I don't. I have explosives, but it's not going to break that core. I don't think. Um, I can get on one of the cannons. Oh, there's some mechs in there that are dead. Let me let me get on the uh, the captain's cannon. I'm gonna check out the space station, Zenu. I'll I'll lay down some suppressive fire. <laughs> oh, I'm not shooting him. I can talk to him. Oh, by the way, I have an advanced warp drive on here, so I can go pretty fucking far. It's a lot of fucking guns. Okay, combat. fuck you. Yeah. <laughs> I just shot a traitor right in the face. He wouldn't talk to me. Where did you see a Xerox? Oh, oh, oh. I hear... I hear weapons fire. Yep. Sentry. I need to go to my ship and empty my shit out. Do you know where the core is at? I know for the ship, but I'm looking for the space station. I'm in the space station now. Oh yeah, because they got plasma cannons and sh or ion cannons and shit on this thing that we can get advanced kits from. Oh. 
Then what? I started. Oh god. Get it, rugs. <laughs> What? There's a lot down in this, down in the shipyard. Yeah. Be very careful. Is there anywhere I can shoot in from the outside? Uh, yeah, if you come, if you're down at one of these ends. Oh God, what's shooting at me now? Hold on. Here, I, I am butted up against. Let me get my cannon and see if I can see you. Somebody got it. I did. I'm sniping. Okay, I see you. I'm just being something stupid right now. Okay. okay. Yeah, I know. I got... Oh, they have a ship in there. Yeah, there's two pieces to it. The nearest medic home spot. Oh shit! That's my ship. All right. Oh, yeah. Got him. All right, fuckers. Basically. Is this seat? No, it's not seat. No material. Come to Papa. Come to Papa. Right, see you. I'm bringing the sniper rifle. Whoa! Shit! <laughs> I just seen you come flying out of there. Where's my sniper? Oh, some blew me up. One shot. Oh, an explosion killed me. I don't know what hit, what went off in there. Oh, uh, that might have been my auto turret. Sorry. I can't control what it does on its yeah. own. go into somebody's ship to use their medical device? You can go into my yes. ship if you need. Yeah, you have to go on a ship. I got one right on the device. bridge. That's no biggie. If I die, I die. <laughs> Alright. I see you the assault what? mech. Oh, he oh, fell out of space! Yeah, he will. Yeah, I think the core is somewhere in this yeah. vicinity. Shotgun on. Oh, there's a Xerax. Oh, no, that's Ruggles. I said there's a Xerax. Yeah. One over here somewhere. Oh, cool. Rich ass. Ah! There's. Got him. Got I just him. destroyed one of their thingamabobbers. Turret. Or two turrets down. Alright. Reloading my sniper. Oh, incoming. We've got two hostiles. One down. Oh, what the fuck just... 
I got him. Oh, there's another sniper. And they want to play snipey, snipey, bang, bang. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'll pull out my sniper. Home I'll spawn. pull out my laser rifle. Stand back whilst I whip this out. Oh, it spawned me in here. Oh, in my place? Yeah. Uh, Is this the way out? Oh, no, this one. Yeah, is. right here. Where'd you go? Yeah, either one of them doors. Uh, Zerks are down. Copy. If you need food, I got some. No, I have some. I just... I feel like, I don't know, I feel like my hunger thing just runs non-stop. It has to do with your stamina, too. Turn it down. Sorry, boys, you're not the only sniper in town. Bitches. Screw you, merchant. Give me your lead. Yeah. <laughs> Kai's the merchant of death. Okay, give me some shotgun shells. I'll take that. Whoa, whoa, whoa. It was a spawn beacon. <laughs> got, I just got a shot fired. Luckily, you're able to see him. I have yet to be able to see him. No. There's loot containers all over the place. Mm -hmm. Empty. Uh... We found a whole lot yet. Okay, we need to find. Nothing I can't use, though. Don't remember. Up the elevator here. It's in an odd fucking spot. I know that much. Fly the ship around until it starts shooting at something. <laughs> Parts. Where was that fucking guy at? I shot in the face. It was up here. Mr. March. Talk to me. I want to say it's in that bottom thing. Down here. This thing. I'm gonna, I'm gonna shoot the artillery shells at where I think it is. <clears throat> well, that's a weird place for a box. I'm surprised oh. we didn't take out the core initially. Mm, thought I found it for a second, but nope. Turrets. Captain's artillery turret. I thought it would be over there. Hold on, I see an arrow pointing down. Let me see what this is. Please verify access privileges. I got their access privileges right here. 
<laughs> Alright, let's see. Right down here. Down, down, down. A burning ring of fire. <laughs> okay, all it did was drop me right down. I see. Into the, the hangar area. Shooting me, I saw a spawner. You're welcome. <laughs> yeah, for some reason it's still showing up online, so no wonder. Not anymore. You get a That's the bedrooms. Could it be on the opposite side where the ship's at? Could be on the ship. Yeah, I bet it is. I bet that core is the ship, which is, so this is actually a base. It's, let me see if I can find a way to mark it. Yeah, the it. shipyard is a base. Okay, so we can yeah, so, here. so the ship has, has the core in here. It's, I don't even know how, to, how you don't have a hole in the ship see it hold on think can i see it from my end no. <laughs> uh, there's a I, there's a yellow fucking thing over this here, dead yeah look for me look for me and okay. where i'm facing where i'm at is directly where the damn core is so you have to shoot at me shoot through me directly to hit the core okay where are you let me I'm I'm on the opposite right. side of the the bad wolf. Yeah, you need to be on the opposite. I'm at the core. Yeah. I'm part at. Unless you can destroy it. I we just need the artillery to shoot it. Hold on. Hold on. I'm firing a laser. I'm coming around. Okay. Coming around the mountain when she comes. Oh, what explosives out? Uh, um, they don't, I can bro, throw. You just passed it. You just passed it. I did. Yeah, I'm firing at. You're too uh, low. I'm too low. I'm firing a gun shot at it. Through the hole you have to do. Let me come right out I mean, where it's at. Alright. Uh, Rugs. Uh, look for me. Okay, I'm. You're down too low. If you can reverse. Uh. Then you, then you could point right at me. Damn. Oh, that's where I need to aim at. Right here, where I'm at. You see me? Oh, I'm underneath the damn thing. Yeah, Hold you on. need to get up center. You're too low. Keep going backwards. Keep going back. Keep going back. Going backwards, as your ship's just too big. All right, the, go backwards. The cannon is right in the middle of the ship. Yeah, you the need one to on my bridge. See where I'm at with your cannon. Turn right the other way. Other way. Other way. Turning. Turn there, right, right here. See okay. Me? Okay. Right, Zooming in. Right, right where I stand right here. If I shoot inward, you'd hit right the core. Right. I don't. I'm I don't at. even see where you're at. I'm looking at the front of the ship. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Let me see something here. Hold on. Right ah, here. you're over here. Yeah. Okay. I just came towards you. If you can. Oh shit. Oops. All right. Look. Yep. Oh. Yeah. Oh. So what that that. So with the artillery cannon, if you right click. You can... Okay, cool. What did you do? Um, I saw an explosion. No, that... 
the artillery cannon, if I right click, it'll make the um, artillery shot an electric pulse. I wonder if that'll take out a shield. Wow. Um, it's. Can you? You know what? Put a Do hole... you see me? Oh, right there where he is, yeah. Um, right, so, so if you put a hole right here, right where I'm uh, standing. Uh, okay. Like, like right here. I mean, he could literally maybe hit it from right here. It's at an angle, but I don't know how. Yeah, he could just. Yeah, keep pushing through that. Just fire at that. Fire at that. I'll be inside. Let you know when you're in. Another one. Okay. Okay, it's you're through. Head. You're through. You should be able to see it. You may have to zoom a little bit more, but it's open. You missed. Hold on. Hold on. Can you see yeah. me? Oh, wait, wait, wait. It's open. I should be able to take it out now. Yeah, if we open it, that's all we need to do. It's gone. Right. Copy. I got a core. I got it. I have three cores. One of them was yours. It, yes, that core oh. was the shipyard. That's why we couldn't find it. Uh. So it isn't a ship. Just... It was... Oh. It's already Dre. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. It... I had one on that, That's what I thought. I, I was thinking about it. And I'm like, I think it is... It's in the ship. Yeah. There's a lot of good stuff on this thing. I would... So, what I would advise... You got tool turrets on yours, Bradley? I have it on one of my small ships. I was going to say, we could use mine. But I'd rather you guys back way out. I've got like two or three tool turrets on mine. Hold on, I'll yeah. back my. I don't want to hit either of your ships. So. Are you are you getting the? Yeah, that'll give you everything. Turret. Won't you, won't Did you it? get the turret? I didn't even see a turret. No, I got Bradley. One turret that was underneath. Yeah. Okay, good. Because that was the only one that was there. Yeah, we took out all the guns. All right, I can I can back up. Yeah, you guys need back up quite a ways. Yeah, I don't have any tool turret or harvesters uh, on this. Yeah. This is strictly for does. boom booms. This is boom so booms I'm only. I'm going to go roam around while you're doing that. I should be. Oh, there's two two tool turrets, so it wouldn't take long to harvest it. Right. I'll yeah, get in there with I'll get in there with you. My ship will run support for uh, covering fire. I just okay. gotta get behind you. Because we got the other shipyard, and I wonder if that'll call in another guy. And I'm disappointed we didn't get to wipe out the damn, uh, big boy. I thought we disabled the damn, I just don't know how the hell it still managed to warp out. Yeah, that's weird. That shocked the hell out of me when it did that. I'm like, what? I've only used three, this entire time I've only used 3% of my power. <laughs> Good. That's excellent. I was worried you were gonna burn the shit out of that power when you said you put yeah. that mission. It's like, oh, I'm just flying around, see if there's any stuff. May as well. Oh, or... If I needed to get home in a pinch, I have a th extra th thousand on me. That's why I've been like building that shit for the cr like. Yeah, I got me a crazy platinum ingot. Another one. Got All right, knife. I am at your okay. ship. I just gotta find. Entrance. Yeah. Oh, I found another. Is that a turret? No, damn it. But I found another turret. And I'll move us in closer. Where's your entrance? Uh. It says exit. Right here. Ah. That's where I'm at. Okay. Alright, where's your. Okay, here's the seat. Okay. Alright, move us in a little closer. There's two tool turrets under harvester. Okay. Make sure we're centered a little better. I'm just roaming around because the inside this wreck. <laughs> All right, I'm moving in a little closer. All right, we should be good. I'll take whichever one you're not in. Okay. Really? Nice <laughs> thing is, since we have a corn there. We'll get all the blocks as is, so we don't have to worry about breaking the shit down. Yeah, just don't aim at the big ship in the middle and take the core out. We'll be good. Yeah. It's not going to be able to fly. 
No, I know. No, no, we just, otherwise it becomes just parts and not the blocks and stuff. Right. I think we destroyed the gravity generators because couldn't run and do anything without jetpack. I got a hole in my ship again. This time we had nothing to do with it. I'm just kidding. I can't <laughs> <laughs> I oh was like, God. no, this time you're not going to be able to blame us. <laughs> I'm hoping there's some Xeno blocks in here too. Just need 13 more of those damn things that have been a pain in my ass. I think I'm just gonna sit here on my ship and try to sort some of this shit out. That'd be a good idea. Oh, we're even getting combat still. That's nice. Right now, because I right now, I, with me reorganizing everything, I don't know how much more combat still I need for Liberty. I'm probably pretty close to where I don't, but I don't. I can't really tell yet. I love these tool turrets. Yeah. It, it makes things so much easier. Yeah, I think I'm gonna build. I think on that. Two nap that we got that looks like the bird of prey. Yeah. I'm gonna see if I can hide it on Liberty, and it's gonna have two or three tool turrets on it and mining lasers, and that's gonna switch to being the mining ship primarily. Because if I'm taking Liberty out nonstop, I'm yeah, have both capital ships hidden on it, depending on the situation. That that's kind of my plan with my Spartan. It's small enough I can fit that under the wing. And I can mine with it. And then with my other one, my drop ship, if, if we go need to go down planet side, I can use that planet side. Yeah, because then I can store the creel on the actual Liberty instead of putting it on this one. Same with the tanks. No, we'll give you that back. And I don't have to worry about any of that shit anymore. But yeah, these turrets are so fast, and they have such a great range. That's great range, even from here. I just put a hole through a uh, bad wolf. <laughs> Don't ask me how. Well, you had to go. You had to go through his ship first. I'm behind it. Oh. <laughs> he was. He's thinking ahead. <laughs> so, so, so is. I mean, now it's a holy fire instead of uh, the spirit of fire. <laughs> I I am very impressed with the performance of the spirit of fire tonight. I yeah. I was. I was not I, expecting shit to go down like that. I didn't think you had that many shields. That's why I was like, wow, you did take a pretty good hit and you didn't lose anything. Yeah, it was, he was trying. He, he was trying to get me, but I, <laughs> I got him first. <laughs> Except oh, I, I, I learned from that incursion with me and Stone fighting in Xerox Homeworld. So I made a few modifications. I found that they have very little defense from behind. So if you can somehow get and stay behind them with mobility, you can take out their systems quickly. But the trick is to stay behind them. Yeah. And that's hard, which I think there's other ships that have very good rear defense that you're not going to be able to just try to keep up the speed and just stay behind them and just wail on them. I just had a feeling that that's only going to work for Xerox mostly. God, we're eating the station up. This would take forever by hand. Yep, that's why I, that's why I put this on here. I just want to make one capital as my salvager, and this as my, basically my warship for if I need to go on land, because I have a feeling by the time I'm done, yeah. even if I do everything, I don't think I'm going to be able to get Liberty on the ground. I just, I, 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 I don't think so. I don't know, which would defeat the purpose of the, the hangers there, but 
not necessarily, because I can you still use it. I can still angle it where you can drive off of it and then go into the hangar and then drop down until we need it. There's different ways to do it. Even if we use that small vessel that Bradley has that's a hover ship. Right. Well, it's like my Osiris battle cruiser is going to be an exploration ship that's an all-in-one encompassing ship. That one I'll keep mainly at, at base. Um, well, I, I'll use that one mainly, but when we go out deep, I'll take the Spirit of Fire. Uh, I don't even think deep anymore. We ran into a Dreadnought close to our system. Remember? We yeah. Were gonna go well, then we'll, we'll just need to make sure that we can make shit tons of fuel problem is, is that fuel's going to eat us alive on all of our ships. Well, if we only have some of the ships using fuel at a time, because the other ones will be off and we're not using them. Right, I turn all my, because I, I turn all, all of them off. food on Liberty once it's done. And that's going to still have solar panels on it, because the purpose of that is it's going to be auxiliary power when I don't need it. But lesson learned, I'm going to leave all generators on because I believe as long as they're not exceeding power, they stay idle. Which reminds me, I need to put solar panels on the Spirit to help conserve. Yes. Because, like, on this one, you could turn it a little bit towards the sun and you'd be in good shape. Yeah. It's like on my Spartan, like I've, got, I've got a couple solar panels on that, so it's always got power because we're going to have to get a lot more mo auto miners and find very heavy rich promethium planets than what we have in order to really be able to supply a lot of fuel for our ships and I think that's going to take time but as long as we can use the base to base hopping once we get it set up that's not going to be an issue. True. The wrong one. That don't matter. That's why I like these. Is like this. Is this? These my this lasers. We can with multiple gunners. We can shred this stuff down. I mean, we've already got half the fucking station. Yeah, I'm gonna move forward a little bit. Copy. Yeah, I'm still fine. Yeah. Right now I'm revamping Liberty, so I think I may be done with what I need, but I, I'm still hesitant to say I'm done. I just got to reorganize it all. Well, of course. Because I, uh, <clears throat> and what, my goal is to definitely get down to about 130 KT on it, if I can. Because right now it's at 230. There's probably yeah. ways way more than mine. Well, yeah, it, that thing is like four or five layers deep of combat still, and then space, and then even more combat still. That thing has so much combat still, it can't move super fast. The combat still alone is what's weighing it down right now. And I and I was looking at some of these other battleships they have and stuff. Yeah. As long, you can use carbon substrate to really offset it. Just in and out. Yeah. Oh, I don't know. I heard somebody come in earlier, but... Oh. I don't know. I didn't notice that. I 
am looking forward to the Conan update next week, too. What's changing on that? A lot of the entire combat system. They're doing an overhaul on it, and you can make your own banners for your clans and some other shit. And then there's going to be three chapters, and I guess dungeons, and they're going to also add sieges. You can do PvE sieges, so we can set up our own trebuchets and attack bases and stuff. Which before you could just make them and not use them. Yeah, unless you were in PvP. So I like that idea. I like, and purges are going to be more robust, so it's going to feel more like a seven days to die. They're reworking that whole thing, so. Right. I'll be right back. Copy. Which personally, the idea of an even better tower defense with Conan style really excites me and that's one of the things that I had mentioned because that's the draw of seven days isn't the zombies it's the custom building it's the tower defense if you really can utilize that stuff holy shit that, that's true I mean we can just do Conan instead of seven days seems how they I fucked it up I still plan on doing seven days. We still have a lot of followers that watch seven days, and true. And it's and truth be told, there's still a lot of opportunities for us. It's a it's a it's a pretty much becoming a Minecraft thing, but and they know that. I think that's why they're doing the screwball shit they've been doing, which sucks. But I mean. Hell, look at Minecraft. It's owned by Microsoft. Same yeah. Doing this it's just thing. annoying that the fun pimps don't bother optimizing their shit. It runs so fucking laggy when you got all them zombies. You want to face all them zombies. It makes it challenging. Yeah. But not when your computer is having trouble keeping up when, you know, you yeah. can play almost any modern game except for this one that's 13 years old. Yeah, that's my gripe with them, too, as they because they're like, oh, we're not going to do it until it goes gold. It's like, dude, what the fuck's wrong with you? I mean, you know, there's a lot of people that love your game, and multiplayer is their jam, but you're... I don't feel like if it wasn't for, like, Neebs and some of these other channels and the modders, they, they they wouldn't would fucking relevant. matter. They wouldn't matter at that point. Yeah, I, I feel like the content creators is what bailed their ass out. Well, it's like even with with Imperion here, the this is so specific, you know. Which but is why I was but there about is an interest with it. It's just a very smaller issue, and I don't know if it's for the lack of advertisement, space niche, or. But I think space is on the rise. Everyone's tired of modern, you know, sh modern warfare shit. Everyone's tired of World War Two. Everyone's tired of, you know, I've never all that. cared for that shit, to be honest. I've always cared about space and, and doing that fun shit. Space shit's always interested me. There's just never space. been anything good. Space and westerns and medieval and fantasy have been my jam. I would, honestly, if Seven Days to Die wasn't zombies and it was bandits and stuff, I'd still play it. Because I like the tower defense and the building and stuff. If they had NPCs, I mean, like Sengoku Dynasty and Medieval Dynasty. Great games. I mean, Sengoku I haven't played yet and it's not out, but what they've shown, they've done a lot more passion than Wild West Dynasty. My issue with it, it's just city building games. It's building dynasties and doing cities, and I'm curious what the multiplayer is going to be like, because I like that type of stuff. But, that said, wouldn't it be cool to be able to build your city up into a kingdom, and you fucking overthrow, or you participate yes. in the wars, and you command your troops, like, almost like Mountain Blade, kind of. Uh, Mountain Blade was where you can command your troops, but you're not immortal. 
which you can make yourself a little stronger, I guess, or whatever, but if you command your troops in the middle bow, you tell your archers to move here, and in real time, all your forces are fighting. Or, you know, there, there's a siege, and, the, and you're using their base that castle that you built to literally hold off waves of enemies. That type of stuff is amazing. But nobody wants to do it. And I feel like that was that would be the pull that I would do in a game. Would be the RPG and survival, but the opportunity to build stuff and have wars and stuff. I know folks like Kel just want to raise animals and barely fight, but there's a whole world of people out there that want to have the action or they fight, oh, yeah. you know, at their base. You know, and, and there's going to be those that, you know, we put in protections that say, hey, at the game, if you don't want your shit destroyed, hey, guess what? We'll put in some for you guys. It's just a little bit of coding. Just like, you know, like Valheim for the guys that said, well, I put in a thousand hours building this epic city and it was destroyed. We can work on those type of play styles with a simple toggle, typically. Well, it's but, like on, on here... You know, yeah, the premise is survival, which we can do pretty much anyways. And then it's gathering resources, building an armada, and exploring, attacking, and all that. I like the attacking and shit, you know? Yeah, I would love to be able to do what X4 and some of these other games have in a game like this, where you do have your... You build your space stations and your cities, and people do shit. You can you, you can make it yourself space. with your own you resources. It, yes, make it yourself. Design it. Yeah, and that's the type of shit that I wanted. To that's do. what I like most about like like Starfield. I mean, you could choose a variety of ships, but you can modify it any way you fucking want. Right, from what I saw, and that got me excited. Because unlike you, I wasn't excited for it until I watched Courtesy of Alaris, If you're still watching. You sent me that Xbox coverage on it, and it made me go, "Holy shit!" They, this, what what oh. what really really convinced me was the fact that they actually showed gameplay, real fucking gameplay. Be careful where you're aiming your gun, because I don't know if you can reach the spirit of fire from where you're at. Oh, okay. Be really careful. I'm not shooting it that far. Because I saw some. Uh, Blocks and I kind of got a little nervous there. Oh. Nothing you did, I just don't want us to hit your ship. Yes. That... You know, I, I, I'm having distress moments because of what I did to poor Bradley's ship. I think it's we, just one little hole. I think we basically got this ship. Yeah. I mean, we... Leave that stuff up there alone. Yeah. We don't need all that. Yeah. So we can go destroy the other shipyard, see what it brings in, if it calls for friends. I'm um, thinking about it. If they call for friends, I've, <laughs> I've got a better we'll friend. Up. Oh, shit, I still got plenty of And yeah, we should be fine to go for another siege. Yeah. And I, trust me, I got a shit ton of ammo, and I've been building that up the past week, just... Yeah. I've been just storing it in the spirit, just as I build it, I bring it over. Yeah, there's a reason why I've been doing what I've been doing on my ship, on this ship. <laughs> I supply my own uh, ammo in the middle of the battle, so I don't have to stop. Yeah. Exactly. Well, that's why I, my Osiris is getting so full of resources from all the looting and shit we've been doing. That's why I brought half of it over to the fucking spirit. Okay, I think we're good. I don't want to risk it anymore. Yeah. Else. All right, so... Take, take me over to the spirit and I'll hop out. Yeah, let me check the harvest thing real fast. <laughs> this is probably a lot. 280% in the harvester. Right <laughs> Jesus Christ. It's really yeah. full, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, but that's fine. My God, Bradley, your ship is so tiny compared to mine. Yeah. That's not what she said. <laughs> I have, I have, where the hell is a convenient entrance for you? Uh, right here is fine. Right here is fine. <laughs> okay. 
<laughs> That's not what she said either. Oh. Because I'm just going to go right here to the bridge. Okay. Yeah, bro, we got a lot. We got over a thousand combat still, a thousand hardened still. Another, actually, damn near 3,000 hardened still and 2,000. No. Jesus Christ, was that. Almost 4,000 hardened still and 2,100 combat. Plus a whole bunch of components. Fucking A. Good shit. That's why I said if we can get multiple people on that those guns, we can just pretty much take that shit apart. But we got one more shipyard to go play with. Everybody loves playing with shipyards. Yeah, I, all I was doing was circling around the damn thing, and it really wasn't hurting me. Yeah. Every now and then, I, I would have to dip just to regen my shields is all. I put a lot of top speed. Oh, my God. To spin around on it. I'm making it looks like you're 30 solar panels. I. It looks like I am. Hold on. Oh. <laughs> that poor shipyard. <laughs> it's, like, barely there. I'll have to send that later. That's funny if it looks I took like a screenshot. Because I'm not even in. I'm in a, just trying to unload everything <laughs> from all the shit we've harvested. Yeah, that's why I love taking these space stations and shit. So much parts. We've really become, uh, what do I call it? Junk thieves. We're just... We're, we're, we are a literal wrecking crew. Just to yeah. turn easy, I have to do the tilt turn. Oh, because <laughs> it well it's because the ship's so huge yeah all right so i'm going to turn on guns full power again Wrong button. Need all right. that. and then know. next destination we're going to turn coordinates and it's straight ahead xenu shipyard burger. yeah i wonder if the xenu burger is going to call in friends or if it's going to be Oh, please don't hurt me. I'm curious now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm definitely going to put... Uh, after we knock out this, I'm definitely going to put... Uh, fucking solar panels on this. Yeah. Make further modifications. <laughs> it's funny, you're just like, stay behind the spirit. Stay behind the spirit. You're going at a, a top speed, uh, apparently. Oh, I'm at uh, this 100 meters per second. Yeah, so. Mine's 99. <laughs> oh, you guys are slower. That's what it is. Uh, yeah. Well, this thing ain't that big of a deal. Yeah, I was going 100, so it might be something was damaged, but I don't know. I ain't too worried about it. I don't know, sometimes tonight. mine does that. It'll go I'll 99, let you, I'll, not 100. I'll let you catch up. Oh, I'm literally right you behind you. You can just you. go just in. Watching. Yeah, well, I yeah. can see you. I'm just right behind you. Like, fire! <laughs> fire! Uh, fire! Clearly make, make sure your oh, ammo is no. reloaded. Yep, it is. Si, sí, senor. I'm gonna switch to my plasma laser gun, so so I can. I might add more uh, cannons to this. You really just want to show them your guns, don't you? <laughs> like Ironhide, I just wanted to show them my guns. All right, I guess I'm gonna spin around here. Oh, look at that! Ain't that adorable? Missiles your way. Oh, look at the beauty of that. You like that? Yeah, look at this. Yeah! All those turrets coming at it. <laughs> I'm down to 68. My positrons are so good. So good. See, I gotta get in close. I'm taking a run. Switching the turrets. Oh, wait. 
It's only a couple little turd. Uh-oh. Pull back. Um, we got some coming, dropping from warp. I'm oh, trying. Bogey's behind us. I don't know if there's any capital. Looks like just interceptors so far. We'll get some distance. Interceptors. Let our shields recharge. I'm letting my shields recharge. I heard a boom and it hit that. I'm like, oh fuck, what did he just blow up on my ship? Yeah. Looks like so far so good. 70%. Yeah. Reloading. Come back up yeah. all the way. Are you guys coming after me? Oh, isn't that adorable. special? Just a little bit special. Okay, so I think that's all they're going to play with, so I think we're good, Ruggles. For now. Is that ship? Is the shipyard still f firing back? It is. Yeah, missiles. Well, we know where the core is on that damn thing, too. It's on that ship. What is that hit? Just to enter my dictor. Interceptor. Oh. Some got fried there. Shield's holding just fine. Oh, that's because they're focusing on me. <laughs> there we go. I can do circles now. Yeah, mine's just dropping a little bit. I'm down to 35, 32. I'm slowly backing away. Yeah, I'm trying to go for that core. Copy. Since I know where it's at. Is there an interdictor behind me? Yeah. You think you're so cute. Enemy, Enemy crafts have been disabled. Long range scanners indicate no more ships approaching. What? I think you disabled them. Yeah, that was the last oh. interdictor. Okay. So, let me see if I can. Das ist kaputt. Ja. It's time to board the bitch. Alright, my artillery just hit it, shot it. Mine too. I'm going right oh, for that. Core's uh, gone. Core's gone. Thank you, turrets. You're Victory welcome. I shot it. <laughs> I oh, shot oh, you the turret. Were okay. Yeah, <laughs> I was shoot. I had made a opened a hole in the front and. Oh, I couldn't see from my side. I was like, eh, well. I guess I need. I mean, to make the Xerox are else. dead. Wow, this is intact over here. Ding dong, the Xerox dead. Which old Xerox? I'm gonna Zerx. find out this <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and get some. Let's get some ammo made. I burned up a lot of my artillery, so let's get more of those. And then what else did I have? Uh, I need MK200 lasers. Let's see. And precision cartridges. You want me to throw? You, did you get the core from the last one? I accidentally destroyed it, so... Well, we did that or whatever, so... I can throw one down real quick. Yeah, go for it. 145... Oh, wait. 140, oh, where the hell did it go? Oh. I put one down, and now I can't find it. Do you need one? No, 
No, I have one. Oh, you put it down there already. Yeah, but I'm trying to find it to make sure you guys can get into it. Just press P and then. Oh, uh, yeah. I don't know where it went to. That's weird. I sat it down and it just disappeared on me. There you go. Go to looting, boys. Yeah. Yeehaw. I'm going to modify my ship. I do not want energy pills. Thank you very much. Take the ammo. Okay, no. take my shields down temporarily. No. No. Uh, yeah. The Xerox are gone. I don't see any more, uh, see any more guys. Yeah, there's none in here. Yeah. That's weird. Oh, nothing's definitely appearing off my screen now. I guess you should go out and look for freaking turrets underneath this thing or all. I. <laughs> if there's any left. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. I. I oh, why are you big boy? Oh. Man. Do we have turrets out here? I don't know. Shit's showing up on my screen and it's not disappearing. Like, I take it. I guess I need to log out and back in, maybe? Yeah. Okay. Hold on, let me do that real quick. Where's my ship? Hey, Rugs. Yeah. Move your spirit of fire back. Okay. Do it the old fashioned way again. Wait a minute, give me a second. <laughs> Bradley's ship's just, uh, just, uh, no. It's a bad wolf. <laughs> yeah, far enough? Uh, let me see. I'm behind you now. Sorry, I, I didn't realize I was that fucking close. <laughs> yeah. All right. All right. At? I'm going to log out and then back on. All right. I don't see anybody near us, so we can proceed to begin Operation Loot That Shit. Where did you put that uh, core, by the way? I don't know where it is, honestly. It disappeared okay. on me. I couldn't see it. Okay. It was towards the back. Uh, I put it down, couldn't see it. And like I said, other things weren't... I was picking up, but they weren't disappearing. Okay. It's like one of the... You know where we went in the last time? Like that, the hangar where it's open? Yeah. It was in there somewhere. Oh, it didn't take long. The core's already gone, it looks like. It wasn't in the hangar. It was on a cloth somewhere, I guess. Huh. Oh, well. Oh, I can well, put we'll another one back down in a second if you want if, me to. Up to you. Yeah, you know what? It's may as well. That way we don't have to... You can always make some more. ...burn time. I would put that somewhere on the far opposite from the ship. Um, you. Let's see. <laughs> It'll take me a second to get there. It was... I'll put it like over here on the top across from you. That's fine. I 
take on the scaffolding. Just just gotta, looking here. Just gotta set it to where we can all hit. Oh, it. I'm sorry. <laughs> I keep forgetting that. And then I didn't have to go back over there. I could have just done it from where I was at. Yep. Yeah, you could have. Could have, would have, should have. Yeah. It's no different than me forgetting about the uh, auto drop and uh, seven days to die in Mankin's town. Go, oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> that was a, that was slightly funny. Well, it tells you how long I've been, since I played Seven Days to Die either. Too. I don't. I forget about that shit if I don't play it a lot. That's weird because this is where I. What are you? There's a lot of hovering uh, loot out I'm here. I'm yeah, I'm looking. Right by I'm the doing ship. Our... Oh, he'll grab it. I came inside to check everything out first. Uh. Ooh, there was reactive matter in there. Oh, oh, baby, give me, give me six more, please, six more. You must have missed it on the other one somehow, or we blew it up one. Yeah, I probably blew it up. I just need six more alien shit all this stuff. I can't believe it's six away. Ooh, ah, e, ooh. Ooh, e, ooh, ooh, ah, ting, ting, what a what a bing bang. Ah, oh, fuck, I'm full. Shit. Is that what it is? I guess so. Way back out yonder to my ship. I learned my lesson. When those tool turrets are going, stay hell away. <laughs> I actually didn't mean to hit this far away. It's my ah. ship when I hit them, hit them uh, buttons to take uh, off. It goes. Oh, I thought I thought we were exaggerating. I'm See, still not back in my funny. ship. Alright, down to five more alien cores. Or blocks. You got this. I don't think there's any more here. But I imagine the next place we go, we'll have it. I'm sure it will. I'm using carbon blocks to go around these solar panels because... This will definitely help with power yeah, consumption. because that's why Liberty doesn't burn much. Because I have solar panels. It only burns if you turn on thrusters or use... It burns! Yeah. It burns! Constructors. It burns. burns so bad. Because it doesn't get the luxury that bases do where it has... A I got a tool turret from somewhere. Cool. Use it. Could be a hover, though, or... I didn't look at it, I just seen what it... Usually that's the ones I get, which sucks. It's like, oh, come on, guys. <sighs> it's alright when we're stuff. taking bases apart. Yeah. Go back in and see all these little floaty ships. Or floaty ships. Floaty packages. There's a package. That one, nice. Oh. Uh, oh, there's another one. It must not pick up everything. Probably not. Oops. 
stuff to build with at least. Now here's the million dollar question, next excursion we go to, if it turns out that it is something like a battle cruiser or a dreadnought, you gonna wanna pull out? <sighs> uh, pull out or are you gonna shove it in deeper? That's, uh, that's a good question. We may, may not wanna risk it. I don't think we do. I think if it's a destroyer or a lesser, yeah. Yeah. But, Wait, yeah. But I don't think we want to tackle one of those yet. No. Not to at least maybe get cruise missiles and shit, because... Yeah, which you're already working on that for us. I'm very close to getting that. Because once you unlocked. make the cruise missile launcher, you'll make it for the rest of us, and then we'll yeah. we'll all have it. Just depends on also how hard those damn missiles are to find. If it's platinum, we're gonna be screwed. We're gonna have to find plants with damn platinum. I've been stockpiling platinum. Where the hell have you been finding platinum? Uh, all of my excursions, where I've no asteroids though, or plants. No, no, I've been. Yeah, the only place I found mine has been on chests and stuff. That's what I was like, where the hell have you been finding it? Because I've got like almost three hundred platinum. Yeah, I think I'm 100 or 200 platinum. Yeah. But that's, uh, that's, I've only been getting it from loot containers and stuff. Nothing, like, nothing planetary or space wise. And I'm guessing wow. it's probably treated like gold tucked in and, uh, the other one. It's on the planets. You have to find it. So that's a good spot. One block over right here. Yeah, this is my enjoyment here is just taking all their crap like true plunderers and stuff. It's like, yeah, what we the are their true pirates. Pretty much. Well, of the Xerox, anyways. Yeah. Only 24 allowed? Yeah, 24. you can only have 24 oh. solar. That's bullshit. Yeah, I know. I'm in here grabbing all the stuff out of the containers. Trying to hurry as I'm just deconstructing. Nah, you're fine, because if, if you hit it, it just goes into the little box for me to pick up. Right. What the hell did I pick up the game? It don't matter, I'm getting a lot of shit. Definitely so good. You bastards. So how are you digging working four tens? Uh I like it. On YouTube. See, that's kinda what I'd like to do. I'd like to my counting. I it, just, it gives me more it, options. It honestly. would cut down my stream times at night because some people wouldn't be able to do stuff with me 
because of the Eastern time, but if I was getting home at 7 o'clock instead of uh, 6 o'clock, and I was skipping lunch or whatever, still, yeah, I'd stream for about an hour, two hours a night, and then on Fridays, have the whole day to do shit that I need to, or stream multiple things. Yeah. Have, have multiple exactly. Days, and that's what I like, because realistically, sure, you lose some time during the week, but... Hell, there's days that I need st business to take care of during the weekdays that where people are closed. Then I'd rather have that free day to call them and say, hey, what the hell's up? Whereas you don't get that luxury working, you know, 40 hours, five days a week. So there is definitely something to be said about, about it. I mean, hell, they say a lot of times your productivity productivity drops after six hours, typically. Regardless, so. Let me get everything I'm sitting full again. Well, and the fact that I can do majority of my job just, you know, in four days, well, I it, it's like well, a, it's, it's like a win-win. argument. There was an argument that I, I saw about like salary and working. If you can get your job that's in your job description and you can and then some on your own and still have time to go do whatever you want, what's stopping you other than the company? I mean, for example, yeah. You have you have a job and you can get it done five, six hours. That's your job description. You may go above and beyond, do a few other things here and there, but that's what you're paid to do. That's it. So you're done with it. You're already caught up. You slammed through it. You're super efficient. You do what you do. I don't feel like you should be punished by having to stay for your job that's been completed because... Correct. Somebody else may not be good at their job, or it, there may be stuff to do, because you never know. Some There may be some where they need you longer because they're backlogged or they have an issue, which you're being basically paid to stay and get that job done. So my feeling is, especially big on salary, why the hell, if, if it takes you only 30 hours to get it done, and that's your job description, or you're still going above and beyond and getting that done. I think they should really reevaluate how salary works. I think if your work's done and you've completed it and it's very it's good, go home. Get paid for your time. Oh, agreed. I mean that if if you're behind or backlogged, then you know it's a little different story. And I think that's how it should be when it comes to that. But I don't know. Poor Bradley trying to scavenge anything, and I'm just no. You're just fine. Zotting it away. No, but I'm I'm not scavenging anything. I'm just picking up the boxes because you guys, when you hit a box, it leaves a, a container behind. I know. I'm just getting your car because I can see you this far. Ow, my butt's sore. You hit me in the butt. The butt talks. Well, I salvaged your butt then. Uh, oh, here's a box. Anything in you? But yeah, I've always thought that. It was, there was a fun discussion. There was a guy that was working three full-time jobs during COVID. Because he was working from home and he was on salary. Thing is, he could slam through his job at home without interruption, dealing with people, anything. And he did it really well. Yeah. So he got a second job. He just had to make sure that his meetings didn't overlap or anything. So he was making double his money working this same job at two companies that were not competitors. And he was making insane money for just those two. But then it didn't stop there. He basically was training his sister and got her a job under his credentials 
and he was basically subcontracted to paying her, which I know that one was a no-no, but I guess the point that I'm making, if you can get the job done, do it well, and fulfill it, what's stopping me from either A, working a second job during that, and we'll just work from home, or just let you go home early and pay you for the 40, because your job's True. done. I just, I don't, I think there's just something to be said about everything. My boss does that sometimes. Uh, like once the kids are gone and we got paperwork done, sometimes he lets us leave half hour early. A lot of times we're done when the kids walk out the door. We might right. have to do a little bit of paperwork here and there. But yeah, I just, I find that behavior and stuff fascinating, especially after I started reading about the guy that did all that during COVID and made more money than he could ever dream of, which is honestly sad and says a lot about how wages are paid nowadays. But yeah, I found, I found the whole conversation very illuminating. I think she missed the light. Yeah. You're beings. Hey, what is that hole in Bad Wolf? I don't know. It's the one that came through, same hole that matches up to uh, Spirit of Fire over there. Oh, oh no. Hmm. I guess the spirit of fire was just so hot it burned a hole right through Bad Wolf. I don't, I don't know what happened. It's a, it is a hot ship. It's very sexy. It's all blueprinted now, <laughs> and we all and all make our own, and we we'll fuck everybody up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he stole Ruggles' design. Shame on you. <laughs> uh, I could change some things on it so it don't look the same. He can if he wants to. I'm not stopping him. I'm just kidding. Nah, I just, I'm having fun fucking with him. Anybody else? There. Now I have so many solar panels. That's I got a solar panel that I got from somewhere. I need to see if it'll... It'll say what it's for. What type, base, yeah. capital ship, or what have you. <laughs> there's a couple flo Oh, there's all kinds of floaty shit now. Where the hell did you come from? <laughs> <The> current output. <laughs> 1.3 megawatts. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Consumption, 24.7 kilowatts. When starting up the shields, it takes 223 kilowatts. Yeah, it uses a lot of power. Fucking holy shit. My God. Uh -oh. Fuck them energy pills. Again, more energy pills. You just need some energy pills that'll help you run. Apparently. Nice. I don't know where that came from, but I'll take it. Two bullets. Really? Really? <laughs> what is this? A Talon poster. I have to have that. Your memories of what happened to you in Talon. When they once hated us and were chasing you around trying to kill you with crossbow. That's just kind of a weird find in a. Yeah, it doesn't make sense unless the Xerox really liked them. Uh, 
Oh, you're, why is your ship flying? You're gonna get a hole put in it. <laughs> I have no idea. I Ruggles didn't mean. I, I didn't mean to get that far, that close. Why is my ship moving? Ruggles. Oh. He's struggling. He's trying to. <laughs> he's trying to <laughs> snuggle. He's snuggling you from behind. Apparently, holy shit. I was positioning my ship to where I would face the sun and get power. I guess he really wanted a, a, to become a holy man. <laughs> Jesus. Like, what? Why do I just want to push it out? Save template. <laughs> oh. Picking up shit and I just don't know where it comes from. Even though I watch what I'm picking up, it comes from shit. It's not shit. It's energy. It's inner shit. So what system are we going to next? Yeah, I think I'm pretty much done on this one. Okay, <laughs> there's not much left. It's crap. Um... Let, let me clear this out. Wow, I picked up a lot of explosive charges. I don't need to carry you. Where are you? Oh, that's for another weapon, okay. Did you get yourself a long range radar? I'm going to do that right now that you mentioned it. <laughs> I'm like, you probably want to do that. Yeah, we're we're going now. You're probably where we're going. going. We make our own roads. I don't think it's a matter of making our own roads. I just don't think he wants to get surprised by Mr. Capital Ship. I can't because I don't have an advanced upgrade kit. Didn't you get one from that ion cannon? Did you deconstruct it? Deconstruct it? Oh, um. You know what? Let me go do that. I was about to say. <laughs> you you got that iron cannon. Yeah. Off the last one, yeah. Where are you like put that motherfucker? Yeah, but you didn't use it. Um, hey, Miss Kentucky, how are you doing? Let's see. Put that up here. Why are you on fire, dude? Who? Me. We didn't uh, start the fire. But the world's my been water. burned since the world's been turning. <laughs> That's weird. It's all weird. Yeah, it's suffering from heat weird. stroke. Now I gotta go fix this. Everything's yeah. weird. This is mad world. Uh, wrong station. Is it this one? It's actually a good song. Really? Oh, I stole the shield generator for a base. Oh, I'm doing good. I'm doing good. Just uh, playing some Imperium tonight with the guys as we create shenanigans and mischief along the way. Let me make sure I didn't leave it in here. And of course, Randall ra laugh at Bradley. And I'm okay so. with that. <laughs> Positron beam cannons. Special Imperial beam laser cannons. turret. Is it? Was that it? Uh, I have not been able to break those down. Well, that's what you, I got. You have to uh, put them on something and then deconstruct it that way. Oh, okay. It's the only way to do those ones. Okay. I gotcha. Unfortunately. So I yeah. need, and I. I guess I didn't get one. That was what that was, was that Imperial one, I think. Yes. All right, next I thought I got one. you boys. Hold on. Is. What am I doing? Let's see. Let's look at our something. system map. Oh. Did you destroy my core over there? No. OK. 
can we go back and grab it then? Let's see. I guess we'll do another warp. Why not? Okay. Where Let's to do this time? Seer Gamma. S E E R E Gamma. I see it. And I'll turn my weapons back on. And I'm warping. Seer Gamma. Is that a different system? Yeah. Oh, okay. It's just near it. It just says S E E R gamma E gamma. Oh, I see it, it now. There it is. Just kind of hop skipping along, see what we find. Yeah. My God. All right. What do we Where got in that? here? Oh, your oh. ship's still on my screen. Oh, me? Yeah, we're, we didn't jump Sir Gamma. Hold on, we might be bugged. Yeah, we didn't jump it. Uh, let's try one more time. If it doesn't work, then I'll have to restart on my end. I think you guys can still make it, but... It says you made the Sierra Gamma. I have not... Yeah. It says you're there. Yeah, I'm, okay, now... I'm there. Iron Asteroid, huh? Here in the middle of nowhere. All right, let's see what we got. Ooh, we got a s exploration class three. We are, yeah, class three, baby. We're going there. What? What? We are going to Enrin Ta. Enrin Tal. Tal. It's Tal. Do you not know Tau. what Tal is? Enrin Tal. Anren Tao. Anren Tao. You gotta fly through the sun for that. See you there. See you there. Class three, I'm gonna try it. I don't think we've ever seen a class three yet. <laughs> Although, I may not see You know, see Ruggles, it. looking from your ship from this perspective, it looks a little phallic. Mm. <laughs> On the screen. <laughs> Oh, I didn't warp. Yep, neither did I. I'll try it again. Oh, neither did I. We'll give it one more shot. If not, then we may have to pause and restart the server real fast. So that's what that Maybe means. it's telling us we shouldn't go there. <laughs> uh. uh, no. All right. I'm still in warp. That's interesting. Right, watch you guys drop. Warp. Yeah, that's telling us that it won't take. So we'll just have to restart real quick. That's not a big deal. All right. All right. Escape. Escape. Once you guys are, show that you're back. If you're not, I want I want to know that way we don't. I'm back. I just quit. Okay. I quit. Yep. Okay. Fuck this game, man. <laughs> fuck this, <laughs> fuck this game. I'm out. Oh, fuck this game. I'm out. Multiplayer. All right, saving that. All right, bear with us a second, folks. We get this party to start back up. And loading. All right, we got it loading again. Loading in. Alright. Connecting to Summerfire. My, my doctor's office did a billing thing and said that I overpaid $24 uh, for my son. And they have the check in his fucking name and he's five. <laughs> Can't you just love Dr. Department? Oh, for fuck's sake, an eternal... So I'm like, 
do I still sign it or what? Do I have my son sign know. it in gibberish or? <laughs> That's his fucking signature. <laughs> and Miss Kentucky says that warp is trippy. Yeah, it is. But this game is so much fun. Oh, we got a light blue signal. I'm a little nervous here. Ooh. I can't get back in yet. Yeah, I'm I waiting just, for you. I just warped. I'm waiting for you. Oh. I don't know what light blue is. It's a signal. Uh, light blue signal is a distress signal. Oh, boy. Well. I have one of them things, too, I think. I found I didn't know what the fuck it was for. Well, what the I, fork I, it was for. I okay. guess we're going to be uh, pull Riker here, or for cargo. Shields up, red alert. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, let's see if I can get it. Alexa, red alert. Oh, God. <laughs> Even Alexa judges you poorly. <laughs> Everyone judges you. <laughs> okay, on my map. Uh, you went to Enrin Tau. There we are. Last three might. Misky Girl says hi. Hello, how you doing? Uh, we are there. investigating this signal. Yep. Oh, you guys are lagging behind. I haven't started. I was waiting for him. I'm heading there now. Jeez, Ruggles. Jeez. Well, I I was I was curious. You know. Bro's like, oh my god, I gotta go. <laughs> I've, Screw Bradley. I've got, give him the middle finger. As I've got by. the <laughs> biggest ship. I'm not afraid. I'll, I'll slow uh, down no, for you. No, he's just giving a, a poor Bradley the middle finger. Like, I'm get on my that. level, bitch. <laughs> get on my level. Oh, uh, shit. I'm going to turn so the sun's facing my solar panels. Miss Kentucky girl. Yep. All right, we're coming in. Yeah, I'm no from Kentucky, so I'm probably related to her. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Brad. You think, I'm, you, think I'm kid you think I'm kidding? I'm related to half the state. Oh, goddamn. I worked at one place. You know, I, All the I, people from there we trace back to be. Well, I, I'm from I'm from Michigan, and and so I I do. Oh, there's nothing here. It's, ju it's just a thing. Oh, I I, I mispronounced the Kentucky as Miski. I'm like, oh, that's it's my it's my education for Michigan. <laughs> my my apologies. Miss Kentucky says, doing good. Just bouncing back between you and Kai. <laughs> Left my ass off. <laughs> what the fuck is this all about? I, I, I don't know. Well, there's... Oh, oh my God, I'm going to run into the station. Well, so. Watching your guys' tiny <laughs> ships fly by is hilarious. Uh, all right. What is this thing? Uh, I don't know. I got hacking software. Is there a doorway on it? That's what I'm getting ready to go check. There's an admin core. Maybe it's... Maybe there's something on it. While you're doing that, I'm going to go check out this asteroid out here. Oh, my God. That's Heck 21 it. away. I got to get in here first. Get out of my... Sh Where the fuck did it go? Oh, there it is. Let me see. My... I don't see anything. God. You mean all <laughs> that hype for nothing? What? Uh, <laughs> oh, this is kind of cute. On Kentucky top. girl says, "Well, I guess oh. hello, cousin, uncle, brother." No, that sounds more like West Virginia. <laughs> it's a damaged black box. Download data to PDA and investigate. Okay. Did you download it? Yeah, it says investigate the sector. Oh. Oh, this sector. Let me. Oh, based on stellar drift radiation patterns, the computer has calculated a possible origin position for the beacon. Oh. <laughs> Lead the way, Bradley. Hold on. Lead the way. Yeah, where is it? 
I, I'll I'll be your emotional support ship. <laughs> <laughs> I I have no business mining on this thing. It's it's built for war. It's built for war. Pip pip chivio. <laughs> pip pip chivio. I'm built for combat, sir. Oh, you're going the other way. No, I just had to get away from that. It was bouncing off of it. Uh, let me look up my PDA real quick and see what it says. Of yeah, course, you love bouncing off of probes. <laughs> uh, why am I not surprised right now? <laughs> you shouldn't. Why be. am I not surprised? Yeah, nothing freaking surprised me anymore. So, uh, Miss Kentucky, how you liking Seven Days to Die? I've been pretty disappointed in Alpha Twenty One, but I mean, still doing it. It but... just says approach and search area. Let me see. Okay, well. Um, go wherever it's telling you to go. Yeah. Approach yeah, it. Looking. Approach it and search it. Scanning for life forms. Scanning for life. life forms. Where are you? Oh, 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 here it is. Wait a minute. I got it. Hold yeah. on. Yeah? Am I going the wrong okay. way? Do you see which way I'm going now? I'm turning around. I'll grab that, though, and then I'll come and catch you guys. If you guys make it, if it's if it's a uh, progeny rip, you're by. <laughs> rip, rip. <laughs> oh my god! That's the only bad thing about a huge ass ship. It turns so slow. If you hear me scream. Oh god! I I turned around for nothing. You're you're coming my way. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, damn it. Oh my god. I'm four kilometers away. I, I'm I'm yeah, I'm getting I, close I was to you. Two playthrough streams so far. I wonder if it's gonna send me somewhere else. Good. Yeah, I was gonna do I did two playthroughs, but or I was gonna do day seven, but I guess this lace lace experimental wiped a bunch of people's crap, so I don't know if I even have seven day seven now to do on the stream it's it's frustrating but we weren't uh, fortunate like others to be able to I don't see anything yet uh, do alpha 21 so we, we were left but out my scanners picked up a new signal okay okay let me find that exploration ship warp trail oh here it is oh warp trail uh-huh. Oh, so we uh -oh. got a warp? No, you don't have no. I'm just following a trail. All right. Well, I will follow you. It's only five you. kilometers. Well, sometime then when we're playing it, um, you know, I can always invite you to tag along. This is true. Oh, it's near Kai. <laughs> oh, boy. It's a dreadnought. Oh, my God. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's no moon. That's a space station. Oh, if it's a dreadnought, well, the long suckers. That's going to be what happens. It's going to send me somewhere and get me killed. Yeah. Uh, bad wolf will be bad wolf will be put down. <laughs> <laughs> the entire time we've been out here, I've only okay, used ten percent on. of my fuel. Oh, yeah. it gave me pentaxid. That's it. That's now, now it's calibrating sensors to trail it. Uh, after calibrating oh. these scanners, you're able to detect an old iron ion trail. Okay. Okay. Which no, now I gotta go back this fucking way. Oh Jesus. Jesus. Plane ring around the rosy. Nope, that's liberty. Jesus. <laughs> Look how slow I fucking turn. Hmm. Yeah. Hey, hey. <laughs> Do you have to put more thrusters on or something else to make it turn faster? I put a few on the side and I put RCSs on mine. I've got like 20 RCSs. Yeah, his is not going to turn well. I wonder how many RCSs I actually do have. 
wonder what that would be under. Might be equipment. Nope. Ding, brother, dun, ding, brother, dun. Would you like an applesauce with that? Applesauce with that. Apple mm -hmm. pie. I know. Oh, <laughs> you've been corrected. Whoa. I, I know it's apple pie. I've seen applesauce. You're the boss, applesauce. You're the best, applesauce. Kentucky Girl <laughs> said, shared your guys' streams. Thank you very much. Definitely appreciate Thank you. So you. Much. <laughs> oh, good lord. RCS. Oh, I have 10. I guess I could do more. I lost Bradley. Oh. Oh, God. Watch it's out, Bradley. Right. There's a dreadnought. I see it spun it in. Oh, God. Bring it on. I took one out before. I, hey, I just got <laughs> this time a I'm prepared. to the left that I can warp if I need to. <laughs> <laughs> this time I'm prepared. It's not where I want to warp to, but it's it'll be away moment. from that. Uh, if I ever I set mine to warp to the Polaris-controlled sector. <laughs> you know what's nice about this ship? I, can, I, I think... Here and you're able to calculate the power. I think Game, I can, it's giving me little bits of stuff here and there when I. I can warp home from here. Yeah, that's because you were able to do it before oh, they. Uh, <laughs> the, uh, yeah. But technically, you could cheese it. You, I don't know. I couldn't I warp home. That's forty-eight light years. You could pull it, I think, and then put it over the repair thing, and it restores it with the right resources. <laughs> I'm that's a little nervous true. now. The signal source is orange. Oh. Or yellow. I, I'm no, gonna I'm gonna yellow. take this back to base so I don't blow up too much power. Are oh, you leaving him? I'm gonna come back with my smaller ship. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm no. okay with that. Oh no! How do you jump that far? He's got the advanced warp. I've got special advanced warp. Um, the third person stream with us. He's just part of the wrecking crew. He doesn't have a YouTube channel or anything. Yeah. He just Not yet. Plays us. Not yet. <laughs> I've got to come up with like a persona first. Bradley the Impaler. We're, we'll just start calling him Cosmo the Magnificent. I'm <laughs> bad Brad. <laughs> bad Brad. There you go. <laughs> yeah, he's bad. Bad. Really bad. Bad is bad and the whole bad bad. Uh, I can do. My buddy's what? kids, they call me Big Brad. <laughs> Big Brad. I'm they Big were, Brad. They were asking me today, they said, because I told his dad I was playing with some YouTubers, as I gave him your guys' thing to see if they would show up, but I don't think they did. Oh, God, what the fuck is this? Oh, God. Oh, I left at the do? wrong time. <laughs> what did you do? <laughs> I don't know. I'm oh, God. Get closer. Oh, God, it's a battle cruiser. Rebel oh. left us. Oh, God. <laughs> Is it? I don't know what the I fuck I don't know what is. it is. I can't see it yet. <laughs> it's huge. It's purple. Yeah. Oh, shit. It's pro. Oh, God, we're firing at it. It's progenitors. Is it? I don't know, yeah. but it's not firing at me. Oh. Checked. I'm trying to come. I don't know if I can see it. Hold on. I'm going to turn my guns off. Oh, shit. Oh my it's, god! Oh my god! Oh, what the? It's not shooting at me. Uh. Oh, here's you uh, some Xeno material. A ton of it. Uh, oh. Oh. Uh. uh <laughs> oh, what Seriously. the fuck is this? It's not lootable. None of this is? I don't know. I'm. Dude, what the fuck is this? Uh. Oh. Uh, uh, <laughs> I'm so nervous. <laughs> this isn't normal. <laughs> god damn. Oh my god. I'm looking oh to see if god. there's a. Oh my Hold god. On. I'm, I'm bringing the Spartan. Oh god damn it. Wait, no, it's. I just don't know what the fuck it is. I. I. I okay, I'm gonna exit my ship. Oh god. The risks. <laughs> the risks this man is oh, taking. Oh my god. Oh my god. It what? says this is playable again. What? Like if the the mission, the thingy I just did. All right, uh, let me. 
Uh, <laughs> I'm closing in. This thing's giving me the creeps. What the fuck is this? Oh. Ah! It's your guns, Christ. Kai. <laughs> Turn your guns off. Turn your guns off. Oh my god. Turn your guns off. <laughs> You're wasting your Xeno material there. Oh, oh my god. Seriously, this will finish your thing. Oh my god, what the fuck is this? Oh. Not, uh, uh, what system are you guys in? I, I, I found the core on that one, but I ain't. We're saying, uh, uh, I don't know. Uh, Kai's panicking worse than me. <laughs> I'm out, I'm out floating in space. Zero gamma. <laughs> Kai's panicking Hi, over How you spell it? S-E-E-R-E. -E -E. And the sector's Enrin Ta. God damn it. Hey, I was not expecting my guns to just shoot shit. I told okay? you that. <laughs> I said, you gotta turn Wait, your guns off. Did you fire. see the weird ass shit? It looks like a. Looks oh, like I an know. Eye of death. This I is know. creepier than shit. This is like playing Phasmophobia. God damn. You will finish your mission, though. Oh, uh, yeah. There's a ton yeah. of these little containers with that yeah, stuff. I'm so, I'm so oh, die. something's shooting. Is that you? No. Yeah, something's shooting at my ship. Oh, you motherfucker. <laughs> oh, fuck. oh yeah, it's pounding your shields. Get back there. I'm a ways from it. I'll die before I get back there. Oh, it's it's the uh It's a little turret. It. Yeah, it's the gun it's the guns on it. Alright, motherfuckers. You wanna play? It's not even damaging me. What it is is I sh should have took the core out of it, I guess. Yeah. That would have been your first choice. Well, I mean, it wasn't firing at me before. Well, you know, don't don't trust anything. Yeah, he's like, oh, no, don't worry. Nothing's now I'm gonna... stuck in this fucking mess. Oh, I, I would bring this without my long range radar. Fucking stupid. Oh well. Kai, are you going to come out here and get your stuff and finish oh, your I, quest? I'm out here. Oh, are you? Yeah, I'm already out here. Here we I go. I think it quit shooting, didn't it? Oh, uh, there's a bunch. I, I think so. There's a bunch of these, so I gotta blow them. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta blow him. You gotta yeah. blow him. And yeah, we should sometime. I just feel like I've been swamped. Uh. I want that one because it had guns on it. I don't know if it's done. All right, enter. Hold my PDF. Leveled up. Bonus to drills. More damage to the multi-tool. Scales up the material. And warp. A few more. Sweet. All right. And yeah. guess who's back? Yeah, after all the fun. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, what is that? What is that? Well, we, have you got to see it yet? Yeah, have you got to see it? This shit's trippy, dude. No, I haven't seen it. Not yet. Gotta see where you're at first. You towards the signal? I'm, I'm burning at 119 meters per second. I don't know if you guys got guns on you. I got guns. This, no, is, like this. Some, this is like some trippy dream that you have when you're fucking hungover. I don't even know what the fuck this is. But it's, it's very trippy. Oh, you're way the fuck out there. Yeah. Well, it'll take me a second, but I'll get there. I get, I get. It's all right. Yeah, it's all right. We got this under control. Maybe. 
Are you sure? You sounded very, very uh, afraid. Uh, yes. Take a look at this shit, dude. It's fucking trippy. It's like the flood. It's like really goddamn trippy. Yeah, once you get here, you'll see. Yeah, it, it's like I've never seen it. It's like cool. This. It's cool, but it's like. I was getting fucking phasmophobia flashbacks on this shit. <laughs> there you are. Ten... Ten kilometers out. Yeah, you know, the stuff that you don't like, Ruggles, that's something what I was picturing is some fucking giant aliens that come on to eat our ass. <laughs> you know, that's some somebody's fetish, I'm sure. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty goddamn much. Fucking hey. stone. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna rewatch this to be like you assholes. <laughs> <laughs> you would talk about me when I get offline. But yeah, about you eating assholes. Okay. <laughs> Look, from all these containers, I've got a stack of Promethean pellets. Yeah, it's very uh, wild. You know, from the distance when I come in, it looked like a giant ship. Oh, it did. Yeah, that's what I thought it was. I was like, "What the hell?" I still don't understand what all these blocks are for. I, I don't understand what they're for either. Yeah. <laughs> for. I'll find out in like three kilometers. <laughs> yeah, it says port is not possible. Miss Kentucky should... says, "Okay, I gotta head out. Finish a vid I was working on." Hope to catch your next stream. Th appreciate you. We'll see you next time. Appreciate there must be a core night. somewhere associated to this whole mess. What the That's shit? Yeah. I, okay. I think Obvious. this ship materialized into... Ruggles, turn your weapons off. I'm, I'm doing that. Yeah, this <laughs> shit is so fucking trippy. What the Honestly, hell? Honestly, I thought this was... That's what I'm saying, dude. I thought this was like a progenitor or some shit, because... Take care, Miss Kentucky. Thanks for hanging out with us tonight. And at least we can get a, a good, good laugh at us. <laughs> Freak it out. So uh, these are dude. colored blocks. Yeah, in the distance, though, it looked like something that could attack, but it's really nothing. There's a core somewhere. Well, I, I can I, I can get all up in this, so yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll get up, get all up in this business here. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he did all the heavy lifting, so you know. I was the one that jumped out and come running in. There's yeah, I was one. coming behind you. So. Oh you shit! Won. I'm too hot. <laughs> yeah. <sighs> I'm suffering heat stroke. What? I'm dehydrated. What the fuck? What the hell's going on? Radiation? Probably high radiation here. No, I'm not getting any of that. Really? Huh. Still, remove or replace foreign core. Yeah. I think we've got all these cores. I think the actual weird blocks that look like some freaky ship is what they're talking about. It's weird. I know. I'm wondering. Let me look over here. That was weird as hell. Yeah. It, it's it's like like I said, it's trippy, like some weird freaking hangover you just had or something. You're like, what? The is this? We got the zip and dab and duba and the duba dab and diba. Yeah. Well, the nice thing is it, it said this is a redoable thing, so yeah. I don't know if it'll respawn all that Do you alien. Do a hacking software or something? Or? No, I just went on top of it and there it said access panel and it downloaded everything straight to my PDA. Huh. Well, let's right. let's see. Where's uh, my ship? I'm lost. No core. In space. I was gonna go to my ship and turn my weapons back on. See what I shoot at. 
See, th this is exactly why I parked in the middle. I know where my ship is. Well, your ship wasn't being shot at at the time either. Yeah. Some of those had little turrets pop up. Yeah, they were shooting a lot. And quite frankly, who the hell knew what the hell was going to happen? I don't think any of us have seen an event like this where this weird You're welcome. Shit comes out. <laughs> it says I'm eligible for a subclass, but then it showed it for a second and it was gone, so I don't know. Slow down, bitch. Don't fly into this. Me? No, me. My fat ass. It's all about that ass. About that ass. sake well my guns aren't aiming at me Maybe it's just a way to get that stuff. Yeah, it's a possibility because it's. Meow. Meow. Whoops. This thing's got really good maneuverability. Am I out of ammo for that gun? Nice. Ammo container. There we go. I got my second class done. I am now marksman level one. I know. I gotta go kill... Now you gotta go kill 70 Zerax. more Xerax. 70. It sucks because you can't... No matter how many I kill, it has to be like a lower tiered ones. Okay, scan class three sites in my PDA. It says you need standard survey probes. You can craft them under your decoration tab. Okay. So they're in your PDA. Yeah. You can craft probes. All right. No. He wants to probe the probe. That is pretty trippy, but at least I got the Xeno stuff done. But, you know, I, I'm probably going to try and do what you said and remove that. Uh, <laughs> Freaking uh, warp drive and have the repair thing put it back. Yeah. God. That's open now. I thought my ship was firing. <laughs> well, when you're not expecting your ship to fire and you're distracted <laughs> as shit, it's like... What? Bullets! That's you, Ruggles, Everywhere. Shit? Yeah. Okay. yeah. Who else would it be? I love shooting shit. Could you not tell? Oh, jeez, Edith. He just likes being a dork. Oh, jeez, Rick! I'm firing! Kaboom! What? I wonder if I could shoot through this blue shit. I'm confused. Again. Why is that spot... Is there a reason the deconstructor would cut... Oh, are you on, you bitch? Hey, guys. What? But that's what it is. What is this? What is what? can't tell, it's so far away. Oh, okay, that's my ship. <laughs> Is it going backwards? <laughs> what? Surely, but surely. Is it? The ship's going backwards. Were you not in it? I don't ship it. Oh, that's your ship. Okay, I was like, what? I had seen that 
a ship from a distance that looked like it was a red ship or something. I don't know oh, mine? Out here. Yeah, it was all like, <laughs> like yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I really can tell. Tatatas. Yes, Tatas. I've I've oh. flown all three of my ships tonight. This one is the most fun I've had besides the Spirit of Fire. I like this one. It's lightweight. I'm disappointed. I, I admittedly, I'm disappointed. I was expecting some giant thing to come out and honestly eat Bradley. Eat Bradley. Eat Bradley. That's why I was very uneasy. I'm like, oh shit. I don't like I this. I did get, not paying attention, because every time you do a stage, it gave me something. Yeah. I got two technical artifacts. Oh. Some kind of data storage device of progenitor origin. It's unusual yeah, and you, heavy for its site. You turn it into US. Yeah, I've seen where you sell them. So, that's interesting. So, when you do the F1, if you hit F1 and you go to scanning, it says you can activate it and use standard survey probes. I wonder. I want to activate this and test this. Okay, so difficulty four it requires four standard survey probes. Anomalous signatures detected. I don't have enough probes on me. I have to make four standard. What does it take? I'm curious. Oh, I've got some kind of probes on me. What kind do you need? It says four standard. I'm curious. Let's. Uh, let me give a look. I should be able to make. Cause I got them in a. Crafting. So I probes. am going to go yeah. back to Haven and try and make some of those for us. Yeah, you're welcome. It's, it was mm -hmm. a good idea. I'm just saying. That's a research beacon. Basic system survey. Well, I got enough platinum to make quite a few, so... All right, I'm going to go ahead and head back to Haven myself because it'll take me two jumps. Yeah, it's going to take me about the same. Well, that was uh, a very <laughs> interesting uh, moment in time. All right. Hmm. Honestly, I was not expecting... When I saw that, I have yet to see a progenitor ship. I honestly thought that was a progenitor. Yeah. I did see a progenitor ship, and that's kind of what it looked like. That's why I was like, oh, God. Do you remember that time I told you I seen a pro it says it's a progenitor? And you're all like, yeah. run. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Where did... I'm trying to backtrack. I am... See, I thought you were joking about that, and I was like, yeah, get out of there. Yeah. No, I yeah. wasn't joking. Yeah, I was like... Yeah, progenitors are not a joke. I think they're the hardest thing in the game next to Legacy. But I got to thinking it looked kind of like that. I think this is where... I... Oh, we got some trippy-ass Dead Space stuff going on, so who the hell knows? Oh, yeah. I mean, you already have the infected and a bunch of other shit. Yeah. Abominations, infested. Oh, I found a really good asteroid here. It's called... Um, Lil's gone, two erestrum, two magnesium, two titanium, looks like neodium. Good shit. Cobalt, on the way back. Oh god, firing weapons. You're firing weapons. I found another mining site class three. That's a heat signature. Another class two. That'd be something wanna... to do for tomorrow, for sure. Yeah, I want to... God, I want to bookmark this area. Just a hair from jumping all the way back. <laughs> I, I have to make a third jump. I get back to Haven, and the first thing I see is Spaceballs 1, the name. Because <laughs> I got it. It's ahead of the rest of the fleet. <laughs> Alright, yeah. It's just sitting out there all by I itself. I think that was funny to just uh, turn these lines off. It was a good laugh just to watch me jump. I'm like, Fuck. Oh, I, just... I can't do it because I got to move the leg legionnaire. Son of a bitch. Yeah. Cool. That's where I'm at right 
now, bitch. The Legionnaire? No. That's where I'm at, bitch. Oh I'm God. the Juggernaut, bitch. <laughs> Stone was supposed to move this. Yeah, he must have fell asleep on, at the wheel. Well, hopefully there's a way in. If there isn't, I'm gonna make a fucking door. Mm. Trying to figure out where the fuck. Jesus. Okay, I'm over here. Uh. There, I, I made I made a door. <laughs> I, ma I made a door. Oh my god. I don't want to take the time to find my way through the damn ship. Oh, I'm still laughing at the fact that I fucking screamed when I fucking guns. I thought it was. <laughs> Fucking, I was like, God damn it. This, when I am that fucking deep and I'm thinking it's space ghosts and all this other shit, it's like phasmophobia. It makes me jump. So I gotta say bravo to this shit. Dead Space, was, I played a little bit of Dead Space uh, at a friend's house once when they ha I had console. Um, a traitor security satellite. Okay. That shit made me jump too. It fucking even Resident Evil games. The That's earlier part ones. of the fun of the game. Though. Oh yeah, the jump scare. It's like Jesus. I, mean, I like the that, things there for a while on. Uh, he will never. They know. make you get like close on the video to see something, then then something will jump at you. <laughs> yes, I remember those. <laughs> Like, find Waldo, and next and you're looking really hard, and then suddenly it flips, and you're like, Jesus! There's still a... So zoned. There's still a smoke animation coming out of this ship of his. That's funny. I think part of it is when you're so focused on what's there, all your other senses are so focused on something, and then when you're not paying attention with your other senses... That's what gives you that jump scare. Oh, of course. Are you getting ready to land on that with your big ship? Oh, I'm going to. Yeah, I gave him a horrible, horrible idea that just might work. To get us all those long-range jump drives. Before they nerf Well, that. I think... Well, you know... Because they are nerfing that, by the way. Nerfing it? They if you do not know the rest, if you oh that all yeah, I meant yeah. I meant you can still make them. You can still do it for now, but after whenever this final release is out, yes, they're gonna. They took that out for a reason, particularly this reason. <laughs> like eh, you know whatever. Why are my shields off? Why? Why? Wow. Well, I think I'm going to end the stream there. Thank you, everybody, for watching. Thank you for the likes. Yeah. And special thanks to Chris and Miss Kentucky for stopping by and saying hello and hanging out for a little bit. And we will see you guys next time.